I will move the webcam if the webcam's in the way. If the audio is too quiet or too loud or off or whatever, we will be reviewing that. And then likewise for the actual quality of the VODs, I'll be reviewing after the first episode, after the first stream, to see if we can make it better for episodes 2, 3, 4. However long this playthrough takes, I've heard this game is fairly lengthy in terms of the amount of content, but obviously it's down to the player and how much they choose to do. We're going to try and do as much as we can, but uh, for the most part, I say we just jump in. We ready? Selecting experience, we can listen to this game in standard English dialogue, subtitled English dialogue with UK English subtitles, Samurai Cinema, Japanese dialogue with English UK subtitles, or we can play in Kurosawa mode. <laughs> wow, okay. Uh, what do you guys think? Should we go for English or should we go for Samurai sim Cinema? Uh, I have heard for this game specifically, and I don't know if this is true or not, um, because I haven't seen it with my own eyes, but from what I've heard, I've heard that the English version is a bit, uh, is, is better than the Japanese in this one experience because I've heard that the game was actually, I don't know if this is true, but I heard that the voice acting was actually the, the mouth movement, the mouth movements were sorted for the actual English version. Is that correct? Japanese dialogue is what I went with. Love this is Mikey. Sadly, I lost into, hold on, Samurai Cinema. Um, English would be preferable. I'm not entirely sure, guys. Normally, I would play in Japanese with the UK English subtitles, but I, from what I've heard, we'll try... Uh, I think we'll try standard English and see how we get on. It's going to be a lot of people who disagree with that. I'm not sure. Yeah, let's just go for it. We'll wait and see. Let me try and just... Okay. Fuck it. Let's go. Yeah, it's a tough decision, guys. I'm not sure if, uh, if I like that or not, but we'll see. Normally, obviously, when you're watching is invading our anime home. and shit, you want to watch that shit in Japanese, but not always. I don't know. They are brutal. Relentless. Well, I never put the fucking... Unstoppable. Oh, shit. There we go. We are 80 samurai. There we go. Against an army. Fighting to slow the invasion. Today, I die for my people. There must be thousands of them. We will face death and defend our home. Tradition. Courage. Honor. They are what make us. We are the warriors of Tsushima. We are samurai! Oh! Go break their spirits. Hey! Outsiders, send your finest warrior to face me. Nada, Jinida. Damn. I am Haru Nobu Adachi, descendant of the legendary Yoshi Nobu Adachi. Oh no. Holy fuck. Oh, that was a bit dishonorable. I don't think they care about honor. Samurai! Do you surrender? Cowards without honor deserve no mercy. No mercy! Straight into the action. Alright. I got a square button. Oh. 
Okay. Do you want some? One for you. One for you. Oh, there we go. I think we lost Bullseye. Time. Lord Sakai, even if it cost us our lives, as you command, Lord Shimura. I guess the game will teach me as we fight. The square, the triangles are heavy. Dude, this feels good so far. I've got L1 to block. Alright, let's Men, go. We must hunt down let's the keep the pacing leader. going. We'll talk about Everyone, all this stuff in a minute, guys. Me. Again, I'll adjust my webcam and stuff if we need to, but let's More just play the game for a minute. Gone. Let's get immersed. What's up, bitch? No honor. Okay. Fairly straightforward. I don't even know how the bad guys are. Blue one. Want some? Fuck off. Dude, I feel like a fucking Jedi right now. We've got minimal resistance from the first enemies that we encounter. Okay, here we go. Got a nice little dodge off. Dude, I like the music, it is very Sekiro. I guess when the uh I guess when there's like a you knock them back and then you've got a killing blow opportunity. You can hold triangle as well. Dude, we lost all of our men! Maybe I was a shit warrior there. I thought we were doing alright. There is only one path for us. Find the Mongol leader and end him here. I'll fight beside you to the end. I know. How's the audio, guys? Is it too too loud, too quiet? You guys good? Give me some updates as we go. We can tweak it. I got one dodge off, felt kind of clean, but we did get stabbed in the back. There, the Mongol leader. I'm ready. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, a bit loud, but it is a battle scene, yeah. I'll, take, I'll tweak it just the, the, the tiniest of nodes. It's always the same in these games when the characters are having a quiet conversation. Uh, it's really quiet and then, you know, as soon as the action starts, it's like, fuck it, I'll make it calm down. I'm trying to find a balance, it's gonna be... Oh, fuck. Dude, he's got two arrows in his bag, man. Boromir, is that you? Jonathan. Here he is. I am Kotan, cousin of Kublai, grandson of Genghis. Sharpening your sword. Do you know how I prepared for today? You see the bit of sweat running in. I learned. 
I know your language, your traditions, your beliefs, which villages to tame and which to burn. So I'll ask you once again, Samurai, do you surrender? So that's a no. RIP, Uncle. Damn. That was a, mo a lot of monologuing for a guy who was going to stab. But then I guess if the guy surrendered, I guess it would have been worth But would he have stabbed him anyway? I don't know. So we've got the grandson of Genghis Khan, the Mongol invasions, coming into Japan, I guess. Again, I haven't looked too much into the premise of this game, but we'll figure it out as we go. I'm pretty sure that's how it... I'm pretty sure that is the setting. The, get the combat, uh, even just the, the first, like, 10 seconds feels pretty fun. Feels weighted, you know? Feels like your stabs actually mean something. We didn't get a lot of resistance, although I guess that battle was the tutorial battle. That is a cinematic experience that's meant to go fairly smoothly. Should Jack grow a beard like that? Do you think so, guys? It would be bright orange. I don't know if that would be as classy as some of these uh, elegant samurai gents. Somehow we made it. Even though we've been shot How in the back. Get here? How did I get here? Looks like somebody's been taking care of us actually. We got a bucket of what looks like blood and rags. What's this? No weapons, just supplies. That's a huge carrot, holy fuck. Alright. Um Someone worked hard to keep me alive. Yeah, looks like we've been to keep moving. We've been salvaged. Is this our introduction to stealth by any chance? Mongols. Okay, let's get involved. Are we jumping down or? Can I jump down here? I think I have to. Do I have to wait. Looks like they're. Uh... Are these people fighting back against the Mongols? Um, shit. There's a quickly, quite clearly, a definitive walkway that I'm supposed to track. My bad. Someone I thought something was happening there. Hit me back here. Excuse me. They have my sword. Okay. Search for your katana and do not raise the alarm. Okay. Can I literally stealth this? Okay. Um. Looks like we're going in here. Can I stealth these guys or? Oh, I guess I'm not supposed to yet. We're going non-lethal, for the time being. I think. All right. Not raise the alarm and search for your katana. Someone was sharpening their blade. A warrior. Let me take care of you, John. My armor. Are we going this way? Put on your armor. Wait, was my armor here? Did why do I feel lost? Aha. Uh -huh. Here we go. Ready for combat. Broken. But better than nothing. <laughs> we look like we're going to make a fucking pastry. Never mind going to war. Although, if I look this fucking epic when going to make a pastry, I don't know. Uh, leave the house and continue your search. Are we going this way? Yeah. Alright. Halfway there. Now we just need the stabby tool. Oh. Oh, hello. How are your wounds? Can you run? I... I think so. Where's my sword? Not here. You're all here. Uh oh. I'll take care of this. Please hide. I'm putting on some clothes. I'm just coming. Oh, oh, oh hi. Don't hurt me. 
Just to make sure, keep going. One more for good luck. All right, he's dead. Who are you? I'm Yuna. Hey, Yuna. You want your sword? Follow me. I'm ready to stick people with a pointy end. Long enough for the Mongols to conquer half the island. Okay. Game feels like it's running pretty smoothly. Forward and X to jump through the window. Alright. I can crouch with R3. Okay. So we're literally just following you know one step at a time here, right? Oh fuck. Okay, okay. Oh I hope you didn't like her. But I can save the others. Ninja clan, here I stand. Lord Shimura was with me on the battlefield. Uh, what does it say? R2? Sorry, the subtitles were hiding out there. Okay. Fine. You know, wait. Lord Shimura is my uncle. He did. You're Jin Sakai? The Jito's nephew? That's me. I have to know. Did he survive? I think so. The Mongols took him prisoner. Where did they take him? East, along the coast. Toward Castle Canada. They must be holding him inside, celebrating their victory. I could take them by surprise. You'll be killed. Or I'll rescue Lord Shimura. Then help him drive the Mongols into the sea. He can contact the Shogun, call for reinforcements. I didn't nurse you back to health to watch you throw your life away. Why did you save me? I couldn't leave you to die. I need your help. Lord Shimura can help our whole island. And he's the only family I have left. Let's move. Hokai? I want a mug saying listen guys though. Maybe one day. Listen, guys. Did I say that that often? Oh no. Oh not Joseph. Oof. Suddenly liking this game a little bit more than I did a minute ago. <clears throat> oh, stay down. Stay low chat. Don't 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 give it don't give the game away. Look out. Raiders. Armed for battle. They've been riding across the island. I'm ready. Taking slaves, killing the weak. Through here. Okay. You know, teach me. Oh God. You know, I'm just staying extremely close right now because I'm scared. Okay, Oof. don't worry about it. It's nothing, nothing personal. Okay. Sensitivity feels a little oh god. Shit. We cleared the road. If we cross, someone's bound to see us. Mm. I'll take that chance. Wait. The cart. Ah, oh, the cart is our way out. No. Oh, 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 I'm ready, I'm ready. Come on. I'm ready. Don't leave me behind, you know. I feel like Yuna's a little bit slower than me. So I can actually oh, God. We'll take the rooftops. What? You know. You climb roofs, scavenge battlefields. Yeah, what? You're a thief. When I need something, I take it. Like my katana. I traded it for food and medicine. You what? Don't worry. We'll find the buyer. Get your sword back. Okay. Oh, I ripped that guy. That was a bit. Uh... Ooh, supplies. This is someone's house. I think there's a lot of that going on in this game, right? Where you can like scavenge things, right? 
I like how he's like, this is someone's house, we can't take these. And she's like, mate, shut up. I'm like, say no more, Yuna. Give me the whole nine. So I don't know if the supplies are used later to like trade for gold, trade for like armor, trade for weapons, trade for like resources. I'm not I'm not sure. Okay. Why would these little flaps exist? Would they exist? Is that for letting your dog in and out? <laughs> little cat flap? Stand watch. Oh. I'll search the house. All right, people. It must be here. Okay. Supplies. Just genetic supplies, by the way. It could be some snack rolls. It could be uh, could be some cheese. Here's my sword. Sword, please. Sword. Oh, I'm ready. Oh yeah. Oh, young baby. Jin Sakai. Young baby Jin. Nephew to the great Lord Shimura. And I am no coward! It's the coal shoot. Your enemy is no match for you. What do you know about coal shoots, Sereni? But you still lack control. I was practicing. With your father's weapon? The sword of Clan Sakai has saved lives and ended wars. Who did this to you? No one. I fell. I will teach you to defend yourself. I know how to fight. To master your blade, you must first control your emotions. My emotions, of course. I can do that. Uncle. Show me. Oh, are we getting taught? Old school by okay, I'm ready. Is this guy gonna kick my fucking ass? Oh uncle, go easy on me, yeah. I'm just wee. I'm just small. Let's see what you've been practicing. Oh fuck, uncle. Try to strike me. No 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 yes, uncle. Okay, square quick attack, heavy attack, and triangle to do a stab attack. Let's start with quickie quickie. I'm ready. One, two. Oh, Uncle, do God damn it. Uncle's got moves. Try to strike me. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, I see his posture. There's it there. It's broken. It is your turn to attack, Jin. Oh, the stab attacks. Okay. Well done. If you'd fought like that, your attacker would not have bruised you so easily. It wasn't a fair fight. Imagine he's returned to finish what he started, and he'll use every dirty trick he knows. How will you defend yourself? Uh, lure him? He's big, but I'm quicker. I'll stay out of his reach. Wait for him to get tired, then drop him with one strike. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Samurai must always fight with patience and discipline, even when his opponent resorts to trickery. I'll remember, uncle. Now, break through my defenses. Oh, I'm ready. Show me. I feel like I need a lock on. Is there, is there like a lock courage. on? I feel like I'm I'm needing a... Where's the... Is there like a lock button? No. Tap break to break block, defense and stagger attack. enemy. Then strike quickly. Okay, so we break the block. And then... Dude, he fell outside the Maybe ring, the surely. Will unbalance your foe. Follow with a quick strike. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. So triangle, triangle, and then boom. Got it. Enough! <laughs> I yield. What's you let me win? Not at all. If you held a real sword, I would be dead. Really? I would never lie to you, Jin. Did how many leaves I are on this tree? Try to block my attacks. Okay. I will not go easy on this. One. A fine block. Yeah, yeah, you like that? You like that, Uncle? I've been training. I'm sore. Can we take a break? What? We're not finished yet. We just started. Find your resolve and fight through the pain. Oh, I see my health bar in the bottom left. It's very small and it's hard to see on the leaves, but it is there. Press down to heal. Good. Draw on your resolve. Mm -hmm. This is your health. I see it. This is your resolve meter. Draw on your resolve to heal and perform other special abilities. So you've got three of those to begin with. Uh, gaining resolve by killing enemies, parrying attacks, or using other advanced skills. Sounds good. 
All right. It's time you learn to parry. Oh god. Wait for me to make the first move. I'm ready. Once I strike, block my attack. Oh. Fine, parry. You must parry before I strike. Okay, that was shit. All right, I'm ready. All right, not bad. You like that? Good form, Jin. Yeah, good form. You're improving. You should see what else I can do, Uncle. You need to catch your breath. <laughs> It would take more than a child. Wait till I hit you with a fucking bank eye. Hey Jolly, okay. what's up? Let's see you defend against a spear. Jolly, welcome, welcome. Dodge my spear, then follow up with Suck a counter. Left. Okay. Good reflexes. Ooh. Excellent counter. I'm ready. Excellent too slow. Dodge. Too slow, Uncle. Dodge. Too, too slow, too slow. <laughs> Come on, one more. Can I go? But can I go? Oh yeah, you can go any way you want. Can you dodge? Oh, I wonder if you can block forward. You see. There is no Bleach pepe hands. No warrior, you cannot overcome. Thank you for these lessons. Wait till I hit him with the fucking heat in Mitsurugi. Jin Sakai. Anybody get that reference? Me with a match. I wouldn't want to hurt you. If you're that confident, let's make this interesting. The first to land five strikes gets to choose dinner. Easy. I hope you like octopus. <laughs> Come on then, Uncle. Very good, Jin. <laughs> well struck, Uncle. One, two. That's your great skill. Oh. You're too fast. Whew, that was close. He nearly beat me. Finding the uh, the opportunity to block. Before we eat, I have one last. It's quite question. quick. For generations, our families have lived by a code. Yep. Tell me the virtues that guide us. Uh, hung dongs. Loyalty to our lord. Uh -huh. Control of our emotions. Yep. And lack of salt. You know this. Big mountains of salt. Honor. Oh. To fight bravely and uphold the legacy of Clan Sakai. Well done, Silas. You get extra points. Those are your father's words. What does honor mean to you? To not baby rage when I'm and sad. Protecting people. To not get flamed at the chat. The ones who can't fight for themselves. And that also. You have a good heart. But first, we must show everyone that we serve our Lord with courage, integrity, and self-control. Mm -hmm. You say that like it's easy. It's never easy, Jin. I struggle with it every day. Mild constipation. But we must set an example for our people. Oh, okay, yeah. By remaining true to our code. Oh, the code, yeah, sorry. I thought you were talking about some And else. to ourselves. That is the meaning of honor. All right, yeah. There you go, chat. You've been keeping. keeping. Oh. I'm not her samurai. Wait, we gave up the fucking opportunity of attack. He's got a spear, I can dodge that. Sekiro! See this? I'm gonna stab you with this, mate. Woo! Come on, bitch! I've been training with my uncle, you just don't fucking know it. Oh, fucking rip that guy. Oh, next. You found your sword. You know you got a Where can I find a horse? The stable's on far. This way. Dude, that guy got fucking shredded. Hold on. You know, I got um I gotta fulfill the ways of honor, you know. There you go. Now we can move on. I'm ready. For stealing my sword, obviously. Even though I never stole it. Right, <clears throat> I'm ready. Where are we going? You know, are we technically still in enemy territory? Yeah, mm-hmm. Riders. Islands crawling with them. Where are the stables? Behind that building. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Me. You know, me and you together. We can take on any any enemies with you at my side. Look at the size of that bow, man. Get close. Slit their throats and kill them without a sound. Without honor. I will not break my code. Fuck off the fuck the code. Fuck the code. You know, you got a boyfriend? Cute boyfriend. Face me, invader! Oh god. Mistakes! Uh, L to target enemies with your sword attacks. Okay, yeah, okay, this guy can get it. Oh, he didn't expect it. Target the pulsing enemy and attack. 
Fucking yeet. That's close. We can't oh, yeah. save everyone. I'm done running, and I can finally help. Damn it. Okay, what's happening? Help whoever's in trouble. Who's in trouble? Are there people here, or...? Wait, I can put the candle with my sword. Who's in trouble? Is somebody up here? Oh, okay. I'm here to uphold the code. Don't let anyone escape. Ready? Do that. Okay, come on then. Come on then, bitch. Okay. Just testing some things. Fancy footwork. Testing the dukes. Thank you, my lord. Gotta learn to respect the dukes, champ. They said all the samurai were dead. That's a baby. Or a big, you have somewhere to big hide. portion of rice. I heard Golden Temple might be safe. Wait, is that a PS5? Go. Stay off the roads. And guard your son with your life. Oh, it's a baby. Oh well, it may still be a PS5, technically. You risked your life for them. They couldn't defend themselves. Night. Can't let more of our people die. When did we get two swords? They're not the only ones who need you. My brother. The Mongols took him. That's why you saved me. Taka is my only family. And Lord Shimura is mine. Please. I just want my brother back. I'll help you find him after I save my uncle. Mm. I promise. I'm coming with you. Okay. Stables are just up ahead. I'm ready. Wait. Oh, here we go. I got this. Oh. Okay. Let's practice. Let's practice in parties. Oh. Let's get to the horse. Wait, did you kill the third guy? Damn. Okay. Sure. I'm ready. Uh, ooh, one that one. This one. This one speaks to me. Okay, no, actually, I don't think I hit. I don't think it likes me. Speak with you now. Oh, okay. They're samurai horses. The few we didn't take into battle. That's Lucky for them. Personal space, you know. And us. Which horse do you want? Pandemic. I know what one I want. I want the black one. The black horse will be with you for the entire journey. Let me have a look. Oh, I mean the white one's pretty cool, but nah, dude, this one. I'm gonna be the fucking the rider of death. Suits you. And he needs a name. Oh, Nobu for trust, Sora the Sky or Kage Shadow. Oh, dude, I think trust is pretty important. I like Nobu, Nobu Matsu. Sora's to Kingdom Hearts, and Kage just makes me think of Naruto. Nobu. Nobu, a trusty companion. Trust is important in a relationship, even between man and horse. If this fucker runs away from me when I'm fucking dying on the battlefield, I swear. Uh, you've chosen the name of your horse Nobu. This will be your companion's name for your entire journey. abso fucking lately. Let's go. Hey, move. What's up, man? How are we liking things so far? Well, it's early days sushi, but everything looks good. Feels good. We opted into the English uh, subtitles instead of Japanese based on what we were talking about the other day, so thanks for that. Ghost of Tsushima, let's go. Alright, we traveling boys. We're going east. Castle Canada. It's like Canada, but in Japan. Just kidding. Castle Canada. They're holding your uncle inside. Mm. We got a rainy season. Okay, I approached the castle with Yuna. Yuna's came a long way with me. She seems like a cool the walls are too high to climb. We could cause a distraction. Sneak in. No. We walk in the front gate. Kotun Khan set fire to our best swordsmen. Humiliated my uncle. Butchered the warriors of Tsushima. I'm going to repay his kindness. Are you repeating the same mistakes that got your friends killed. That's what the Mongols will think. But this time, I'll strike first. I hope you're right. Dude, I Wait feel like we've got a... Yuna's trying to warn us, and we've obviously got the honor code, and uh, I wonder if it's going to get us... Gonna get us in trouble. Challenge the Mongols to a standoff. 
Standoffs. When approaching enemy territory, you can challenge foes to a standoff. Once your enemy approaches, hold triangle. As soon as they attack, release triangle to defeat them in one deadly strike. Um, as soon as they attack, release triangle. Okay. Isn't this what our friend did in the tutorial? Like, in the in the cutscene? I've come for Lord Shimura. How does this work? Let me practice this. As soon as they attack. Good night, son. Yeah, you want some? Oh. oh. Oh, dude, yes, let's go. Don't sound surprised. In suffering. Oh, sorry, mate. What's all that noise? Not sure. The Mongols fired them off at the beach. They're fighting. Oh. Oh, he hit me back. You know, I'm coming to save you. With a back attack. Oh my god, you had it under control, never mind. Let's uh, take a health here. Let's take another health, actually. Oh god. So I need to get parries to... If I want to fill it back up, I need parries and, and kills. Interesting. Is there any actual stuff I can collect from here? Maybe I can get more resolve or something? We got hit a little bit there. Okay, okay, okay. I got it. We gotta be more careful. All right. Interesting. Oh God. Let's go, mate. Okay. Dude, I've got this guy. I got him. I got him. I got him. I got. Did you know? An actual useful going. companion. I have to fall back. Alone? Keep the path clear. When I find Lord Shimura, we'll need a quick escape. Wait for me. I'll get the horses ready. Do it. If I'm not back soon, ride for the forest. Barker, what's up, dude? You're gonna marry me. Oh my god, dude. Sometimes I do feel like I wish I had a lock on, you know that? Like. It feels like sometimes you're turning your back on the enemies a little bit, and I don't know if I can avoid that. Oh. Shit. Oh, I died. Oh, fuck. I'm alive! Hey, stop it! Oh, no. Mercy. Okay. I was trying to um, deflect more so I could build resolve, but I ended up just dying. Okay. Let's try again. Alright. Not bad. I gotta be quicker. I gotta be quicker at blocking and dodging. Kinda want the spear guy. You see how he's like, you see how he's like, attacking the wrong way? Okay, it's gonna take me a while to get used to this, but we're getting there. Alright. I'm ready. Yeah, I'm just really not expecting how quickly they come at you. Mate. I gotta be more like quicker. I gotta be faster. Dodging arrows. Before fighting arrows, Mongol archers call it and signal their allies to duck. Uh, how do I duck? Is it gonna tell me? Okay. 
Okay. We're barely able to survive here, which is a bit strenuous. I wonder if we're gonna do another call out here. Can I do anything up here? Maybe I can get some HP back or something? Or is this purely just to have a look? Oh, maybe I can do a standoff here. There's bad guys coming. Standoff? Let me challenge these boys. Hey! <laughs> hey, what's up, guy? Okay, let's go. I should have healed before I killed the last guy. Show him his nephew, broken and humiliated, begging to join the Mongol Empire. <laughs> this is your time, Lord Sakai. He hit me with a double combo. Enough. Is that it? You just kick my ass? Oh no. Show your uncle how easily he can bring peace to your home. Mercy, mate, mercy. Save yourself. Oh! I'm glad, I'm glad that was a scripted event where we're supposed to get our ass kicked. But he fucking demolished me with two hits. Again. Father. Oh no. Jin. Help me. What? That's not what the anime dad's supposed to say. Oh no. Oh no, he's gonna watch as his dad dies. Oh, you hate to see it. Feels disgraced. Lord Sakai. <laughs> All right, so we're saving. Your master, it's time. I'm coming, Yuriko. <coughs> Yuriko, father. The whole island has come to mourn your father. No, God. Can't you send them away? You must face them. No, I don't want to. You are now the master of Clan Sakai. I don't want to, yes. Granny. You're not alone, Jin. I am alone. Your father is the wind at your back. I let my father die. Your mother. Oh, these jugs. In the trees. 
and uncle. He will tell you at your father's fire. Oh, look how nice it is. Beautiful. Oh, look how nice it is, though. Oh, that lighting. Okay. Oh, they got little candles in the pond. Do we even have to leave? Can we not just stay here? We could just call this cozy den of uh, Tsushima and live here. You could be my wife and... Okay, maybe not, but, um, you know, I'll talk later. Oh, shit. If you ever need guidance, Clan Adachi will help you. Adachi, yeah. I'm pretty sure the Adachi are a clan in Shogun too, I think. If you guys have ever played the Total War games, I think they are. The Adachi clan rings a bell. Oh, dude. All these people giving respect. Your father protected the people above all else. A true samurai. Ishikawa. Personal spaceman. It's okay. They're there. Listen. It's okay. Shh. Don't worry. Listen, it's alright. Now I'm the boss. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm the king. I'm just kidding. That was insensitive. My dad's just passed away. Anyways. <clears throat> I'm also mourning. Oh, God. It's time. I couldn't save him. I was a coward. Jin. You are a samurai. He died because of me. Oh, God. Your father fell in battle saving his only son. His reward is a warrior's death. That's fair. Now you will carry on his legacy. Your father's spirit resides within his blade. Will he see me if I go for a poo with it? I mean, what? He's always with you. Oh, Even in the hot springs. Sorry, we're making this weird. Tomorrow, you will come to my fortress. As my wall. Yep, looking forward to that. Stay. Sleepovers. Say goodbye to your father. Okay. Okay. Looks like we survived again. How does this keep happening? Being blown up by a firework, shot by two arrows, stabbed a couple of times, then thrown off a bridge. Still got all of our limbs working though. Wait, where's my horse? Father. How do I save? The winds of change. Oh, dude, is this Genshin Impact? We starting on the beach? Follow the wind. Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? Dude, okay, so we're left broken. One sword, no horse, no waifu. Fucked up. Parting a little bit, definitely needed some ibuprofen. But we're following the motherfucking wind. Dude, look. Look how nice it is. Mm. Smell it, just sniff it, chat. Sniff that ancient feudal air. Oh boy, I'm going out into the woods. Is that where the wind's pointing me? I can't see the wind anymore, it's run away. I was too slow. Is that Nobu? You know? You know? You know, you're here? How did they know? 
Jin. I'm, I'm fine. What happened? I got punched off a bridge. I found Lord Shimura. I could have saved him. But the Khan was there. The dickhead. I failed my uncle. At least you're in one piece. One piece. I swore to protect this island with my life. But now the Mongols have stolen our home. Killed our samurai. You forgot what it's like to fight someone stronger than you. To feel weak. Sometimes when you're staring death in the face, you have to do whatever it takes to survive. The Khan expects to fight a war against the samurai. He will anticipate our every move. Unless we find new ways to surprise him. That's how we'll save Lord Shimura. And retake our home. You'll need some help. Riders. The Khan's attack dogs. There's too many of them. Hide in the grass. Oh. Riders of the storm. I'm gonna push you now. Take her. Hide in the pampas grass. Oh, Yuna, shh, shh. Give me that, give me that. Achoo. Yuna. Chat, do you ever consider yourself to be pampas grass? Do you ever smoke the pampas grass? Must be searching for you. Don't answer that. Oh, the winds! What way is the wind? Is where's the wind blowing? You know, you know, I'm ready. Sorry. sorry. Bastard scared off the horses. They're samurai mounts, trained to return to their masters. No will call. Watch this. <whistles> there he is, dude. Nice trick. The Mongols must be hunting you. We should split up. I'll draw their attention while you escape. I'm not leaving your side until we've saved my brother. First, I need to find more allies. Trained warriors. Like Sensei Ishikawa and Lady Masawadachi. Yes. They can help. Yo, Daz, what's up? Too. Once we save him, you'll have the island's best blacksmith in your debt. He'll make whatever tool you need to save your uncle. Something to scale the castle walls. You dream it, Taka can make it. Oof. Where are they holding him? He was captured near Ketchi. Right there and ask around. I'll join you soon. Taka won't last long in the Mongol cage. You know. I am a Mongol cage. You will save your brother. And your uncle. And my axe. Okay. I'm ready. You know, I love you. Be safe. Phone me, please. Okay. Let's go. Good so far, boys. I'm liking it. Very cool. Very cool. Okay, exploring Tsushima map and journal now available with the options button. Let's go ahead and slow Nobu here. Tsushima Island. You can't just say the, the English words, you know, you have to say the Japanese words, Japanese. Explore Tsushima to discover new locations. Okay, this is this is a tale. Uh, Jin's Journey, The Warrior's Code. Complete tiles to build your legend and acquire new resources and abilities. Okay, assassination reward. Focus hearing major uh, legend increase. Okay. Yuna is searching for her brother. We need to help her. Um, searching for her brother, a blacksmith named Taka. Okay, The Broken Samurai. As your legend grows, you'll learn powerful new techniques. 
Okay. So the closest one we have is uh, this one here, Jin's Journey. Um, and then the other one is The Tale of Sensei Ishikawa. Okay, that's one of the nine. We've got some other stuff as well in between, I guess. Ooh, do we go do this one first? Show and journal. I guess we just track it. We probably want some of these early rewards, I think. The warrior's code. So the wind is going to guide me, is it? Follow the guiding wind to track uh, to your tracked objective. Swipe up. Uh, swipe. What was that? Oh, so that actually activates the wind. Mongol territory. So this is my like my GPS system, right? The wind pointing is like a cool idea. It's not exactly super clear though. Or, like, are we going past this? Should I be should I be getting involved with this or? Oh, I can hear her. She's to my left. Maybe I should be actually running in on my horse. I was trying to um trying to go faster on my horse, how did I do that? X is to jump off. That's to dismount. How do I go fast? Oh, there we go. Just trying to come to grips with the, the, the navigation. Is it actually telling me to go this way? Alright, here we go. Here she is. Jin, you found me. So we can go straight into this if we want. I guess we just start doing some of these early quests to kind of get started. Get some perks, get some techniques, get some XP. And then we'll learn all the other stuff later. I don't think I want to go off the beaten path immediately. Because normally in these kind of games, the early levels actually give you some important stuff. So let's talk to Yuna. She'll guide us for the time being. You handle that well. I should have heard him coming. Let myself get distracted. These people saw Mongols marching prisoners up river. They had a blacksmith with them. Mm. Your brother. Sounds like it. On PS4, they were yeah. Taking him to a camp near the Canada Inlet. I know the place. The PS4 is over to the left. It's fairly quiet but I've got my headphones on so it's kind of hard to tell um I'll let you guys know if it takes off <laughs> okay Did you find any samurai to free your uncle not yet but I'm still searching I'm sure you'll find someone soon okay wow that's some noisy thunder okay so where are we going Haka can help you after we save him hard to believe I might see him soon he's lucky to have you you might disagree. That's what siblings are for. I guess I'm you? going the right way. Any brothers or sisters? Lord Shimura is my only family. What will you do when he's free? I can see the breath. counter at the top left getting smaller, is but other than that, I have no guidance as to whether I'm going the right way or not. I feel that strongly. I've watched him win victory against impossible odds. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to think about it. You're riding well. How are you? Hey, Anthony, what's up, man? Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? I suppose you're right. I don't know if I could have jumped over that. My uncle taught me that a samurai masters his emotions, like you master a horse or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. You can climb up there, like. Interesting. How do I slow my horse down? Do I just... I pull back, okay. Yeah, I, I get that the wind is like the GPS. It's just a little bit... Um, see, like, what is the point of this? I kind of want to have a look. Let me just have a little peek, guys. Okay. Okay, that's how I get back down. Okay, okay. So what would be the point of something like this? Is this just like a... Can I jump across? Okay, okay. Cool, I guess. And my horse just spawns up here, that's pretty cool. Can I drive my horse off the cliff though? I guess... Hopefully not. 
Return to the area 14. Wait a minute. God. Woo! That's how that works then, okay. Well, at least I now know that the, f the gravity system works <laughs> flawlessly. <laughs> Did you find any samurai to free your uncle? Oh, for fuck's sake, you're kidding me, you know? I'm still searching. I'm sure you'll find some Christ. Food. Okay, my bad, guys. Trying to get to grips with how some of the mechanics works. We'll, we'll get there. Okay. Taka can help you after we save him. Game looks really, really nice. It looks really, really nice. He's lucky to have you. I feel like, see here, like, I know it's an open world game and maybe they're trying to keep the HUD as minimalistic as possible so that it feels immersive, but I really feel a bit kind of lost. I, I mean, I follow the path, right, and then every time you flick the touchpad you get this kind of notification top left, but I kind of like when games have like a little marker that tells me exactly where we're going. Like, I've just run through this fucking village. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to I've got the winds in the background kind of like faintly showing me where to go, but... Not sure. Oh, your wounds. Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? <laughs> I suppose you're right. Reaching overlook, so yeah. Samurai masters We're supposed to be going up high. Like you master a horse. Or a blade. Or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. It would be cool playing this on lethal if you got good enough, I think. Um, I think we're a bit far away from that. We're not exactly uh, close to perfection yet, but maybe when we get the timing down. I think the, the hardest thing to gauge in this game is sometimes you can actually go aggressive early, and if the enemy doesn't respond, you get the free kill straight away, easy peasy. But see if you if you uh, go in too eagerly, then sometimes they obviously hit you back before you connect and you get interrupted. So it's going to be about gauging which enemies are aggressive and which ones aren't and then i don't even know how that like is calculated by There's the computer a spot up so. ahead that overlooks the river should give us a good view of the mongol camp what is the wind telling me to go down here or see what does this mean does that mean that it's blowing i guess it's blowing this way that that rock up ahead is probably what we're getting, we're aiming for i guess I guess is this it? Hey, no. Over here. So uh, whatever the wind kind of blows with you, and if you're going in the same direction as the wind, then you're fine. Yeah. Okay. And then you eventually do get a marker if you're close. That's not bad. That's not bad. The Tough to get inside. The Mongols threw that place together in days. There has to be a way out. Oh, the heart. Let's look. <laughs> oh, I see it. Survey the Mongo. I guess that's over there. Oh god, sorry. I gotta be down here at the small. We need to reach Taka without putting him in danger. We'll find a safe approach. So we've got. We can go high or we can go by the rocks. Is that as in go up and round and come in from the top? We could scale the rocks on that side. If they're loose, they might give way. Alert the guards. Okay, what about this one? Defenses and back are formidable. Okay. The front wall there is still under construction. That's our could be a way that in. could be our weak spot. Alright, cool. We can look for a gap in the front wall. Oh, <laughs> thanks, you know. Slip inside. Genius. <laughs> and cut down the Mongols where they stand. If something goes wrong, I thought it was actually allowing us to pick our business. entry point there. I've seen them do it. We have to go in quietly. Okay. Like thieves. Oh god. What's wrong with that? Before the samurai, this island was ruled but by criminals. the spider, hello? We changed that by creating order and delivering justice in the open. We live by a code of honor. And sometimes we die by it. Warriors like my father, who just wanted to give us a safer home. I want the same thing. But we have to fight back. I promised my uncle I'd never break our code. Then bend it. To save my family. And what's left of yours. Let's get a closer look. See what we're up against. We should wait until it gets darker. Okay. 
Looks like we're going in. Let's move. Hey, Sign, what's up? Welcome back as well. Uh, Anthony asks, is this on console or Master Race? This, um, for the time being, guys, until our graphics card arrives, we're probably going to be playing a lot of our kind of intense games on the console, but as soon as we get our GPU, Taka. He's been through a lot. we can consider he's playing on PC. But you took care of him. Someone had to. He hated when I stole. But the, but the console Taka. seems to be running Stop. it very smoothly for the didn't time being, which is nice. I didn't choose to be a samurai either. But going against my instincts... My call. It's better than getting wiped out by the Mongols. We have to fight back. Any way we can. <clears throat> okay, so here we go. I guess this is our, probably going to be our introduction to more stealth stuff. We can't go up the rocks. But it looks like we've got a weak spot here for breaking in. So we're going in our first Mongol camp. We got to uh, here. save the brother, the blacksmith. GPU has been on the, and the, we've been waiting on the GPU in the queue, guys, for about like they see us, four or five months now. Then we better stay quiet. Probably longer, actually. Probably closer to six six months. Oh, Jin's turning to the dark side of the force. Stab the Mongol in the back. Sorry, sir. not how it normally goes in video games. Oh, Jin's gonna remember that one. I liked how when you stabbed the guy in the, in the throat he actually screamed, like he cried out, because there's so many games where you just, you know, stab the guy and that's it, body drops. Oh, okay, more tutorials with uh, with our uncle here. What we hunting deer? What do you think, Jin? But there's running with a limp. Your arrow wounded him. This is when a beast is most dangerous. Remain alert. Yes, uncle. Keep after him. Follow the bear tracks with I your don't uncle. I think bears lived here. They don't. But the fighting in Yarikawa drove some this way. So it's the rebels' fault. We should feed them to this bear as punishment. We are not barbarians, Jin. Oh well, how about that? Bear tracks are still here. Looks like little bear. Little bear paws. Where did it go now? Okay. Sure. Guess we're just following the path. The bear stumbled here. Is it dying? I feel like I'm playing the Witcher. No. But we're getting closer. Okay. Uncle, you told me to be alert and yet here you are just running about like you don't give a fuck. Uncle, are you gonna pretend like you're trying to take cover or what? Stay ready, Jin. I'm so. Yes, uncle. If it's still alive, can I take the shot? Prove you can control your emotions. Then, perhaps. Mm, we've got young, young Jim. Eager Jin, not the reserved, humble Jin that we know today. He's fucking sweating for a kill. Never. We could still be alive. Oh. That looks like a... Oh, yeah. This arrow should not have killed him. What's happened to him? Oh, something bigger has attacked him? He's... Look, Uncle. He's been disembowelled. There's a gash in his side. Not from an arrow. Uh-oh. An assassin! From Yarikawa! Traitor! You would stab the stone in the back! Rosakai! Control yourself. We are not criminals, like this man here. We are samurai. He tried to kill you. He must answer for this crime with his life. <laughs> Jen, eager McBeaver. And look him in the eye. And teach him that samurai never acts out of anger or fear. And take his life with honor. Oh no. What if the guy just... Oh, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. Does Jin care? When we fight, we face our enemy head on. 
And when we take their life, we look them in the eye with courage and respect. This is what makes us samurai. Only cowards strike from the shadows. Awkward. It's kind of what we did in the future. So this is why Jin is so, um, he's so, like, resistant to the idea of the stealth kills. I kind of like that, I kind of feel like young Jin was kind of getting off and stabbing the guy, that was a bit weird. I feel like he enjoyed that a bit too much. Jin. What's wrong? Let's find your brother. Can't let them see us. Use all your senses. Think and move like a thief. Like a thief. Okay, here we go. Focused heating. Press the touchpad to f use focused heating. Revealing nearby enemy positions while slowing your movement. Okay. Alright, got it. Fuck you, Dolphin! Good night. Next up, horseman. Okay. What do we do with these guys? Okay. I think we move on. There's no one else, is there? Oh, there's guys over there, actually. We should probably deal with this guy that, before he turns around. Just in case, you know? Just in case. Sorry, mate. Probably didn't have to kill this guy, but, you know. Better to be safe than sorry. So, where are we going now? Is there another guy? There is. This guy's back to us. Night, night. Ooh, yikes. What we got here? Is this a prisoner? Okay. Give me that shit. What's happening in here? Are you dead? I think he's dead. You know, is that? No. Not Taka. Not the brother. Oh, good. Okay, we got a guy in the tent. Is there a back way in? Aha. Uh -huh. Coming through. Taking all this shit. Oh. Goodies. 24 supplies. Records. One of 40. Tons and tons of stuff. I don't know what the supplies are used for yet, but we'll figure that out in due course. There. A prisoner. Taka. Let's find out. No. It's not Taka. Should have been more careful. These guys are these guys are just chilling, dude. I guess we let this guy free, maybe. How'd you get in here? We need to go. We'll talk when it's safe. Come on. That guy's hat looks like it's seen better days. Is this guy gonna fight with us, or is he just literally an, like Let's a refugee? We'll be safe there. Okay, up we go. He looks like he might be a friend, but I don't know if he's like. Are you with the straw hat, Ronin? I was. Cut ties with them after they started running low on rations. Lord Shimmer has been captured, and I could use some extra souls to free him. Are you looking for work? No. But the other straw hats may be. Last I heard, they were hunting Mongols in Tsitsu Prefecture, by the coast near the Kishi grasslands. Dude, who is that dude? That guy sounds so familiar. That guy's voice sounds so familiar. Flowers. So we can give to Unilayer. I mean, what? Are we, uh, I guess the brother's not here, so we're leaving again. We attacked the fort, stealthily killed everybody, and now we're just getting the hell out. This way. Alright. We're looking for my brother, a blacksmith named Taka. Don't know him. 
But a lot of prisoners move through here. This guy's gonna help us. Okay. You said they were moving the slaves. Where? They mentioned Asimov Bay. And there was a blacksmith in the last group. Young man with a beard. Uh, Lolast. Uh, Lolatch. You better be right. Sixty-nine, sixty-nine. I hope you Welcome, find man. Where can you buy this game? Um, on PC? I'm not sure. I think you guys are saying this is a PS exclusive. Is this game a PS exclusive? Surrounded by walls. Rushing in without a plan will only put him in more danger. Maybe it'll come to PC at some point. I have a friend who might be able to get us inside. Find him. The sooner we rescue Tucker, the sooner we save my uncle. Okay. Jin. Tucker will forge whatever tool you need as soon as he's free. Like a rolling pin? But after that, we're leaving the island. Oh. You've seen what the Mongols are doing here. I pay you. Lord Shimura can stop them. Stay. Help us fight for our home. Home is wherever Taka and I go. My friend lives in Asmo Prefecture, on the border with Tsutsu. I'll find you there. I know this wasn't easy. Going against your code. I did what I had to. Oof. <laughs> you know. <Thank> you. <gasps> Arigato. Goodbye, Yuna. Love you. Back at Endor. This will be the, Lord Shimura. the bad guys. You deserve better than this. They actually had the Star Wars transition there. Did you see that? Convince your people to stop resisting, and you can walk free. Stop wasting my time. Kill me. You think you've lost everything. But your nephew is still alive. <laughs> My men control the roads. They build war camps near your towns. They see everything. And they will find him. Lord Sakai will fight until his last breath. As will I. You love him. Just as you love your people. You're a father to them. Will you abandon your children? I won't make them your slaves. Hello, guys. Hey, Jess. Hello, Shikinesis. Which horsey did you pick? Which horsey and name did you pick? We picked the black horse, and his name is Nobu. Point of no return. The warrior's code. Okay, so here we go. Technique point earned. We're close to getting another one as well. So, you've earned a technique point. Use it to learn powerful new techniques you will aid, that will aid you in your fight against the Mongols. Okay. So, do we get to pick the first one? Or we can take circle, circle to do a roll. Okay, that seems like it's going to be very, very helpful. I've also got deflection. Um... Right before, was it perfect party party against the la at the last possible second to perform a deadly counter attack earns a moderate amount of resolve. That sounds really good as well. I would like to get in the habit of deflection and stuff like that. I can't do mythic and exploration yet. It seems like that's all locked off. So for the time being, I think we just go for this square or triangle to counter attack. Yeah, dude, I'm down. Let's go for it. The rolling seems like it would be useful, but we'll pick this one up just now. Uh, gear. Let's have a look. This is the first time I've checked all this out. So I've got the katana, and then I've got this, the tanto, which is the smaller sword, I guess, the little dagger. Um, empty charm shot, charms grant perks. Okay, we don't really know about those yet. Don't know if we have to look at that. Equipped, white headband, or none. I like the white headband, that seems fine. I got a mask, okay. And our broken armor is the only army we have. Okay, sweet. Accessories, Stormwind. Nice name, I like that. The sun's warm embrace. Uh, a song that can change the weather. Okay, cool. We got our journal, techniques, collections, collect artifacts to learn about the Mongols. Resources are stored in your satchel. I guess this is all for crafting and stuff later on. Cool. Pleased with that. If we deflect better now, we get more resolve and offer, like, give us a, an opening, I guess. Um, hold options for detail. Journal updated. The broken blacksmith. 
Let's see what it says. So, um, major legend increased meat unit at our friend's home in southern Azamo. Or we could go and do the Tale of Sensei Ishikawa at the inn. Uh, this is going to give us archery. Cool. So recruit Sensei Ishikawa, recruit Lady Masako, recruit Yuna's Blacksmith, and recruit the Straw Hat as our Act 1 progress, I guess. Um, we said we'd meet Yuna, so if we weren't going with Yuna, I say we go and do this one first, maybe? Um, Yuna and I tracked her brother to a prison camp in the walled town of Azamo Bay. I'm going to save Taka, we need to find help. Yuna says she's a friend. Um, okay, should we go and do this one next, or...? 800 meters away. That one's, yeah, so this one's really close. So let's go ahead and do that. We have to go down there. At the, wait, is that, the, did that say hot springs? Did I make that up? Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, Yoshi Springs. So we've got Castle Kaneda. So this guy is not, I guess the guy that is like captured in the in the castle is obviously not the same guy as this guy. I was getting those a bit confused, but it seems like it's alright. We've also got something else here. Undiscovered location close to us. Uh, what is that? Traveler's Rest Inn. Mongol territory also. It's just like an area we can clean out if we want. Okay, well let's have a look then. Um, what is it that's close to me? I, I kinda, do you know what? I kinda wish I had a mini-map. Follow the guiding wind to reach your tracked objective. Swipe to on the gust of wind to show you your objective. What was the what is the little thing that's close to me um, on the map? Items and resources you collected are stored in the collections menu. That's fine. What is that? Is it over here? Fox den. You have arrived at your track location. What is the point of this? Hello, Fox. Are you leading me somewhere, Fox, or are you running away? Does the fox take you to treasure or something? Oh, we're definitely following the fox. Keep up, horse. see it, it's taking me to the treasure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do we get over there? Do we have to jump that? How the fuck did he not grab onto that ledge, though? Question mark? Dude, come on, man. Jin, what are you doing? That was the easiest ledge grab of your life, mate. It should just be automatic, right? Fuck. What the fuck is this pish? Jin, jump the fucking chasm, you dickhead. Am I supposed to run and jump that? What? I guess we have to, like, go... Do we not jump across there? Do we go up top and then climb down? Climbing doesn't feel very smooth either. Figured that out later. I guess I am not supposed to hop along there. It's just because the fox jumped down there as if to say, follow me, this is the path. But I guess it's not the path. And then like, R2 is the drop down button. When I push R2 when he's hanging, it doesn't drop down. It's just kind of weird. Oh, there's the fox. What are we getting for our luck for our treats? Inari Shrine found! Just like in uh, Persona, you've unlocked the new charm slot. Okay. Charm slot unlocked, you can now equip an additional charm. Don't think we have any charms, do we? None. Charms grant perks. Yeah, I guess we do the shrines layer to get that. Okay. Alright, good to know. See, like, like, hold on, I, I, I gotta get this, like, down a T because it's, it's annoying me. When I climb, is it... Do I just hold up and he does it automatically? You don't actually have to, hold, like, push X to jump, do you? He just does it. 
All right, good to know. Pet the fox. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's a good fox. This isn't like the fox that lives outside my room that screams all the time. That fox is a psychopath. See, bud. What does the fox say? All right, where's my horse? Interesting. We'll see where we're going next then. We need something to do. There's a nice sprawling valley to explore, which is actually really kind of cool. Um, the game does look beautiful. The game looks a little bit zoomed in for my liking, but you know, it's all right. It's not a big deal. What else have we got? We've got an undiscovered location over here, or we could go and do this quest here. We could maybe hit this up on the way, or we could go do the Mongol territory here and just have a look at some of this. Let's let's go over to this and see what it is. Um, let me get my horse. I need to get in the habit of getting on the horse and like figuring out how to be efficient here. I can get bamboo on the back of the horse, that's good. This was the, the little fox shrine. We don't have a bow and arrow yet, but I'm assuming archery will be unlocked as very soon. Yeah, I, I don't know if I totally f understand where the wind is guiding me at times. It doesn't seem like it's really, really clear, but I feel like that's just a, a lack of me not understanding it just now, as opposed to like... Yeah. I mean, I guess if you just head in the direction where the wind is like at the sides of your peripheral vision, that is you going in the right direction. Like, I don't know how close I am to my objective. This is 70 meters up top now. I guess it's telling me to go up. Can I ride my horse up? Okay, yeah. Uh, here we go. Survivor camp. Ah, oh, here we go. Um. Hi. Let's have a look. What we got here? Some people. Like, I like how it's so he densely hidden in the bamboo. That's cool. All my goods are useful. I got a merchant. Let's talk to some people first. Hello. Nekami, protect your path, my lord. Thanks. My mother believed Inari is my guardian. The fox. She saw a fox chasing fireflies outside our home the day I was born. She knew that foxes are Inari's messengers in our world. When you see one, always follow where it leads. Okay. I will. Thank you. Thanks. So we followed the fox. We're already ahead. So it's just a little tip from the game there. I thought I saw someone else I could speak to. Who was it? I've got what looks like another dude here, and then who is he? Is he the, like, the trapper? Okay, interesting. Well, let's have a look at this guy first. Hello? Another samurai? Alive? I thought Lord Jinroku was the only one. I don't know the name. He's in Kashinen, my lord. I'm sure he would be happy to see you. Okay. I'm curious to meet him. Okay, map updated, rumor location for options for details. Is this like uh, the other side of honor? Someone mentioned seeing a samurai alive in Kashin. So I guess that's, where is that in relation to us? It's down there. Okay, over there. So I've got another quest option now, which is interesting. I think we're gonna t follow that just now. Let's talk to the trapper. If you have hides to spare, I can offer you something in return. Okay, so let's see if we can sell anything. All right, cool. Don't know if we need these just now, guys. See, when I'm collecting resources, guys, should I be keeping them or should I be selling them? Because sometimes in video games, you want to just sell all your junk, but then sometimes you want to keep it. I guess we hang on to it for the time being. Um, Leather, your inventory. Thank you. So I would buy these, I guess, and then use that to craft my own stuff, perhaps. Um, but I really can't afford that much stuff at the moment anyway. And he's got a limited supply as well. He, he doesn't have just a, like an infinite amount of stuff. May I assist you, my lord? Hi. Lord Sakai, you survived the invasion? So far. <laughs> have we met before? Uh, no, my lord. But I watched you ride into battle. Please accept this gift. If you wear it, they say a spirit will lead you to whatever you're looking for. Sounds like something you could use yourself. Not with Mongols prowling the countryside. But if it leads you to any flowers, bring them to me. Or other traders. We can use them to fashion dyes. I'll remember that. 
Okay. Thank you. Good to know. So here we go. Traveler's attire. Perfect for those with a long journey ahead. Did he just give me that? Armor dies. Hats. If you can bring more, it's yours. Okay. See, this is where I do wish we had this on PC, because this kind of shit would load so much faster than the console. So yeah, you have to wait a couple of seconds for each one to show. It's not very long, but we don't have enough of these flowers yet. Uh, whatever this currency is. So we can't actually buy that. What about armor dies? Oh. Continue exploring to unlock these. So later on we will be able to like change up our clothes, I guess. Hats. This is what we want. <laughs> That's terrible. Fierce warrior headband. Again, we can't really afford that, but... Pretty cool that these exist. I like it. I really do. Um, guiding wind target. You can now track new locations with guiding wind. Uh, Alright. Undiscovered records. Undiscovered flowers. Oh, okay. So you can actually go looking for them, I guess. Not bad. Okay. Did I get a new set of clothes? Tales of Tsushima are now available to help people across the island and build your legend. Okay, so that's the that's one of the other missions we just picked up. Did I actually get a new outfit there? Yeah, okay, so I'm not wearing my broken armor anymore. I'm wearing my traveler's attire. But it doesn't look like it's got much. Oh, you can actually upgrade it and stuff as well. Ah, so we have it like this, but we can we can upgrade it a little bit. Traveling clears 20% more fog of the war. Fog of war on the map. Okay, fair. But we need supplies for that. We don't have anywhere close to enough. But that's why we need linen. Okay. Cool. And then if we get 10 leather, we can actually make it even better. Very cool. I like that. Controller. The controller will vibrate within, within 30 meters of an artifact as well. Alright, okay. Cool. So there's a broken armor. It has no perks, does it? So there would be no reason to wait it. Cool. I get it. Everything's coming together. That's fine. You have my thanks. Sweet. There we go. So we got a new new set of clothes. <laughs> we look like some sort of like homeless Batman, but other than that, showing a bit of chest. I like it. Okay. And the trapper is where we convert some of our supplies. This is where we get we would get our linen and our leather from here, which we would then use to give to the trader guy and then upgrade stuff. I think. Yeah, we could try. We could buy this if we wanted, but we we have such little supplies at, at the moment anyway. Supplies, it looks like, is just pure money. Okay. Flowers. What else have we got up here? Wonder if there's any artifacts like actually around here. We only pick up one flower at a time. Very cool. Very very cool. I can see there's like watchtowers on top of the mountain. That looks like a fortress. So we came here and we found this little campsite. That's pretty good. Um, sweet. Should we continue on and have a look at this one? I feel like this is the, the, the next logical place to go. I think the game wants me to go here first. We could go along here and do this. But we'll do that later, I think. Let's go ahead and do this. Guide and win target. So we can track that or we can track some other things. Undiscovered records or flowers. We'll just go for the main quest. Which looks like it's over that direction. Very cool. Do I need to save my game, guys, or does it like auto save? How do I? I'm just kind of curious. Exploration. Explore Shishima to find various activities that will enhance your abilities. That sounds pretty good. Anari shrines. You need to, you also, we need to find three sh shrines to get uh, another charm slot. But I don't really have anything to put in the charm slots yet, do I? Satchel, and that's all of our stuff. Save game. Okay. There we go. It probably has an autosave function, but we'll do this anyway. Hey, Firon, what's up? Hey, Jack, how far are you in? I'm not too far at all, mate. We're just literally getting started, my guy. We are just played through the tutorial, and now we're finally getting some time to kind of roam free. Is that my horse? Is that my horse? I think it is. Oh, God, my horse is here. I think I almost stole someone else's horse. Um, what happens if I ride my horse off the edge? Will my horse die? I guess my horse is too clever. Cleverer than me, obviously. Um, beware the spider says you'll get used to the wind navigation system. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, I think that's how it's going to go, guys, but for the time being, we'll just figure it out as we go. 
Uh, sushi said, so folks, the reviews for Biomune are out, if anyone cares. What are they saying, Sushi? Are they positive? DXM's here, says, sup Jack, yo, what's up? Jesse, welcome. Jesse, you've been here a while, but... Welcome again, I guess. Where are we going? Is it down here? I guess. Take me to the magic of the moment. We seem like we're pretty close. Supplies. Just stole that from the... The war was rather loud. Holy shit. I guess we're going down there. I guess the smoke is kind of like an indication that like you're uh, to head to something probably. Fairly negative overall from the ones I've seen. Oh no, that's not good to know. Well, it's actually good to know, but it's sad to hear, I guess. Okay. Look at this, dude. Uh, so we made it to the spring. Can I actually ride myself? <laughs> ride myself. Can I ride my horse all the way down to the bottom of here? Is this a path? It is. Okay. I thought this, this little pathway was a little bit too kind of uh, stealthy to be the main road, but I actually think this is the way that we're supposed to go. Uh, let's go. Hustle. When I'm riding my horse, man, it just makes me think of Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> just reminds me of Red Dead, too. Okay. Yoshi Springs. Perhaps someone at the inn can direct me to Sensei Ishikawa. Okay, so where the fuck is the inn? Is this the inn? That looks like it's the the trapper again. There's a bunch of flowers. What was this? Is this the Fletcher? Ah. I don't have a bow. I wonder if she'll give me one for free. You don't have a bow? No. I lost mine at Komodo Beach. I'd give you one if I had it. Though... If Sensei Ishikawa is alive, I hear he has a fine collection of weapons. Bring one to me, and I'll make sure it's in the best possible condition. Her thing is going crazy, dude. What? Her, dude, is it really windy in here? Or? Uh, okay, complete the tale of uh, Sensei Ik Ishikawa to receive gear that can be upgraded here. Fine. Farewell. Nice, so we got a little tip from the game telling us that we can come back here. That's good. Alright, not bad. Um, there's people to talk to. It looks like we're going over here. Hello. Have you seen the birds, Lord Sakai? What birds are you looking for? The golden ones. Songs that remind you of more peaceful times. Ah, they were my mother's favorite. She used to say they knew our island better than any other creature. I believe it, my lord. If it weren't so dangerous, I'd follow one. See where the golden bird leads me. The golden Maybe bird? Just that. But you should wait until our home is safe once more. I will, Lord Sakai. Thank you. Alright. Golden birds. Um... You're a good horse. Can I just go across the water on my horse? Is that going to work? Okay. The water's lovely and clear. I am assuming this is the inn. I didn't see any golden birds on my travel so far, but good to know. Yeah, it's actually a fucking set of hot springs. That's so sick. So we're probably supposed to go over here. I like how the, the path to the inn is actually just a rock fucking... That's brilliant. Okay, who's this person? What's he got? Come here, you. Lady. Hi. Hello. Oh, you must be weary from battle. Oh well, you know, you know me, killing, Come, killing evil soak people. Soak in the healing waters of these hot springs. Replenish your strength for the challenges to come. I must be at my best for all of them. Then follow me, my lord. Uh, rumored location added. Uh, not yet complete. Where is that? We're actually there. So wait, are we doing that? I 
I guess she's gonna just take us to the guy. Hopefully. Bathing in the hot springs restores your spirit. Well, I'm ready. And if you make a habit of it, the waters will grant you a long and prosperous life. Okay. Excuse me. I feel like I just like you know I've been running running about on my on my horse in the wilderness, probably trudging through rabbit shite, horse shite, sheep shite, and then I walk up river from this guy as he's bathing in the water. As it's windy as fuck, he's probably on that. That guy was so happy until I just like, you know, trudged through this bit and now he's, he's getting all the dirty worse, like running down onto him. Okay, I'm ready, Matilda. What are we doing? I'm ready here to rest. 63 Metacritic for Biomune, okay. Interesting. Worry to wait to see again. Oh my gene! Didn't think I was gonna get to see some fucking butt cheeks. Oh, reflect on my father or my uncle. Um, let's reflect on our uncle. I thought they killed Lord Shimra. After everything he's done for me, everything he taught me, I can't lose my uncle. I won't. Oh, maximum health increased. Fuck yeah, dude. Sekiro. Oh, budgie. Oh, deck. Oh, ruined. Such an improvement. Oh, indeed. Did you get, Surely, did you get a glimpse of that? Over our enemies. I feel Listen, it's really cold. Okay, army. don't judge me. Thank you. The wind's blowing. It was my pleasure. I like how there she just... Hot springs all over the island. Okay. Make use of them. I will, yeah. Take time to heal and reflect. The practice will keep your body ready for battle, my lord. That seems kind of OP. Alright, good to know. Well, that was nice and easy. Did she just watch me as I bathed in the in the war? That's very... Um, very patient and polite of her. Well, also quite forward. Um, okay. Let me just uh, swag my way. Look at that wind blowing my cape out, dude. I feel like Mr. Incredible just fucking... <laughs> Not that Mr. Incredible would have capes. No capes. All right, I'm just gonna swag my way over. Yo, can I run fast? Okay. A samurai. Cool. I hope you didn't need those. Oh, hello. I'm looking for my uncle. I'm looking for Sensei Ishikawa. I thought he fell at Komoda. He didn't. Where is his dojo? To the forest. I can show you the way, my lord. Is this a trap? The innkeeper. Oh, dude, listen. I just bathed in your hot springs. And I spoke to who I think may have been your wife or daughter or grandmother, one of the three. Did the sensei not fight the Komoda? No. He came to town for surprise the day before the invasion. Hardly spoke a word, but he's always been a man. <gasps> I'm just bored on that. I'll be right back. I'm just going to wipe myself in the hot, hot springs. Thanks, I'll take that. Artifacts. Uh, Traveler's Attire will pulse when artifacts are nearby. Is it this thing? My lord. Hold on. The stories of Sensei Ishikawa are true. What stories? They say he sank a pirate ship with a single arrow. <laughs> Not the ship, but he shot a pirate captain from the shore. Routed the whole fleet. I'd hate to cross an archer like that. Do you deserve death? I hope not, my lord. Then you're safe from Ishikawa. Is it inside? My lord. Would that be the blade of Clan Saka? Continue. Records. All right, we got it. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Who are you? We're a bit off the beaten you path here. Swords. That is one worth knowing. Oof. I've heard tales of its sharp edge. And Dude, that beauty, weather looks so nice. But I never dreamed I'd see it in person. It has been some time since I trained on a bamboo stand. I would be honored to see your blade in action. Oh, would you now? Bamboo strike. Okay, I'm ready. L1XX. Is it XXL1? Okay. You were too slow. We almost got through that one. Okay. Woo! Fuck. My brain is really gonna suffer with this. Triangle, triangle, I one. Okay, so it's. Fuck. 
L1. Just like that. Woo! Cool! Took me a couple of goals, but we got there in the end. Your resolve has increased. Good shit. I did it. I did it, chat. The Sakai steel is a truly fine blade. Wielded by an even finer swordsman. But training with bamboo will only make you stronger. I'll need strength for what lies ahead. There are bamboo stands throughout the island. They will help sharpen your skills on the journey. Farewell, my lord. That was sick. Dude, I like that. That actually felt challenging. Like, if you're not practiced. It's gonna throw you off a little bit. I like that. They don't just give you the free shit. So my, what does my resolve look like? Oh, I got four now. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Okay. Dude, this area has very, been very good to me so far. I've had a health Shall upgrade and a resolve continue? upgrade. And a new set of pants. Okay, where to? This is why I wanted to come to this area first. Seems like, uh, you know, this area, they want you to come and do these early quests because they give you a bunch of free shit, introduce you to a lot of the stuff in the game. Hi there, I'm just checking if you have any stuff, uh, like leather, that I might need. Um, I thought leather was going to be really hard to come by and yet I've just found four chunks of it. Hello, are you okay? Forgive me, my lord. But you look fatigued. Oh. Have you endured much hardship? Tons. Absolute fucking tons. You wouldn't believe it if I told you. Mm. But yes, I could use a rest. You should visit my sister in Hiyoshi Springs. I was sick, so she insisted I bathe in the waters. I thought it did done that, I man. could feel the life returning to my body. Yeah, mm -hmm. sounds like just what I need. Listen, I've already touched myself in the hot springs. I don't need any more info on that. Goodbye. Useless woman. Right, I am ready. Mm. Ooh, yeah. When do I get my pet eagle? That must be soon. Wrong franchise. <laughs> when do I get a home? The Sensei's dojo is up there. I want to build my my fallout shelter. Oh my god, what the fuck at the top of it? Dude, that's fucking miles away! Look for Ishikawa's dojo, I see it is. Dude, could he not have built it down at ground level? What the fuck was he scared of? Fucking dinosaurs? Thank you. I'll take it from here. Oh my lord. Dude, I'm gonna be- One more question, my lord. May I ask why the sensei left his post as archery master to clan Nagao? No one knows. Strange. Giving up service to a great lord for... This. Well, just a bit of fucking shit talking going on there. Alright. Um, do I go left or do I go right? Ooh, oh, a beehive. Somehow I don't think I should attack that. Looks like there's a little pathway over there. But that just kind of looks like it leads around to the... And I've tried to climb with this character before, I've been a bit disappointed, so. It's good to get practice, though. Huh. Alright, not bad. We can actually just climb up the front of the fucking the mountain, I guess that's what we do. What happens when he needs his groceries delivered? Okay. Climbing's feeling a bit smoother now, which I like. I've stopped trying to push X, and I think that was slowing me down. You just actually hold the direction and he's fairly, fairly quick. Whoop! Up, up and away. Oh, little break here. We're not done. Keep going, you fucking ape. There we go. Alright, nice. Sensei Ishikawa's dojo. Sensei Ishikawa's dojo. Sushi says, why would the archer have an elevated dojo? Sushi, that must have took you way too long to type. Listen, I mean, there's elevated and then there's building your fucking house at the top of Mount Vesuvius. I mean, uh, Alzora headband. Optimism in the face of adversary is the samurai spirit. Ooh, let me check it. Hold on. Uh, ghost. Oh. Stances. Oh, how do I get these? I need technique points. Oh, cool. Wind stance, war stance, stone stance. Oh, I like this. 
I didn't even see that before. I don't know if that was there, was it? Um, okay, so outfits, headbands. So the will of the warrior is timeless and untouched by death. Or this one, which is the blue one. Uh, honestly, I'll try the blue one, why not? We'll wear this when we go to visit him. Cool. Hello, it's me, your boy. <gasps> Uncle, friend. There was a struggle here. Better look around. Oh, someone was wounded. Remove the arrow. This is definitely influenced by other games. Check this out. I like this. Dried blood. The fight wasn't recent. What's happening over here? Any more clues in here? That's to open the door. Hmm. Is there more? Footprints. footprints. The victim or the attacker. Maybe the sensei is in his house. It's Overlord Sakai. I have the high ground. Hello, Debajo. Um, find the, the sensei. Is he? Are we going to be following the droplets of blood? All right. And the footprints, I guess. God, please don't let him be dead. Everybody I know that and I like is dead. Everybody except from the hot spring lady. Ooh, freebies. Whoop. All right. Dude, as if, as if you would bring a horse up here. I think there was actually a path. We just decided to scale the mountain. A humble home for a samurai. Rock climber style. I'll take some of these. Is Jin Batman? Oh God. Don't move. Sensei Ishikawa. Oh, thank fuck. Lord Sakai's boy. Whew. <laughs> Hello. You survived Komoda. We could have used your bone. I was on my way when bandits attacked me. Are you expecting them to return? A samurai is never caught by surprise. I'm sorry about Lord Shimura. He was a good man. He's alive. He's not dead, yeah. Taken captive by the Mongols. Then there's hope. That's why I've come. Help me save him. I can't. My student is missing. A skilled archer. I will help you look. Then you can both help me free Lord Shimura. Your student isn't fucking the, the ghetto, is it? Try and keep up, Sakai. Try and keep up, mate. Are you kidding me? I got fancy feet. Okay. Sick. Dude, I fucking love the, the atmosphere, dude. Literally feels like straight out of a fucking manga or something. Okay. No one knows. Are there any others who can fight back? Besides us? I don't know yet. You'd better find out quickly. We can't free your uncle by ourselves. I guess this is one of these kind of games where the faster you go, they, they keep up. All right, where are we going? I don't like I can it. help track your student. I guess she... I need no help tracking Tomoe. Tomoe! Tomoe. A woman. From what clan? No clan. Another Kenshin reference. Peasant. But she can outshoot any samurai I know. <laughs> Even you, Sakai. Nah, not me. Not me, mate. Can I stop? Last him? time I saw you was ten years ago. You came to study with me. You remember? I remember most of the students I reject. Instead, you took this Tomoe as your student. You showed promise. Tomoe is a prodigy. Oof. If you say so. What? Mongols. Oh. I'm ready to fight. Oh, that was my perfect thing. Okay. He's got the thing. They fight like drunk Tanuki. I know. They fought well enough at Tanuki. Komoda. Even Tanuki can catch a tiger when it's sleeping. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. I gotta get the freebies. Let me get the freebies. Stop wandering off. Mate! You're not my master, you're not my boss. This guy, look at him his bone arrow, fucking compensating. I like the fine dude. I wanna chop people again. Moist trail picks up here. 
Come. I'm ready. Don't kill Taboy by accident. I'll make no promises. That's close to the hot springs. The town will be the next to fall. If Tomoy has an accident, so be it. Oh, tree! Something happened here. An ambush. Look around. Oh yeah, look around. I'll be right back. One second. <sighs> oh, thank God. Um. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's happening here? Okay. Rice and millet. Left uneaten. The, the dinner. Sudden. Okay. They struck without hesitation. A Japanese quiver. A gift to my greatest student. <sighs> to my greatest student, Will. Don't need to make. Need, don't need to make me feel bad or anything. Just give it to me straight, Grandpa. I respect that. Blood, but not much. No one died. A nosebleed. I fear the worst. Tomoe's hay fever allergies are really acting up. Okay, what's happening? Tomoe would never leave the quiver behind. Unless she was pursued. Or captured. To what end? Interrogation, torture. Worse. They may be doing the same to Lord Shimura. Maybe she had a boyfriend. Fear is a weapon, Sakai. Do not let the Mongols use it against you. Your student. Where would they take her? Fort Nakayama. The fort is nearby. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I should have fought the Komura with you. Better you didn't. You lost enough there. Why did the samurai fail? The Mongols fought like animals. Wrong answer. I saw it with my own eyes. An archer's aim relies not on eyes, but on body, mind, and spirit. Mm. Of course. Body, mind, and spirit, but the eyes are technically part of the body, right? No? Stop here. We need to talk. Okay. What's wrong, Sensei? I've got this bow. Was a gift to me from Lord Nago many years ago. And you're giving it to me. It's a beautiful weapon. I'm ready. Of course it is. And there's nothing more painful to me than a perfect bow ineptly used. Give it to me. Then it's a good thing you're giving it to me. Hey, Lamal. Anything about giving? Yeah. Prove you can shoot straight. <laughs> I'll let you borrow it. Indefinitely, though, right? Try it out before we go into battle. Woo! Hey, Pierre, what's up? Welcome. How do you jack that drop by in uh, M4 Gaming to see how your ghost is going for you? Yeah, it's going great, actually, yeah. We're just, we're getting settled into it slowly and securely. It's uh, it's going really good. I'm enjoying it so far, but it is early days. Once a gift from Lord Nagato to Sensei, now wielded by the Sensei's new student. Aim for that lamp closest to us. Oh, easy, mate. Don't even worry about it. Right, I got this. L2, aim your bow. R2, and then fire the arrow. Is that it? Oh, I shot the wrong one, I guess. Good. Now the one further down the road. On the left. Not bad. Let's see if you can hit the one furthest away. How does it feel? Like it was made for me. <sighs> it wasn't. So take good care of it. <laughs> Let's go. How many arrows do I have? How do I see my... I, I, I don't have unlimited arrows? A bow like this would have helped at Komodo. It is a good bow, but victory is won by warriors, not weapons. You haven't seen the Mongols. This guy sounds like the dad from Pocahontas. He does the the guy that's that, you know, the guy that like runs the tribe. Fire weapons. They have not yet won. Tell me this isn't fucking Kokom's granddad or something. Uh, I think I've only got one left. Then if the arrows are under my face, it says I've. Your student is inside. Got one. I think I want one shot, maybe. Can I make more arrows? We'll get a better look at the defenses from up there. Okay. Spaghetti says, yeah, this is such a great game. Yeah, it does. It looks really good. Uh, this spot is perfect. Okay. I'll find a way in. Open the gate. Then we hit them. You always charge into battle with your Hakama half tied. <laughs> you have a better idea? Patience, Sakai. The Mongols will send men to find their missing patrol. When they open the gates, we strike. The longer we delay, the longer Tomoe remains in danger. She can take care of herself. Survey the battlefield. What can we use to our advantage? Hornet nests. One shot could stir them up. Mm, 
the Mongols will face the sting of insects and arrows. Okay. Got an explosive canister or something? Those barrels could do some damage. We'll find out. Nice. What else have we got here? An arrow in those hanging lights will kick up sparks. <laughs> and start fires. Okay. What else have we got here? They have many archers. They're skilled, but we are better. When the gates open, hey, Cactuar. distract the enemy and rain arrows on their heads. Then we storm the fort and free Tomoe. I think I've only got one arrow. Now we wait. I've only got one arrow. Grandad, I can't shoot these things. They're opening the gates. Wait for my signal. I'm ready. Arrows full. Oh, I've got eight now. They give me some back. Okay, I'm ready. The Hornets. I see battles here. The Lantern. Oh, we can fucking hit it from here. We're quite high up, so I don't think we have to calculate too much depth stuff. Get ready. Now, send them to their ancestors. Coming. Oh fuck! Headshot. Oh. Woo! Teamwork. Fuck. Did I just go down and fuck them up? Cool. Not bad. I'm ready. I'm going in. I'm the boss. Come on in, bitch. Oh, fucking hell. What the fuck? Jesus. Oh, he's got a fucking helmet, okay. Uh, Grandad, where did you go? Need help? Okay. Dude, is it just me or is the music, like, super fucking... The music's quite loud here. He was the leader, was he? Kill or observe more leaders to unlock war stance. Okay. Very cool. Where did the big club guy go? Did he fall off the edge? Oh, he's here. Oh! He survived that. Dude, what the fuck? What the hell happened here? I'm trying to figure out like who's the bad guys and who's the good guys sometimes. It's kind of awkward. See, my friend's behind me, but I thought my friend was like running into the into the area there. Hmm. All right. Guess we get involved. My HP is really low though. All right. That guy just got fucked up. I gotta get inside or something. Can't fight out here in the air. In the air. <sighs> Fuck. I am dead, dude. I can't. I need health or something. 
I need to fight them in here one at a time or get a sneak attack or something. I think I don't think I can sneak attack. Is there somebody coming in? Maybe I can get an archer kill up here. Are you a good guy or are you a bad guy? I actually can't tell. Oh, my health is like slowly... I think it's like gradually filling up. I have two arrows. Alright, well I'm glad my friend was here because he just did all the work for me. That was really bad. <laughs> we got there though. Alright. Um... Fuck, okay. I am glad my NPC friend is actually a useful character because I feel like I did a pretty poor job. Give me that. Yeah, I need I need HP. Is there any? We've got a photo mode as well, actually. Oh, this isn't looking good. Hello. That was tough. Slain prisoners. I should have been more careful, I think. Killed with arrows. Wait, Take it easy, Pierre. Thanks for being here. To her. Search the fort. Okay. Uh. All right. What we got here. These arrows are Japanese. They're Tomoe's arrows. You are sure? I taught her to make the knock with deer horn, and that curve of the evil feathers. So the Mongols took her weapons. The shots are tightly clustered. She's been shooting. No Mongol shoots Japanese arrows with such skill. Huh. Then they allowed her to use a bow. She may have betrayed us. What's going on here? There's some something more afoot. Something more going on here. Hey, Cherry, what's up? Ghost of Sushi's going well so far, yeah? Scroll. Archery terms with Mongolian translations. She's been teaching them. Your name is mentioned. She was teaching them my way of the bow. Oof. But maybe... <laughs> But the question was, was she forced to do it, or was she doing it willingly? Hmm. I grab some supplies here. Oh, that is not a door, apparently. <laughs> just closed the door on the guy. Just left him behind. He's trying to get out behind me. I'm just, like, slamming the door in his face. Okay, this is where we were when we were trying to take cover. Oh, and here's our clothes. Someone's personal quarters. A woman's kimono. Toy's kimono. The Mongols freed her. Why? Because she had good booty. And she was very skilled as an archer. Do you hear that? A survivor. Uh oh. I'm on the way. I'm on the way. Let me grab this. What is he out here? Am I getting- am I going the wrong way? Oh shit, I am. Dude, I feel so, like, confused and, like, um... I'm hoping it gets- I'm hoping I get better at interpreting the fucking- the signals of the game and where to go and, like, which direction to turn, because right now I feel a bit clueless sometimes. Uh-oh, this guy is not looking good. Looking for a woman. An archer. The Mongols caged her with us. But they set her free. Gave her armor and a bow. She killed my wife and the others. The bodies we found. She proved her skill to the enemy. Then they recruited her. Please. It it hurts. Don't leave me. Oh I've seen enough. Rip. Let's go. Oh, this isn't looking too good for our friend here. Dude, I am fucking crippled. If I'm she expected to fight, Sensei, the way won her freedom, and she joined the Mongols. Rip. How would she do that? What happened? I pushed her too hard. Pushed her how? What are you hiding? Smacked her bum. Wait a minute, Sensei. Did you try and romance her? You never tried to romance this student, you kinky, an you kinky bastard. She attacked me. Uh oh. <laughs> Not bandits. Why? She has no idea what it means to be samurai. You drove her to the Mongols. Do not judge me. Do not lie to me. 
I can't let Tomoe teach my way of the bow to the enemy. Then we will stop her. This is my fight. I don't need your weapon. No, you need me. Victory is won by warriors, not weapons. Lord Shimura raised you well. We'll hunt them away together, but we do it my way. And when the time comes, you will help rescue my uncle. You have my word, Sakai. I will prepare to hunt Tomoe. When you are ready, meet me at my dojo. We can't rescue my uncle alone. I need more people to join our fight. Fine lady Masako Adachi. If she's still alive, she's one of the finest warriors on the island. Okay, so that must be our quest complete here then, I guess. Uh. <laughs> Alright. So... I guess we've recruited Sensei Ishikawa. But we're gonna have to do quests for him and stuff, I guess. Get some perks. Technique point acquired, nice. Oh, Your legend grows. The Wandering Samurai. Oh, we get health from that as well. Okay. The Mongols are everywhere. Okay. In a fight, they will surround me like wolves. I need to find new methods to keep them at bay. So here we go. New ghost weapon unlocked. L and R1 to throw kunai at nearby enemy, leaving them staggered. That's very uh, ninja of you. Fucking Naruto would be well proud, okay. So I don't a get a choice there. Blade I can throw to catch a foe by surprise and finish them off. Okay, cool. Ghost weapon, so let me see here. R2 and left to equip kunai. I'm watching the video on the top right above my head. Oh, he uses that, yeah, he uses it on the one at the back and then he kills that one and then... So you actually have to equip it? L and R want to throw. Oh, he throws it at both of them. Okay, cool. What else have we got? Black powder bomb. Oh, sick. Um, smoke bomb as well. That's pretty cool for running away. Sticky bomb. <laughs> that one's a meme. <laughs> Wind chime. Uh, throw a small bill uh, to an enemy to draw attention, I guess. To lure them away and then kill the other one, I guess. L2 and R2 to throw. L and R1 to throw. Very cool. Throw an additional kunai. If we could buy that if we wanted. Do we have... We actually do have an upgrade, but I don't know if I want to... I don't know if I should throw an additional kunai. That might be a bit... I'll leave that for the time being. What else have we got here? Um, I can buy these as well. So we've got our standoff, recover health as well. Um, save yourself from defeat when wounded. Ah, okay, so if we get fucked up. Cool. Standoff, challenge enemies. We already have this whole triangle release. So what is this? After a successful standoff, one enemy will rush in and open themselves to a killing blow. Ah, so you can kill one and then push it on to the next one, is that right? Ah, cool. <laughs> you just go through the montage, <laughs> taking them down one at a time. I like that. Okay. So archery L2 and R2, we've, we've just been introduced to that. That's fine. What is this? R3 will aim into, was it a slow time? Okay. Not bad. Doesn't really seem like something I'd want immediately. Assassination, we've got um, roll just before landing to avoid damage from the highest falls. That sounds, that's something I want. Detect more distant enemies by listening at a deeper focus. That seems pretty good as well. I think I want this, but a lot of these are really good as well. Uh, we can afford that one. I'm going to take this off the soft landing, or the safe landing, so that I can jump. It's definitely convenient. Let's grab that. I'm not rolls out of high falls. Cool. A thief's trick. Okay, so if I was to go to these, I guess I've just spent my point, right? Yeah, okay. So I could have actually opened up some of these as well. Maybe I could have actually took the regular roll if I hadn't spent that point, but it's good to know that's how it works. How does the stances work? Triangle. I mean, there's so many options here. Um, defeat more Mongols to unlock this stance. So we could have moved our way down here. Hold triangle and then tap triangle. So it's like a double attack. Increase stagger damage against swordsmen from stone stance. That's pretty good, obviously. 
but you have to go through these one at a time in order. Perform a Stone Sands Heavy Attack with Ferocious Speed. Very cool. We could have also took Health Parries, recover a small amount of health. That that would be really nice, actually. Parry an unblockable attack from a Mongol sword. Uh, parry incoming projectiles while blocking. <laughs> okay. Gain moderate resolve by using a parry or perfect parry. That, that's obviously really good. Very cool. What else have we got? Circle and square for a dash strike. That would be really good. Yeah, I think I'd like that. Sprint towards your enemy and slash them with a quick strike. Look at this. Let me see that one again. Oh yeah, I need that, dude. That is an absolute must. I don't know how we get these ones. The mythic one, uh, tail not complete. Ah, so that you get this at the end of doing like the actual main story, I guess. Oh, look at that one, dude. You got the fucking... Oh my god, that's super rad. <laughs> look at that shit. <laughs> it's like a Master Yi fucking... That's like a blip. Like... Whoosh. Like that. Oh, so dank. Quick... A quick unblock attack that inflicts extra damage against staggered enemies. Triangle and circle. These are really cool too. So there's so many things that we want to be upgraded, which I I really like that because sometimes you get RPGs and you get all these points, you just don't know what to do with them, and then you feel like you're wasting your time. Very cool. Uh, everything's looking good. You've acquired a bow. You can quick fire. Oh, these are kunai. So apparently, if I let this go, I've got three kunai. Tails updated. So if I hold L2, so I don't actually have to equip the kunai, just my, my bow. So if I push, oh yeah, if I push R1, he just throws them. If I hold, okay, well I've just fucking thrown two of those into the abyss, never getting those back. I need to go and get HP from somewhere, man, I'm fucking crippled. That that place fucked me up. Um. What we probably want to do is save our game here. It's probably auto saving anyway, but we'll make some backup saves just in just in case, you know. It'll be nice to be playing a game again that hopefully doesn't crash all the time, unlike Oblivion, which was a bit of a pain in the ass. So we're let's have a look at our journal then. We've got the Tale of Lady Masako or Masakao, uh, major legend in samurai clan armor. Travel to the Adachi estate. Got blood on the grass. Uh, the mercenary straw hat Ronin may be rough around the edges, but I could use their blades to help them defeat Lord Shimura. Uh, okay, and um, we've got the broken blacksmith, which is obviously Yuna and her brother. So what is the, where's the, where's the journal entry for, uh, oh, oh, okay, so this is, if, okay, fucking hell. So there's, there's Jin's journey, but then there's also these ones as well. The side of other, the side of, the other side of honour. We get linen and minor stealth charm. We don't have any charms at the moment, so that would be alright. Minor range charm into silk, meet Ishikawa is dojo. Are these actually easily seen from like the map? So that's the other side of honor. And then I guess the yellow ones, the important ones, Jin Journey are marked in yellow, is that right? Got it. Okay, we're all good. So these are like side quests and obviously these are main quests that we're gonna have to do. We've got our, uh, our man here, if we wanna continue doing that, if we wanted to pursue that a little bit more. Undiscovered location. I kinda wanna go to the uh, Oof. I kind of want to travel across to uh, the hot spring and heal, if that's an, an option. We haven't really went too far away, but why don't we want, why don't we head for this undiscovered location? Maybe we could do the sensei and the student again, or we could go and do this one. Women of the clan. Golden temple, I have no idea what that is. The other tales as well. There's a lot of opportunities. We should probably do the closer ones first, right? That makes the most sense. Komoda Town, I think that's where we started. Alright. Let's uh let's go this way then. So the winds are telling me is it back up the hill? I guess. Is that right? Yeah, we look like we're getting closer. I has spaghetti. Um when the only food you have for breakfast is your Cheerios, those are my snacks. Yeah, I'm starting to get hungry. I had tomato soup before I started the stream today but I feel like um, I feel like I need food already dude why am I getting like this my body is like con is my body's becoming conditioned to uh, need food as soon as the bloody stream as soon as I start streaming my tummy starts rumbling how do I get my horse down here
Did you see the video of her using Amber as a sword, Jesse? No. At last, Amber is useful. Alright. This looks like it'll help us. We have a sunset, dude. So I think there is a... Is there actually a day and night cycle in this game? I think there is, right? I know I can change the weather with my pan flute. This is the water that's absurdly loud compared to everything else. I don't know why that is so overtuned. Um, Alright, fuck it. We'll travel back in here on our little horse again. Pavlovian reaction starts the stream once Pavlova. Yeah. We did get groceries today, so I'm back eating the boring food again. I could stop in the archery dojo now and have a bowl. I feel like I'm taking the long way around here every time I come into this village. Is this actually the way? This can't be the main path. Right. If I visit this, this spring lady, will she heal me? Because I am fucking doomed. Can I actually just dip my ass in the water? How do I heal, guys? Do I have to rest at the end? I'm utterly fucking crippled. Somebody take care of me, I'm dying. Fuck. These boys just chilling in here, alright. Lads, I have no idea where to go. How'd I get my health back? There has to be like a way of doing it. Everybody was like, go back and use the springs. Hmm. Will it go up if I fast travel, maybe? If I journey between places, or...? Mate. Bovani gear, okay. Okay. Crane strike, hold X to buy for five. Moderately damaged and draw speed one gift from Lord Nagato. Now wield it by the Sensei student. So this is just to change the... The look of it, I guess. Thank you. Dude, what the fuck, man? We gotta figure this out. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, there's something on there. Flowers on the roof. Um, Maybe I have to go to the campfire? Let's fast travel to the campfire and see if this actually, if the travelling actually heals me. When approaching enemy territory, you can challenge standoffs. Oh, it did. It, it did give me HP back. I haven't built my resolve up. I guess I have to do that elsewhere. This guy's able to be talk. I can speak to this guy again. I'll tell the others are you new? Who are you? Hello? Maybe I can get a quest. You know the tale of Tadayori, my lord? No. I know his name. But I've not heard of his exploits. It's long believed that the Ama Tadayori war granted him great power. Mm. That it would be disastrous should it fall into the wrong hands. Okay. And I can't let that happen. I'd like to hear more of this story. Look. And this armor. The musician Yamato may be able to help. Yamato. He told me the legend in Azamo, near the river that separates it from Tsutsu. Tsutsu. Okay, map updated. It's another location. Alright, not bad. So... Where do we want to go then? Do we want to just do this? I feel like we should just do that. What was this undiscovered thing back at the... At the shrine. I'm gonna travel back. So I got my HP. Some enemies can block your attacks, hit them with triangle to break the guard. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Look for columns of smoke. Oh, there's an artifact here. Look, there's a firefly guiding me. Records. Cool, I guess. Hmm. Right, where are we going? Undiscovered location 160 meters away. This way? Did 
how do I find it, man? I can't do my wind when I'm in the village. So how the fuck do I know if I'm getting closer to it or not? I guess I'll follow the, the bend round. Maybe this is it. Is it this guy? Did the navigation... Okay, legend storyteller. This must be it. In our legends mode. Uh, not now. I have no idea what that is. Mm. Legends mode. Is that like multiplayer or something? Uh, interesting. I think we do this one again. I think we do more stuff with the sensei and the student. I'm um, happy enough with that. We could also go and start Lady Masako. I wonder if some of these are actually going to be stopped at some point or another. You know, like, I wonder if, if uh, like, we get him to, like, tail four out of nine and then eventually he's going to stop and then we have to go and do other stuff or, like, get our legend upgraded before we do more, maybe. Can I also want to go to this fort and just fuck these bitches up? And then come back to them, maybe? Let's do that. Uh, how the fuck did I get the <laughs> how did I get the village though? If I follow the wind, it's this way, I guess. We could just fast travel, but I kind of want to get in the habit of like learning how to navigate just a little bit, and then in the long run we can maybe start fast traveling here and there. But okay. Huh. Alright. Grab that. I'm gonna go slay some Mongols, chat. Just to get a bit more practice. How many arrows have we got? No, I don't want to take foes. A moment in time. I think that was for going into photo mode. Is that my first achievement in the entire game? Or did I get... I think I got achievements earlier for starting, actually. I got the one that was called um, the point of no return, didn't I? All right. Um, right. Let's get on the horse. Come on, Nobu. Right. Apparently, the wind is blowing me up into the right, like this. So I think this will be us. Hopefully, we're getting closer. I kind of wish the, the little icon for like how close you are would stay on the screen though. You can see it's up top left, but I think it'll fade away, yeah. Am I going down? Is that, is that whistling noise, is that? Oh shit, what the fuck was that? Oh, is that a bear? I can hear... See the noise that I hear right now? Is that one of those gold birds we were talked about? The game told me about before. Apparently I was to follow like a golden bird just like I was to follow the fox, but I have not seen any golden birds yet. Those might be bad guys. Those bad guys? We're just gonna avoid them. Legends is online play, yeah. Okay. Though it's playable solo, it's uh, though it's playable solo, it's actually quite fun. Okay. I think this is a fortress of enemy bad guys. Let's see what we can do here. All right. The fuck, man! What was that audio, man? Sound like a fucking tiger just shot in my ear. What was that noise, bro? So I've got three guys in the front. We can just stand off. Draw your blades. Chapter! 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 
Oh my god, you swung that way. Motherfucker. This game, this game could really benefit from like a lock-on, I feel. Like, I feel like the game could really benefit from a lock-on. Okay, when travelers the tire will pulse. Alright, that's more record shit, isn't it? Are you okay? Thank you. I didn't mean to go out the door. I'll take some of that. What else have we got? Collect. Okay. Out we go, I guess. Is there actually any more enemies in here or nah? Grab that. That's what we came for. That's what the, the firefly was buzzing about. Is that it? Was it just the three guys? So have we technically liberated this place now? That was easier said than I... Th easier done than I thought it was going to be. You familiar with the sound of tiger shitting? Yeah, dude. It's like a firework going off in your ear, right? Isn't, haven't you guys all heard that before? This area is so large, and the fact I only killed three guys here is a bit weird. I just threw away. Oh, I just threw away my fucking good eye. Maybe it's just because it's the big. Oh. Oh. Okay. I kind of want to use my. Oh fuck. Uh, oh, that was a leader, apparently. Killer, observe more leaders to unlock water stands. There we go. Okay. So there was more enemies. I just couldn't find them. Get my kunai back. And I get given the... Uh... Okay, yes. So the kunai was pretty good, actually, for like buying a bit of time. I feel like as long as you don't get overwhelmed by the enemies, it can be alright. Silent Bird, what's up, dude? What's the crack, Jack? This game looks beast. It's very good. Yeah, Bird, this one's a good one, mate. We're just getting started with it, and uh, I'm coming to grips with the controls and um, trying to figure out like all the kind of basic bits and bobs, but it's actually super clean, man. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot to it. You can tell they've worked on it. The game looks phenomenal. But we're just uh, learning learning how things works. I think my favourite part of it so far is definitely how the game, like the actual ambience that it's created, but then also the combat is like really fucking fun. Feels like, almost like Dark Souls combat. That's not my horse. I need my horse. Where's my horse? Oh, here he is. Right, I think we, cl we cleared this place out as like a kind of secondary objective. We should go back to this guy. We could fast travel to him, but I kind of want to just... I want to get in the habit of, like, roaming and... Getting used to... Travelling and stuff, because, again, the only thing that's pissing me off so far about the game is... Definitely my... Definitely my kind of lack of compass, lack of minimap. And the fact that, you know, it's like, you know, follow the wind. But the wind is actually almost un unseeable. It's, like... Fairly unclear. I'm gonna fucking attack these guys. Oh fuck. Looks like he attacked me. Are the spear attacks or no? That guy was just waiting for death, man. What the fuck? 
I think I think this last guy was supposed to be staggered by my kunai, but he was staggered for way longer than I thought. Dude, is my horse okay? I think my horse got kind of fucked up. Take a shot for every time Jack almost steals someone else's horse. <laughs> oh, this guy's still alive. Not anymore. Alright, uh... Okay, I think my horse is fine, even though technically I got fucked up. Game shit a brick towards the end, lol. Completed Subnautica, yeah, towards the end of Subnautica, but the game does... It does get a bit fucking laggy, man. It, I had some serious glitches with that game towards the end. Like, crashing frame rate, but then also, like, you know, I had glitches with the prawn suit would get stuck and not move. Okay, dude. I'm not really getting the whole... What is this camera angle, man? Fuck off, man. Alright. It's gonna take me a while to get in the habit of this. There is no camera lock in this game, guys, right? There, there, I'm not being like a total dumbass. There is no way to like lock onto an enemy as they come towards you. I feel like having that option might be okay, but it's maybe just because I'm used to playing games with lock and then once, you know, once I play it for like a few hours I'll get used to it, but it feels a bit strange. Yeah. When we first came here, we were cold and we were clear with no colours in our skin. Cactuar, are you calling lyrics again? You're a good horse, Noble. Taking bets on how long it takes Jack before he kills his horse. I think my horse is already fucking ready for retirement, honestly. Right, we have to... Oh. This analog stick to go fast, sorry. Right, there we go. I'm not gonna try and kill more horse guys, don't worry about it. Yeah, when I was playing Subnautica board, I got um, to some of the earlier, or sorry, some of the later game temples, and my prawn suit would like get glued to the floor, and it wouldn't actually move, and I'd have to like repel pull myself across. What the fuck is that? Oh god, boars. Fucking boars, but... Alright. I think we're going the right way. Yeah, there's the smoke. I think the smoke means that's my, uh... Yeah, is he up there? Okay, okay, okay. Can I... Yeah, back up to the archery house, okay. Alright, nice. I think we help this guy out um, and do some more of these quests before we get involved in some of the other things. I quite like the bow and arrow mechanics in the game. The headshots feel mega satisfying. So I say we do that and then we talk to this guy. Like, we do some more archery stuff and then start investigating some of the other quests and then maybe hook back up with that girl we met in the beginning whose name I've definitely not forgotten. Dude, is he shooting from there? This guy's a god. Alright, here we go. I wonder if we stand in front of the target, he'll hit us in the face. Poor horsey, let's not get attached. Hey bud. I'm ready for a mission. Sign me up. Sensei. Any word on Tomoe? Yes. But I'm not sure you are ready for her. No. You make her sound like a demon. That's not far off the mark. Tomoe is fearless. She is not samurai. But she is a born killer. I know the type. No, you do not. This guy's really fucking sucking up this fucking... Tomori, Tomoe character's butt cheeks. The sensei and the student. Donkey, will it be named? Come. Where My horse is called Nobu Chat and I'm gonna keep him alive until the, rent, until the end of the game. I suspect We're not calling him Donkey. If I updated Subnautica to play it again, but I'm too afraid it's gonna explode my old PS4. Starving leopard is fearless yeah, too. I mean, don't get me wrong, guys, I loved, I loved Subnautica, but it was very clunky on the old PS4. Very clunky. Why did she turn against you? Why did she turn against you? I took a risk sharing all I knew with her. When she betrayed my trust, I punished her. 
It must have been harsh. You saw what she did to the prisoners at Fort Nakayama. That was no mistake. That was a choice. And not the first time she's made it. You don't know it was her fault. You don't. I do. I don't know if I like this guy. He's very standoffish. He seems to be dismissive of us. But we're going to prove ourselves to him. He's going to teach us some techniques. Maybe. If we're lucky. How many arrows do I actually have here? Are we climbing? You gonna make it? To climb to get there. You gonna get? You gonna? Sure, you can make it, Sensei. Yeah. You gonna be all right up there, old man? What are you waiting for, Sakai? Don't call me Sakai. Oh, that was a clean swing. You need a hand, Sensei. Is he gonna get it? Is he gonna get it here? Oh, dude, we're gonna go around the corner. And he's gonna be standing at the top of the mountain, guaranteed. Oh, f f this guy. Not bad, Sakai. This fucking guy. Taking the fucking piss. He said the only way up was to climb. No, I said you had to climb. It's good exercise. Arrows, Mongol and Japanese. If they were here, they're long gone. We might pick up their trail by the practice target. There is no target. Near that watchtower. Not bad, Sensei. Find out where they went. Was there any need of you to do that? That seemed a bit. Did he really need to shoot the watch for the watch? Move it, Sakai. This guy's fucking very very bossy, isn't he? Did he really have to shoot the watchtower to show us where it was? He was just showing off. I'm coming in. Is anybody here, friends? Oh. How many Mongols is Tomoe training? Exactly. Severed head. Used for target practice. Ew. Sensei! Mongols here! Oh. That's a big doggo. Sensei! I could use your help! Oh, fuck. What? Yeah, alright, mate. Practice makes perfect, I guess. I wanted to see how many arrows that guy could take. But he took like three in the chest and just did not give a fuck. Um, give him my arrows back. Can I go up the top here? The Mongols came running out and I threw my kunai. I think I threw my kunai at the dog. Like, he, I meant to throw it forward at the archers and he kind of like threw it off screen. Oh, he's weighed on me. Fuck. Shit. Come down. That would definitely burn your hands. Okay. Good work, Sakai. Uh, not really. I got shot point blank in the face. Arm, Observing your response to an ambush. This guy. I'm gonna stab this guy. You knew those Mongols were still here. Yes. You didn't think to mention it? If you can't handle a few Mongols, what good will you be against Tomoe? This is war, not a test. And how many wars have you fought? Hundreds. Couple hundreds. Oh god. I'll test you as I see. <laughs> Fucking roasted, we just stand here and take it. I can see why Tomoe attacked you. <laughs> yep. <laughs> This fucking guy. Now, where did she go? Sir? Ross, what's up, Hello, guys? Girl. Welcome. All A right. lot of tracks. A dozen men, maybe more. What's up, Ross? Follow the trail. All right. So, do we actually? All right. Okay. Just watching the master at work. Hello, Ross. How's the game treating you? Yeah, pretty good, man. You're doing pretty do you well. To use your bow this time? Yeah, boy, Raymer. And What's up, your boy? Can you take a dozen enemy soldiers without me? Hundreds. If I must. Did I keep? Good answer. I only got three arrows. Fuck me. I wonder if I can craft arrows at some point. That would be cool. Ross, what were you playing today, my guy? 
What's been happening? We're not too deep into Ghost of Tsushima, but it's, it's good so far. Challenging. I like it. Combat feels heavy and really satisfying when you pull it off. We're uh, coming to terms with the angles of the game and the, the kind of pers the kind of depth perception. I feel like the game's very zoomed in, but that's probably just how the combat's meant to be. Um, we're going this way. Oh, this guy got fucking wrecked. Okay, are these? I think these are actual targets that we have to fight. Look at them. They're practicing what Tomoe taught them. Murdering the innocent. Today I started Dead by Daylight slash Splunky 2, your favourite. Give Celeste a wee shot there, if you are aware. I've heard of Celeste, yeah. I, I haven't really played too much of it, though. Um, but it sounds good, man. I've got the big dude down there. These guys... Four targets total? I gotta assassinate this guy for sure. Jump down. I bought a technique to roll upon landing, which obviously clearly doesn't work very, very well. Oh fuck. Shit, that's not good. I didn't see that guy looking at me. So I can headshot the dude up top, but that guy would see. Uh, maybe there's a way around here. Yeah, okay. We gotta be able to assassinate the douchebag. Where's that guy? Where did he go? Oh, he's not dead. Alright, rescuing hostages. The Mongols have taken hostages. If the enemy spots you, they will start executing the prisoners. Bit fucking late for that. Oops. Love this, by the way. Excellent game. Yeah. We're getting the hang of it slowly. Alright, water stance picked up. Yeah, that's good. Water stance is highly effective against shields. Okay. Cool. Uh... I'm not going to activate this just now. Oh, I, we just get it for free, do we? Um, or do we have to, like, select a... Oh, we just get it. So triangle, 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 shield breaker. Hold triangle and then tap triangle, triangle for flurry strike and hold R2 to change stances. Okay. Uh... Is that it? I think there was another one, was there not? I guess my uh, my friend helped me out there. I don't think that went very well, but we got it done. You're okay. Oof. Did you see a Japanese woman with these Mongols? I couldn't believe it. She was giving them orders. What did she say? Something about. We did play Sekiro, sensei. yeah. She kind of sus. I really, space, really enjoyed Sekiro. Heard, my Lord. Like really enjoyed it. Forgive me. I got addicted to that. Nice. Yeah, Sekiro was a winner in my book. I, I couldn't put Sekiro down. It was one of these games where I just... You start playing it and then you're... You just can't stop. Super, super, super fun. I'm relying on my bow quite a lot at the moment. Um, I need to try these new... Like... Oh, there we go. So, stone stance. So... What is it, right? How do I... Oh, I... I okay, so if I want to go on a... Water stance, I can do this. So... Oh yeah, so he holds it like that. That okay. Very cool, man. Okay, so if I do like, yeah, that's the technique for breaking the shields with the triangle. Let me just have a look at some of these other ones. Technique, um, stances. So what we got here? Hold triangle for a piercing strike. This one's got triangle then. Blah blah blah. Okay, let me chase. Let me let me try this. That's the shield breaker, but I can also go... Okay, cool. Ch swap back to this one. Yeah, that's a lot slower. But this one's got like the piercing stance, like this. If I upgrade that, I can actually stab twice. Interesting. Alright, Dad. Uh, hold on till I get these arrows, because I'm running out of arrows. Can I, can I have these, please? No? Do I have, do I have max at 
I'm only holding six. Okay. Don't know what happened there. Uh, I better talk to this guy. Hello. Um. What's happening here? I feel like I want to loot this corpse, but oh, it's just arrows again. Okay, I apologize. Sorry, we're getting there. Mm. I taught a monster how to hunt. They heard to Our full Sekiro playthrough is on YouTube. If you guys ever want to go back and watch it. I, it, the VODs from that point of our streaming career, if you like, uh, I didn't actually chop the VODs very well, so there is a long start and end to the end, like, to, to each of those streams. So nowadays, like, our stream can maybe go, like, eight, nine hours sometimes, sometimes longer, sometimes shorter, and uh, what would happen is the VODs would just be the full length of the stream, like, eight hours. And nowadays, I try and cut the start and the ends of the VODs to try and bring them in just a little bit, so that when you start watching episode one, it just takes you straight into the game. Which is better, but some of the the Sekiro Let's Play should still be pretty good quality even on YouTube. Um, but there is a bit of extra faffing around at the beginning, so yeah. Sakai, the way you fight. He bought Sekiro with his drug money. Says the Bachio. The Bachio, you're a bit wild today. You alright? You've never faced an enemy like this. I see you keep talking about farts and stuff. Are you hyper today, the Bachio? A samurai is a guardian, not a killer who darts around like a thief. You didn't see Komodo. I've seen enough. I know it was brutal, but I won't train another monster. I know. I won't let that happen. If Tomoe is going after Yoshi Springs, I need to prepare. So do you. I'll see you at my dojo, Sakai. Okay. I guess that's done, uh, part two. So, this is a tale, right? Or is this the main story tale? I don't know. You got a point? Cool. I guess we put that into something. I don't know what we're gonna put it into, but... Charm of efficiency, range charm, hey, nice. Good. Um, let's go ahead and lock that in. So if I go into... Oh, mythic tales are now available. Seek out musicians to hear legendary techniques and long forgotten treasures. Fucking hell. Uh, alright. Sure. Maybe I go around and actually do the other ones. Get involved with some of these other people first. So we're on three, uh, If I go into gear, you can equip charms to augment your stats. Charm of, uh, efficiency. 15% increase to knocking and reloading speeds. That's really good. So we can draw our bow a little bit faster now, which is pretty cool. And we've got two more spots as well, if we get any more. Katana upgrades. Uh, sure. So we are at Katana 1, and we can do this now. Find any swordsmith to upgrade. Oh, okay. Sick. Kill enemies faster, yeah, for sure. I think we want to be doing that ASAP. We did actually meet a swordsmith. Assassinate enemies faster. Ah, okay. Oh, so the Tanto is our little dagger for assassination. I got it now. I understand. I was kind of confused at first how the how that works, but we can also upgrade our bow and arrow as well. Look, there's any bow mate bowyer to upgrade. Decent. Okay, cool. Bamboo is required for that and supplies. Sweet. Very good. Um, all right. Can upgrade the kunai as well. Well, I think the sword has to be an absolute upgrade, right? That's gonna get. We're going to be upgrading that ASAP pronto. Need to go back and talk to a swordsmith. Do we want to go and do that now? or So... Bamboo strike we've done. Legend storyteller. You just fast travel to there, I think. There's no... There's no swordsmith here, but we've also got this, whatever that is. Um... I don't know if I want to keep doing this guy with the Tomoe stuff or if we, we move on and do some of these other ones. I kind of want to go and visit this one, get some armor and stuff, figure out what the fuck the Golden Temple is. I guess if we just go and try and go here now, we just get fucked up, do we? The enemies are probably like really hard. Uh, Yeah. Can I... Boar's got up one upgrade. So wait, is there not a swordsman in this village? There's a boar, a merchant, and a trapper. Where did I see the swordsman? Fox den. 
We definitely saw a swordsman, right? We did the bamboo thing, right? Maybe the so maybe the bamboo guy wasn't the swordsman. Can he not upgrade my stuff? I don't know. Cam Camon Kai says, "Hey, very good choice to play the game. Thanks, Camon Kai. Appreciate that." Out for a bit, most likely we'll jump back later, but stay honourable, my friends. Thanks, she kind of says, take it easy. Um, just send us smoke signals when things go wrong. Uh, do we want to go here? Someone just entered my Genshin world without me accepting. I do not have it set to that. Why? <laughs> Uh-oh. Just wanted to be friends, obviously, Jess. Guys, where do I find the swordsman that can upgrade my sword? I thought that we saw one in here. But according to the services available, there is no swordsman person here. Wasn't there like a was where you know how we did the bamboo? I'm gonna go back to the bamboo guy and see if he can upgrade me. Hmm. Look for flocks of white birds circling on the horizon. Fly. Don't know what that said. The flyover place is something something something. Will you? Oh, sorry ladies. Oh, that's awkward. That's awkward. I guess we can't. I guess we don't have a swordsman yet. I'm just gonna loot the place. Don't mind me. Yeah, I guess not. Hmm. I guess these hot springs don't count as like different hot springs, do they? Still all the same place. Alright, sure. Um, well, I guess what we do is we just go on a journey and head for here. I, I think we start doing the Lady of Masak Masakao and try and do some of the other ones. We've got him to level 3 so far and we got a token from him. That's not bad. If we do this, we actually get some decent armor, which definitely probably wouldn't be a bad thing. We also go down here and check out some of these things, I guess, on the way, maybe. There's a ton of stuff to do along the way. I'm curious to see if some of these are actually, like, useful side quests or if they're actually going to be, like, garbage tier. Hmm. I think I'm going to run and go to the bathroom real quick, guys, and consider turning on the oven as well. Pretty hungry just now. But I kind of also want to get to our next area. Can I follow this stream? I gotta get the habit of rolling and doing the, the roll that I bought. Hold on, let's see if we can try it. There we go. Got it eventually. It's the first time I've pulled that off successfully. I literally just straight quit the game LMAO. Instant panic. It's just somebody looking to say hello, Jesse. You just wanted to come and see your characters, bro. Jesse, just because the guy came in to say hi doesn't mean that they were out for bad things. Honor the shrine? Foxy shrine? What does this do for me? Inari shrine. Okay, cool. I didn't even follow a fox to get to this, I just found it by accident. Um, is that lighthouse where I'm going? No, it's on this side of the river. Some say they know every secret on this island. I wonder where it's going. Oh, the golden bird, I see it. Have I to follow the golden bird or...? Yeah, okay. Finally, I was looking for these. I wanted to see. Uh, I heard a screaming noise earlier, and I thought, well, maybe that's. Oh, hold on, I'm coming. Oh, it led me to the shrine, Pillar of Honor. Okay. Jesus Christ. Um, I just found a new bow. Beware the warrior's fighty vengeance. Um, what is that? Is that was that a new weapon? The bird took me to the bow and arrow, I guess. But the the question mark was already marked on the map, so the bow the, the bird was kind of overkill. 
I think I was coming here anywhere. Anyway, what did I just get? Half bow. Did I get like a... Was it a colour for it or something? Um, outfit, accessories... Hmm. Let me see. Weapons? Bow options? I have no idea what the fuck I just got. I guess it's like a... I thought- I think it's a skin, but like I don't know how to get into the cosmetics. Uh, I forgot how to find my way around. It's none of that shite. We do have an upgrade though. Uh, let me see. Jesus Christ, that fucking mighty. Perfect parties recover a small portion of health. Uh, yeah, sure. Deflection. Is it vanity gear? Is that it? Can, any can anybody tell me what I just got? I'm assuming it is like a skin for my bow or something, but like I don't even know how to fucking put it on. Do I need to go visit the bowmaster to be able to equip that shit? <sighs> Not entirely sure. It's like, you know, it's, it's just me having to figure out the game slowly, but sometimes games do this really intuitively and sometimes they do it like... Less so. Like, the game was like, hey, you found the secret thing, it's a reward, and I'm like, yeah, I don't know what it is. How did I find it? All my kids are useful. Okay, the bowmaster was like, over here, I think? It was something ashes, like somebody's something's something ashes. Perhaps I can better your bow. Speed, distance, and power. I don't care about any of this shit, I'll mate. See you again. What did I just find? Sakiri steel. So this is my swords. Outfits is in here, maybe. Weapons and ammo. I know I can change the look of my sword, right? Sword kit options. Ah, fuck's sake, that's what it is. It's a sword kit, Yash's Embers. So you have to come into sword kits. Is that the same for the bow and arrow as well? Bow options. No, the bow doesn't have, like... As far as I'm aware, the bow doesn't have that, but the sword does. Ah, okay. Actually looks kind of hideous, though. I don't know, do we want this? This is way better than... <laughs> What the fuck is that? <laughs> Beware the warriors fiery vengeance. I don't think these actually, I think these are just pure cosmetics, right? Interesting. Alright, well, I guess while we're here, we probably could just upgrade the bow. I haven't met the sword guy yet, so... Yeah, sure. It's a lot of my supplies, but I have enough bamboo. Your arrows will strike like deadly falcons. Um, thanks. Deadly falcons, thanks. This is the half bow. I wonder if I put lots of money into upgrading this and then I replace the bow and then suddenly all my upgrades are wasted. I don't I don't know how that's gonna work. Until next time. Woo! Um Fox then complete. We can fast travel to the Fox then and then head down here. I think that's what we do. I don't I, I'm happy to travel around on foot when we do this playthrough, guys. But I also don't like leaving this village. <laughs> the village is a bit stinky. Um it's actually a really nice village, but like, navigating in and out, I, I don't know, throwing me off a little bit. So the tale of Lady Muscal is this direction, I think. Let's go ahead and punch in a save file here really quickly. And then I'm gonna go make some food. One second guys, I'll be back in a second. Um, party too early, get stabbed, party too late, get stabbed, party on time, never happens. Partying in this game feels easier than like Sekiro or whatever. Well, not no, partying in Sekiro is fairly straightforward. Partying in Dark Souls is like next level though. Um, and then the one time it does happen, you don't even kill the enemy outright, so you gotta do it again. <laughs> there you go, chat.
Alright boys. Snacks in the oven. Sorry for that. Sorry for taking a wee break around. What are you guys saying it? Any mountain lions in the game? Hopefully not. Not after the oblivion fiasco. Alright guys, let's go on then, shall we? Let's see if we can go and find our new uh, friend. Maybe along the way we can find a swordsmith? This area of the game is called the Golden Forest. Oh, we got a camp here. Um, I guess we just fucking... Did. See, to me this looks like an area to like inv investigate and, and explore, but like, I think you just drive through it, right? I like this, man. I like the leaves on the ground, man. That's so amazing. Oh god. Uh, shit. Hmm. Looks like that's an area. See, like, there was nothing... What is that? Instant on the, uh, on the pass. I hear shouting near the bridge. Oh, fuck. Um, okay. Change of plans. Here we go. Come and fight! Alright. Is it just the one? I'm only gonna get better if I keep practicing the fucking... Let's try our new stance out. Okay, that was pretty good. <laughs> I feel like a bit of a maniac when I'm holding- You know water stance? It's a fuck- it looks like- <laughs> you look like a fucking psychopath. <laughs> that looks so much more natural, but like, I get- Yeah, okay, we'll need to practice that shit. What was the point of this? Um, we killed these guys, but... Oh, I came in here and I don't even think this is... Supplies, I guess. It's good practice, I guess. I keep expecting there to be like fucking hordes of enemies, but... Maybe I should get in the habit of like using my horse a lot as well, but I've rode, I've rode my horse everywhere and it feels really weird. It doesn't feel like the smoothest system. Is that it there? Oh, this is the bridge, okay. What's going on here? Hello? My lord! What's this? What have I walked in on? They've taken the bridge! Tell me. We were running for Hiyoshi Springs. The bridge looked safe, but the Mongols were in the ravine. Classic they, Mongol strategy. They started shooting from below. Classic. Someone's injured. Banta. My brother's boy. Your brother was named Banta. Dead. Banta fodder. Tell your family to stay clear of the bridge. I'll stop this. What's the best thing for sharpening knives? Um, quite clearly a dragon's tooth, Serenity. If you're doing, if you're using anything else, you're doing it wrong. Pretty sure. Bones. Keep screaming, What's happening here? Am I? Where are the bad guys? Okay, I see them. There was an assassinate button there, but it popped up like way too late. There's the other bad guys. Sometimes it feels like, um, I think you're supposed to stealth this. Okay, he's dead. 
Did I get it? I didn't get... Oh, I left that one behind. Oh, I've got one arrow. One arrow. Oh, I got, I got the new... Oh, guys, wait, hold on. I got the new fucking attachment charm that makes my arrows a lot more, like, efficient. Like, my my bow pulls back faster. Climb, 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 climb. What are we, what are we waiting on here? Oh, too slow, mate. Too slow, too slow. Whoever balanced the audio of this game is a fucking twat. I'm just saying. I said that in a bit of, in a moment of frustration, but the whoever balanced the audio for this game is a fucking psychopath. It's so it's so inconsistent. The game is so quiet, and then when you get into certain areas, it's like, do, 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 do. it's like, mate, what are you doing? I know we're in combat. I know it's an action sequence, but come on, man. This is new. Jim. It's the Christopher Nolan way of balancing. Hey, Trey, what's up? How many arrows do I have? Four. I'm coming over at fuckies up, boys. Hopefully this time I don't leave any behind up behind me. Did I leave any up? Oh, I did. There's that one over there. Fuck off, mate. I got him. <laughs> I got him. <laughs> Worth. Aye. Ah. Uh, what are we doing? Oh, you hate to see it, dude. Get off the rock. No. <laughs> Ghost of Tsushima, no! <laughs> fucking invisible ledge, dude. Alright. Now I'm fucking back to being absolutely crippled again. Thanks. Really enjoying this. Really, really enjoying this. Climb it. Oh, you fucking slut. You can't hit me from there! I'm gonna get Melvin. I love the fucking headshots, dude, and I love the air assassinations. This area is very footery to navigate, though. So you're supposed to assassinate the first one, right? Is this the way they want you to go? Oh, these guys are dead. I feel like I could do with, like, a zoom-in function. I don't know why these enemies on my side of the river haven't spawned this time. Maybe that's like a difficulty thing, or it was like a checkpoint, maybe. There's one over there. Ah, oh, shit. I think they spotted me. Maybe? How many arrows do I have? Three. 
<laughs> what was that noise, dude? Oh, come on, you twat. Climb the fucking wall. Hi. Silly bitch. Where's the Death to the hornets. Your only weakness, fool. Alright, I'm pretty sure we fucked up multiple times, but we got there in the end. Don't worry, I'll get him. I'll get the boy. I'll get the child. It's okay. Don't know what happened there. I'll get him. It's okay, pal. You're alright. Gonna rescue this man. Did he shoot you in the dick? Yes. But I took it like a man. I'm not gonna complain about it. Thank you, my lord. The bridge is clear. Hey. I like. I really like the shoon. Speak with the bandits. The with Banta's uncle. Dude, if I was Banta, I, I think I'd have thrown myself out into the fucking canyon. Hello. The Mongols are gone. Did they scream? Their suffering isn't your concern. Take your family to Hiyoshi Springs. These roads are dangerous. We will. Thank you. No problem. Do I get any sick rewards? Are you a... Is there a swordsmith amongst you? I need to upgrade my sword. Okay. Incident at the Hiyoshi Pass. And oh by god, was it indeed an incident? That nearly broke me. Oh, come on. Really? Am I gonna point for that? Charm of the Unyielding. Defense charm. Ooh. What we getting? Uh, sure. Minor defense charm, moderate really reduces damage well taken. Uh, take it. Okay, so less damage when taken. Went less damage taken when below fifty percent health. That was a hard sentence. I think I'm broken after that quest. Right, fine. All good. Well, that was interesting. Uh, onward to Miss Akal then. Where's my dumb horse? I'm on the wrong side of the river. I can't tell. I think I am. Come on, horse. It's okay. I'll show you. I'll show you how to travel. Wait, are those mo No, those aren't Mongolians, are they? Oh, mate. No. No, 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 no. We're busy. If I keep stopping... To you are kidding me. No, lads. If we stop to fight all these douchebags, we're gonna... It's gonna be 12 years before we get to the next part of the game. This looks interesting, though. Oh, fox then. What does the fox say? Come on, buddy. Wait, where did the fox go? Oh, he's over there. I'm ready, buddy. Squeak, squeak. Where's our shrine, little buddy? Pretty sure I saw this, like, particular... I think I've seen this fox shrine before. I think I've seen it in, like, a trailer or something, or somebody doing a review for the game when it first came out. I remember watching someone follow a fox through the yellow leaves. Alright, an Ari shrine found. There we go, boom. Not bad. Alright, horse. Uh, onwards, where to now? Uh, this way? I think it's this way. Good shot to hit a target that small. How rude, Serenity. How rude. Listen, I'll have you know that Jean, Jean here, or whatever his name is, has the biggest pee, pee in all of Japan. It's actually so big that you can take an arrow to the dick and not care. This way? I do actually need to come to collect bamboo now, so if I can be grabbing this on the way past, that would be alright. Okay, Adachi Estate. I think this is where we're supposed to be going. Clan Adachi's estate. Lady Masako should be here. I am a samurai. Lady Masako! Hello? Warriors of Clan Adachi! Is anyone here? Oh no, that looks like blood. <clears throat> Are we gonna have to do the Witcher thing? Blood. Of a battle. Someone was dragged here. Oh, 
a broken doorway. Someone forced their way. There was a struggle. Oh my god, a used condom. They were horny. Sorry, and I pretend I received that. It was kind of gross. Used by the women of Clan Adachi. They fought to defend their family. Right. They were trying to escape past the children through the window. Okay. Where are we going next? Something else? I like that they do make the clothes easy to find, which is kind of... It's nice. Oh! Kill him! Do you know, I had a feeling something weird was coming up there. Where's Lady Masako? What? Oh, we are not dead, mate. No! Fucking hell. How did that headshot arrow miss? Dude, that was like right on him. Where's it gonna put me back to? Alright, okay. Oh, but I lose my, my resolve. Kill him! Where's my body? I was trying to get my perfect party there to, to work, but I really do need to to practice it. I guess it's the last possible moment you get the perfect party. Not Mongols. We'll need to work on this. And not bandits. I need to find out what happened. But Sire, they could be bandits. These people if look like survived, they may have fled on horseback. Better check the stables. What we got in here? Anything exciting? Alright. Uh, the stables is over here. Yeah, I, I'm getting in the habit of spamming L1, which is what I used to do when I played Sekiro, which is probably not the best. Empty stables. Someone took the horses. Blood's dry. Alright, what we got here? Horse tracks. Someone fled the estate. They left a trail. Okay. So where to now? I wonder, did I, f did I fuck my potato? I think I was supposed to peel back the lid of the potatoes on the meal I put in the oven. But I was so en so enraged by the, the canyon fight that I just threw in. Hmm. My potatoes might come out shit tonight. I think I'm supposed to peel the lid off. Alright, where's, uh, where are we going? Are we following the, oh, we're following the blood trail, are we? Footprints. The rider was being chased. Do you know what I think this game would benefit from, right? Just a, a, This is just my own opinion, and once I get used to it, it'll be different. But, like, I feel like the game is far too zoomed in when you're traveling. I think this kind of... This this angle is really good for the combat. Because you're in and you're You know, the combat is deep, and it's, it feels impactful and meaningful. So you're up close, right? But see, for, like, the running around, I kind of wish that the, the angle would zoom in. Just, just not, not, like, not, like, miles away, but, like, just take a step back. I feel like so close to the ground and like the game is so big. Uh, return to the footprints, did I? Oh. Uh oh. Archers were hunting the rider. The rider was skilled, knew how to confuse their aim. Oh, hello. What's this? Uh oh. A fallen horse. Rip. This horse belonged to Clan Adachi. No. Uh -oh. Dead for days. Lady Muzzle, it's me. I am a friend. Oh, she looks sad. Jean Sakai. It's me. They said no samurai escaped Komoda. Well, they were wrong. My husband. Oh, he's dead. 
RIP. Lord Adachi Pan died blade. a warrior's death. Defending our home. Our home. Why have you come? The Mongol Khan has captured Lord Shimra. If your clan joins me, we can save my uncle and avenge your men. Clan Adachi is dead. Massacred by our own people. Wait, what? Traitors. Why would they kill those who swore to protect them? I intend to find out. I'm coming with you. No. Do not set aside your concerns for mine. Me? The family of samurai are my concern. Oof. I know what it means to be the last of one's clan. Ninja clan, here I stand. I cannot be responsible for your death. You won't be. Mate, I've only died like five times. Ride with me. Oh. That was a personal request. The tale of Lady Masako. Masakao. Masako. Malt vinegar. If you put them in the oven, then yes, take the film off. No, 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 no. So there's two types of meals, right, that I've come accustomed to over the years. The chicken and the potatoes, right? The chicken that's the creamy chicken, you've, you're supposed to tear the, the film off completely. But the barbecue one, you don't. It's like a little plastic thing that's pierced. But it's okay, guys. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about the potatoes. I'm supposed to take off the film halfway through the meal and stir. But, like, you know, you know. I would involve getting back and up, you know, getting back up and then stirring the potatoes and the, the chicken and, and the sauce and... Thrill, hi! How's the game so far? It's gone alright, Thrill, yeah? I'm enjoying it. It looks beautiful. The game looks amazing. They were waiting to finish what they started. Feels really satisfying, yeah. Does anybody want to go stir my uh, chicken in the oven, guys? Can't be I can't be bothered. I stayed with my son's wives to fight our attackers. We were outnumbered. And then I was the only one left. Oh, surely not. That's how it ended for me at Komoda. For me. Komoda. It wasn't oh, my tummy's rumbling. I buried them here. With the rest of our family. Okay. I'll think about it. Guys, stop worrying about the potatoes. You care more about my potatoes than you care about me. I'm here to honor the dead. I'm here to honor the motherfucking dead, chat. Cut them on the road. Cut them down. Is that a tenant's logo? My sister. My grandchildren. X26, what's up? Welcome. You Welcome back, man. Not so. My man. She was just born. All I could do was bury her with her mother. Right, Never I'm gonna stir the chicken while this is happening. Guys, don't let me get attacked. My sister don't let me get attacked, okay? Keep me alive. Husband in the north. But at least you, she's with family. Come. We ride for the golden temple. everything properly in the oven right but I forgot to put a fucking timer on the bastard and I can't remember when I went to put it on so I think it's been 15 minutes it's been 15 minutes chap I can't remember I think it's been like 15 minutes so I put it back in for 10 oh you think this is funny yeah oh my god my controller's vibrating it must be like a bug or something close by 
somebody do a potato? Next thing you didn't do that. Not the potato sticker. Anything but that, mate. X26 said, this game surprised me. Yeah, dude. We were outnumbered, she cries like bitch. The whole island got outnumbered. That's the point of the invasion. Alright, Cherry, don't be sympathetic. Just go all in on her, why don't you? She's lost all of our people, man. She's just trying to express her grief. But yes, you have a point. Potato! Don't put the potato sticker all over the stream when I'm not here, Nixon. Please. <coughs> Singing crickets. Oh wait, I have to return to Mali. Shit, where is she? No, we're not doing this again, chat. Stop it. Chat. You said you wouldn't. Cherry, don't do this. It's not too late. Nixon, guys. Sorry, you endured this alone. This is a touching moment in the game, chat. The killers are alive. They will pay for what they did. Every moment the killers walk free brings me shame. You can't blame yourself. But it is my duty to punish them for it. Put on top of my fucking subtitles, chat. What if there's a deaf person watching the, the Let's Play chat? Hmm? It's not like my fucking webcam takes up like half the subtitles. Don't need the fucking potatoes in there as well. I need HP man, I'm dying. Can we speed this up mate or... This is a beautiful area, holy fuck. Oh, we're gonna be attacked aren't we? I feel like we're gonna be attacked. You'll have to go in without me. Oh, that's what she said. Find the monk named Sogan and tell him the fate of Clan Adachi. Okay. What are you plotting, Lady Masako? Indulge a grieving widow. Once you've talked to Sogan, find the armorer. She is repairing something for me. I want you to have it. The sword lady. Thank you. I will wait for you on the other side of the temple. Okay. Let's go. Speak with the armorer. Look for Sogan. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. I need you to upgrade my sword, please. Oh, look at this place, dude. Pretty sure I've seen this scene in Mortal Kombat. What the hell? You guys know what I'm talking about? Lord Sakai. It is an honor. Hello. What's up, buddy? Are you in charge here? I think of myself as more of a servant, my lord. Please, call me Junshin. Junshin. I made this temple a haven for our people. I'll spread the word. If they cannot make the journey, there are also camps around Ariake. I supply them with all the food I can spare. That's good to know. I'm looking for one of your fellow monks, a man named Sogen. I believe he is sweeping the temple. <laughs> Thank you, Jinxing. Continue your good work. Cherry says, at least our potatoes are temporary. You are a permanent potato on stream, so. Cherry, your face is a potato shop. Right. I'm here to speak with the sweeping monk. Wait. Are you Sogan? I am. Sogan, listen. Sogan, save me. I am Sakai. A samurai. Alive. A foolish a samurai warrior. Clan Adachi was attacked. She is the only survivor. The Mongols. Traitors. Our own people. How horrible. Has anyone suspicious passed through the temple? A group of armed men? Not that I've seen, but... My duties keep me far too busy. Oh, sweeping the floor, yeah. Please tell Lady Masako. She Sounds like an excuse, Sogan. Sounds like a fucking excuse. Thank you for your time. Of course. Speak with the armorer. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Where is the armor? Find the armor. I can hear. Yo, legend storyteller. Hello there. Yes. Hi. 
An exquisite weapon. You know, you recognize it on sight? For me, every blade is unique, as recognizable as a person. The swordsmiths are always like this. Bring the materials I need, and I would be honored to improve such a fine sword. It's not just like, it's not just like this guy is like, it's not that he's just a swordsmith trying to get by in the world and this is his profession. They're always like fucking obsessed. Oh, that blade, I know that blade. That is from lands 400 miles away from here, but I know it so well. Sakai Katana. Upgrade me, baby. I'll take it. Yes, please. Just like that. Like the finish. Thanks. What about this? Apologies. You don't have what we need to do the work. I'll decide that, mate. I'll fucking decide. Oh my god, the upgrade for this is actually insane, like. We need 150 supplies, though, and 30 iron. Not even close. Oh, it does actually have little upgrades to the blade. It's visually... I, I love that. It's very, very, like, almost un... Noticeable, but it's there. That's really cool. Okay, cool. You have my thanks. Okay, speak with the armor. Wait, this is the swordsmith. Where's the? Ar okay, that's not even who I was supposed to speak to. What's happening up here? Hello. Who's this guy? Hello, my lord. I was just remembering the words of my old master Saigyo. Yeah. To cleanse the spirit. One must first cleanse the body. Yep. Mm. Saigyo was a Deodorant. wise man who spent too much of his later years singing in the hot springs. But surely you agree his words ring true. The healing waters, purifying steam, and shade from a red maid. I'm having a drink tonight, by the way. Nothing beats a hot spring. You can't stop me, champ. Steal your spirit I'm having back. a sake from the can. I suppose you're right. That's exactly what I need. Swordmaster says Anne. Swordsmiths make terrible company at dinner parties like mate, you ever talk about anything else? They're master craftsmen, they tend to be a bit single minded. Why are you guys pretending like you's no swordsmiths? What are you on about, chat? When the fuck was when was the last I thought Anne was being I thought Anne was joking, but then They're good at the beer pong though, Nixon. You don't know a swordsmith either, stop it. Anybody else pretend they know a swordsmith? How is your armor fitting, my lord? Oh shit, mate, I need some new armor. I'm, I'm getting slapped. Said you were repairing something she wanted me to have. The armor. It's one of the finest sets I've ever worked with. Let me get it. I'll wait. Oh, my Nikes. Sturdy armor that once belonged to the son of Lady Masakal. Give me. It suits you perfectly, my lord. I'm awaiting it. The quality is incomparable. It will serve you well. But if anything isn't to your liking, I can always make alterations. Do it all again. All I need are the right materials. Thank you. I want it in pink. Oh my lord, this is disgusting. It's actually alright. does look like my granny's rug though. Like a scarf that my gran might wear. Uh, right, so let's have a look at my gear. Enable armor loadouts in the gameplay options. Charm and vanity gear to create custom loadouts. Oh, okay. So I can what? Uh, gameplay? Where would it be? Accessibility? Subtitles backdrop. Ah, oh, that's good! What else have we got here? Aim assist, toggle buttons, controller vibration, lower intensity. Combat's less intense, giving you more time to react. Oh, okay. Force is easy difficulty though. Enhance wind visibility. Oh, fuck yeah, dude, put that on. Increase the visibility of the guiding wind, yes. Jesus Christ, yes. Enhance combat clues. No, we don't need that yet. Large text, subtitle, color. That's fine. Fine, okay. Okay, that is my oven, guys. Cool. So I, I think what it means is I can select different armors, but then change the visuals of like older armors if you want to keep like better gear. Clan armor. Um, taking damage grants resolve. Oh, okay. Reduce all damage by moderate amount as well. Okay, cool. Right, I gotta get Marvin. Looks not bad. And a canoe. And a sun. And then this guy, this game, we're just, uh, gone full anime. I do like my new, my new suit, though. Look at my new armor. Not the most stylish, but it'll do just fine. <clears throat> okay. So I haven't really found the need for the, tra the traders yet, but 
We'll get we'll get down to that in a little minute. We'll figure that out later. Looks like we've uh, cleaned out the Adachi estate. We've done that as part of the quest, and we have helped this uh, woman speak to Lady Masako. I think that's. Uh, I think we're technically still in this quest, so we could do we could do this. We've already spoken to Ishikawa, so we've recruited him. If I look at my journal, you guys can see. So we we'll, yeah, once we once we do the Masaka, Masakao quest, when we finish it, doing what we're doing right now, that's going to be a score through, and then all we have to do is look at look for Yuna's blacksmith brother. And then recruit the straw hat Ronin, whoever he is. We also do some of the tales as well. There's a tale over here. I kind of fancy journeying across and having a look at this. And seeing what we can get. It does offer a, a, a stealth charm. And we've got a space for a charm that we... You know, we don't have any charms for it yet. So, I say we tidy off this. Where is she? Is she out here? This is another... Is this another tale, is it? Oh, that's Legends mod again. Okay. Lots of dead people here, unfortunately. This should be us finished, I think. I'm glad we upgraded our we sword. That's gonna help. Hi. We've got the same armor as her now. Well. It belonged to my eldest, Shigesato. Shigesato! I spoke to the monk. What did Sogen say? He offers you refuge in the temple. So my family's killers know where to find me. Hmm. We need to move. No, we're not done. How much HP do I have? I am fucking broken. Can anybody, anybody who's played the game, if ESC is still here or someone, how is it that I get my HP back in this game? Like, I know how when I'm fighting I can push down and use a medikit, but like, how do I, see in between quests like just now, how do I actually get my health to recover? It recovers if you fast travel, but there must be a way to do it if you're not fast traveling, surely. Sorry, says I'm definitely more of a fun of the pre uh, definitely more of a fun of the previous God of War games, but the reboot bored me. I didn't even finish it at Serenity. Sorry, I don't encourage Serenity. Okay, she loves God of War. She's just memeing. No Japanese sound. You're not weeb enough. We we did decide in the beginning if we were going to have the Japanese voice actors or the English voice actors, but um, we settled for English. I'm not sure if I'm totally happy with it. I would have liked the Japanese voice. I think we played Sekiro in Japanese, or maybe Sekiro was. Was Sekiro in English or Japanese? I can't remember, but apparently the voice actors in the game have been... Apparently the, the lip sync of the characters has been synced to the English voices the most. I don't know if that's true or not, but that's what I heard, so we're, we're rocking English. The voices... Think Sogan is behind the massacre? They actually do have English. They have, like... Although the voices are in English, they are actually voiced by what sounds like Japanese people. If they're not actually Japanese people, the accents are really good. My home just before the assassins. The little bastard was their scout. That doesn't prove his guilt. No, but it earns my suspicion. Sogen arrived from Kamiagata at the beginning of autumn. When we first heard the Mongols plan to invade... Yeah, we were in the Healing Springs earlier, and I don't think that's... I went back to the Healing Springs to check that, and, and it didn't work for me, and I don't know why. I think the Healing Springs are a one-off for increasing your, your max life once. But after that, I don't know... <laughs> I don't know how to top up my HP. There are ways. I don't know if it's kind of spoiler. Uh, I just... All I want to do is, in between quests, I want to be able to have a full health bar when I start a new quest, so I'm not going into it totally fucked. Look how nice this looks, man. <laughs> Holy crap. So many leaves. Where is that monk? They're so good. Leaving in a hurry. Let's follow the wolf to his den. Yeah, if I get in a combat now, I am kind of crippled. Get down here. You sent me to frighten the monk. I knew he would panic, make a mistake. Now he's leading us to his friends. Stay close. You can't be seen. <laughs> Thanks, Tabachio. <clears throat> Skido could have been played in English, but it's defaulted to Japanese. Okay. From what I can tell from a quick go search, there's not really a way without a thing. There's gear that lets you get HP by killing guys. I think I saw upgrades for getting HP back when I kill people. But maybe I... Yeah, I don't know. I wonder if anyone saw me leave. I guess the game ex... Hide. Did he see us? I don't think so. <clears throat> wow. That was wrong. moving again. Let's go. 
Uh, I guess we have to dip across here into the bushes. <laughs> Is he just going to spin around every 10 minutes? I wonder how far back I can tail him. Lol. Dub better than sub. Uh oh. This guy is suspicious. Oh, he's slowing down now. Dude, if the Mongolians were attacking and I was like a villager. I would be so scared to leave like the, the the walls of my city. Doesn't that take like huge balls? This guy's a fucking psychopath. I think we drop down here. Can I drop down? No? Come on man. Alright, maybe we just follow him up top. Fuck. <laughs> that looked like a bit of rubber banded. <laughs> the swing did. Ooh, supplies. Jin, slow down. Fucking don't tell me to slow down, mate. You slow down. I need to get into that bush up ahead. If he turns around now, we're fucked. There's a nice bush here. Uh-oh, this could be treacherous. I actually watched some anime last night, guys. After I came home and chilled and relaxed. Let's get closer. This way. I watched uh, two episodes of my, uh, of Kuroko no Basket. I realised I was only on episode 16 out of 30 or something like that. Or 13 out of 26 or something. I'm literally halfway. <laughs> it's two good episodes, though. Hey, Lahoz, my man, what's up? La hoz, la hoz, la hoz, may they pinch no more. It's good, man. Not bad, yeah. It's pretty, pretty good. It's tense. The game's tense. Those men slaughtered my family. Spare the monk. The rest can die. Are you cowards? Oh, hold steady, chat. Oh shit, I forgot my buns in between the meal. Fucking hell, dude. Camera angle is so fucked sometimes. Okay, I need to change stance, I think. Oh, dude, just like that. This is the hardest fight we've had so far. There's lots and lots of enemies. I guess I had it in my head that this game would be black and white. You can actually play it in black and white, Lahoz. There's a, there's a black and white setting. Dude, I think the audio balance in this game is so bad, though. Like, the audio for... ...random bits. Jesus Christ, dude, what's happening? I'm trying to dodge back, but I still get stabbed. Rip. Hmm. Are you going to do the Online Legends missions as they pop up in the story, f uh, or the story first? I don't know, Mikey. I don't really know much about the, the Legends. I, I haven't really tried the Legends missions yet, so I don't really know what they involve. Oh, fuck, I didn't mean that. Kind of 
I was too busy concentrating on something else there. There is a lot, a lot of bad guys here. I'm kind of... Alright. Just calm down a little bit here. Targeting is really bad. I kind of felt like that fight was doomed from the beginning when I fucked up the, the first part. I was too busy reading the chat. How, uh, what's everyone's favourite team? Mine's is Irish-British. I'll wait till the end of the story. But I wish I'd chipped away at them. Apparently, you can do them single player but they're meant to be played online or something? Alright, let's do this nice and behaved. I was totally changing my stance there. Okay. Alright, that was a bit weird. Sorry that it took me so many goes, guys. <clears throat> I was a bit concentrating on different things at once. Yeah, it's not that hard if you take your time. I was trying to be a bit too dramatic with some of my stuff. Okay. You destroyed Clan Adachi. I was only a messenger. For who? Knowledge does not end suffering. You know nothing of suffering. Masako. I buried my family, one by one. It took days. But I'm going to leave you for the wolves. We need him alive to tell us who he serves. Our world has changed. Men of vision must rise to face it. And those in the way must be removed. They were children! <laughs> Masako! Rip. He, he was never going to talk. We still need information. There has to be something we can use. Search outside. I'll deal with things in here. Find me when you're done. Fucking potato smiley. Alright. What we got here? Spare weapons. They expected reinforcements. Mm hmm They've run out of food. Must have been here a while. You need to just take your time when you're fighting in this game. There's no point in rushing in, and if you get annoyed by it or tilted, you're just going to lose faster. Hmm. So we need to just take our Names. fights nice and easy. And symbol. Masako might know them. Alright. Uh, can I just fucking... Find anything? We found some bits and bobs. I think this is our quest finished. A list of names and a clan symbol. I found the same symbol on these men. I've never seen it before. A rival clan. Moving in to take control. Ninja clan, here I stand. We have to stop them. I will. You cannot do it alone. When my uncle hears of this, he will not rest until the traitors pay for what they did. 
Help me, and we will bring down everyone who hurt you. She kind of looks like a potato. Together. When you need help rescuing your uncle, I will be there. Nice. Thank you, Lady Masako. Until that time, I have work to do. Yeah. Noble. Actually, Sky to March, a roleplay game. There we go. Nice. Just like that. Cool. So she's been recruited. We got a point. It's gonna help us. Oh, two points. Fuck yeah, okay. Nice. Let's go ahead and spend some points in, lads. Maybe we can actually make ourselves a bit more beefy or durable here. Um, so, that is the Massacre questline began. We can now go and contribute to Helping Heart if we really want to. Uh, we would be doing two of, of nine. We've already done two of this one, and we'll be moving on to three. Fast travel currently is disabled, though. Why? Interesting. Okay, let's have a look at our techniques and stuff. Uh, could actually be okay to pick up the roll for dodge and attacks, maybe? Our other options are parry projectiles will block, and that seems kind of shit, but we have to learn it if we want to progress. I don't, I don't really care about parry and unblockable attacks, but that might help, maybe? Game will resolve by parrying or perfect parrying. We've also got Parry an unblockable attack with a spear. It seems a bit kind of shit. Um, evasive roll. What we got here? So we take this. So we can roll now. Evasive strike useful against slow moving enemies. So that circle square. That sounds really. That looks really good. L3. Oh, and that's the sprint strike as well. I think I kind of want this one so that I've got like a charge attack. Um, what have we got down here? Following the wind to following the guiding wind to hot springs, so can the restore of the waters to increase maximum HP. That sounds pretty good. Resolve uh, for bamboo strikes, wind chimes. Not bad. Um, we we'll have to do complete the heavenly strike to learn this technique, so we get that later. Uh, what about if we have a look at stances? Maybe we could upgrade some of these. This is a stone puncture. That's hold triangle and tap. Hold triangle and then tap. That gives us three attacks so many things you can put your time into it's actually kind of crazy uh, ghost as well got some of these as well standoff streak that seems like it would be really good probably um, but honestly I think I want the sliding attack I think we go into evasion and we go for this sprint and then square to strike I think I want that just give us a bit more flexibility so now with our two points uh, <clears throat> let me show you guys we should be able to roll around so I can roll, and then I've also got like a sprint attack. Cool. All right, not bad. So I've got on our horse, and I think I want to kind of diversify my time a little bit. Um, I think I want to go away from this one because honestly, these these enemies are take are quite hard to kill. Um, so I feel like we we chill from there for a time being. We've done this. We could work with her if we wanted. Minor utility charm. I don't know what that means. We could also go over here and do the other side of honor for a stealth charm. Or we could go back up and start doing some of these areas. Kind of head back and see if there's any more quests here and then go back and start doing more of these. I don't know. I kind of want to have a look at this. Will we go ahead and see if we can check this out? And then maybe potentially head back. Now the winds are... Yeah, yeah. I can... I turned on an option, guys, to make the winds a little bit more clear. It seems like it's helping us quite a lot, so that's nice. A couple of deaths to that quest, though. The infamous Dark, the Dark Souls roll technique, yeah. I think against some of the heavy-handed enemies, I'll, it, it might be that I use the roll in combat, right, as intended, but then sometimes the roll is actually quite good for just gaining distance if you need to take a break and then... Show me your skill! Like, actually, uh make some room in combat to like heal or whatever what ah. that's my new technique
Not exactly smooth, but we got it done. Alright, give me that. Give me this back. Missed my headshot with the arrow. Which kind of made me sad. Because I thought I was really close, but... Interesting. I think having the... You know, if I take the ability that will give us the ability to... The technique that gives us... When we're doing the standoff, we kill one, we go into another one. I think that's... We want to get that soon. That's going to help us cut one extra enemy out of all the fights that we're doing. And I think that'll definitely be a plus. You made the mistake of saying one day if I changed my name to Chernobog, he'd play Bloodborne. Obviously I became Chernobog, but the Bloodborne was put off. Not put off, just not immediately... Not immediately adhered to, Jesse, that's all. You know, it's a long-term contract, my guy. Are we fighting these guys as well? Roll your blades. This is a huge fight. I don't think I should be taking these guys on. I don't think I should be taking these guys on, but I'll do it anyway. We gotta kill the other guys first. Let's kill the archer. I think the rolls kind of fucking me a little bit here. We swapped into water stance to kill that guy's shield. That felt pretty good. Got our arrows back as well. I thought we were going to die to that. I think it's all about being patient and just doing it slowly. You know? Rather than like rushing in and trying to fight them all at once. I need to stop- Now that I'm I've got the roll though, I'm like accidentally like double tap in circle and he's like literally rolling everywhere so I gotta be careful for that. What we got here? Bamboo. Um, is that it? Just a stack of bamboo. Alright, let's get the horse. Where is the horse? Is the horse here? I don't even know where my horse went. Alright, looks like we're going on foot. I don't know where my horse went, he fucked off. <clears throat> oh, I've got a bird. It's the golden bird. Wait a minute. Lads, this could be exciting. The horse was smart and left. What do you mean, Cherry? Investigate the area. So peaceful here. What is this place? Friends? A visitor. Lord Jin Loku will be pleased another warrior is here. Where's the, is the bird just leave, leading me to here? Is that it? I guess the birds are just like extra ways to get to quests. I thought you were Lord Jin Loku. Hello. You're another samurai. Welcome, my lord. Hello, peasant. Another samurai? You haven't heard of Lord Jin Loku? He's a legendary samurai. I'd like to meet him. Meh. When will he return? Soon. Join us for dinner. Perhaps he'll share one of his grand stories with you. The other side of honor. Uh, I'm back from my dangerous mission. Don't worry, I'm unharmed. Oh, I wasn't expecting a visitor. Hello. We're happy to have you, of course. Hmm. Thank you. I didn't realize any other samurai had survived. It was a fierce battle, wasn't it? The beaches of Komatsu ran red with blood that terrible day. We fought at Komoda. 
of course. Forgive me. I'm tired from a long ride. Yikes. Please, have Nabe show you the bath. We can speak more over dinner. Please follow me, my lord. Wait a minute. I don't know if I trust this. Am I going to end up getting executed? Where's the bath? Oh, not out here. That looks like How a... Much do you know of Lord General this looks like a privy. He tells us everything. If it wasn't for him, we would have lost the whole island. When you met him, was he armed? He gave everything to save Tsushima except his horse. <sighs> it's at the Seems stables. like this guy's a My fake. I want to look at his horse. Can I do anything with the campfire? Oh, nice. Where's the horse? Where's the horse? Where's the horse? Investigate the stables. Alright. Does he have a horse? A farm horse. Uh. Never seen battle. <laughs> Normal tools. Nothing out of the ordinary. He's been lying. Telling fibs. I know this saddle. It belonged to Lord Higuchi. Shinroku is no samurai. I'll get the truth from him. He's an imposter. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And he's just living here in the harem. Like a lord. I have to go now. Bye, Wolf. See you later. Bye, Ender. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Have a good night. Hope the studies go well later on. Where is Jinroku? He left quickly after you went to the bath. Yeah. It must have been important. I'll find him. I probably could look around here. Um, we probably look for supplies upstairs and stuff. Where did this motherfucker go? I'm looking for like clues to track this guy. Oh, come on, man. Where am I going, man? Is there like tracks out here? What the fuck, bro? Where is he? Did he go this way? How the fuck are you supposed to know where to go? There's like four ways in and out of this village and there's no tracks. Do you talk to someone or he couldn't have went he can't have went this way because that's the way we were at. Did he run away? Search the area. The winds are blowing like over here. I think I saw like a marker over in this area. Oh I think I see him. I think he's up there. Is that him? We need to talk. Just a fucking clue would have been nice. Like, just like a stop running, you fool! A marker or like a fucking set of foot. What the fuck was that? Stop! Before it's too late. Oh, I'm tired. I can't run. I feel like this guy's gonna have an accident and die. I don't want to kill you. Stop! Oh, carved out a hot spring. You need to come back here. Where did he go? Down here? Remind me to go back to the hot spring. Am I supposed to go up high? Back up the way? Oh, he's back up the top. Jesus Christ, dude. Hello. Hey, bud. Who? I challenge you to a duel! Oh, God. You want to fight me? Yes. It's the only way. If that's your wish, I accept. Jewel at the Kashin Onsen. 
Is this a boss? They're making it like a western stand though. To survive. You're impersonating a samurai and bringing dishonor to the name. And you're taking advantage of those women. I know. Please, my lord, let me live. I'll never go back there again. Leave. And if I ever see you wearing that armor again, we will finish our duel. I wonder if there's more to that quest. I should tell those women the truth. Return to the farm. One thing I want to do is uh where was that hot spring? Was that oh god. Something on fire up there. Where was the, the hot spring? Was it here? I'm terrible at navigating this fucking game, you know that? Is that it over there? I think that's it. Let me go over here and check this. I think if this is a proper hot spring, I think I can potentially use this to increase my max HP. <coughs> Yo, Quinn with 100 bits. Yo, my man, Quinn, what's up, dude? Out of nowhere. Hello. Thank you so much, bro. Welcome, sir. Quinn just casually supporting the stream without putting potatoes everywhere. Okay, I like it, yeah. Oh, ass cheeks. Some butt cheeks for Quentin. Don't mind me, just dropping bits for the homie. Thanks, man. Sensei or exhaustion? Let's uh, reflect on the sensei. Sensei Shikawa should visit this place. I wonder if he's ever relaxed in his life. <clears throat> he's strung tighter than his bowstring. There we go. Max HP increased. Nice. It's definitely going to help. A couple of those. We'll be a full-blown samurai warrior in no time. Just like that. I can rest again if I want, but I don't think there's a benefit in doing it twice, is there? Probably not. Okay. So we are going back to the ladies. Mars is coming back this time. Feels good, man. He does love me, chat. Oh, horse! Don't fall off. Quinn, thank you for the 100 bits. Soldering up a new drone, just taking a break right now. Nice, dude. A new drone. What kind of drone, Quentin? You mean like a... Do you actually mean like a like a camera drone for like shooting aerial footage and stuff? Forgive me for the silly question, but... Does he shave his ass? I didn't see any hair. Any ass hair. I think he's just naturally smooth. That's a, that's a possibility, guys. The game is definitely growing on me. Stop looking at my main character's ass chat. He is the last lord. Okay. Stop ogling his booty. Lord Sakai, welcome back. Hi. Camera John, yeah, the nice. You thought. He wasn't a samurai at all. Cool. Uh, he told you the truth. You knew he was lying? He seemed harmless, and we enjoy having him around. I hope you didn't kill him. He's alive, but he won't be coming back. I'll tell the others he left on an important mission. We were fine without him. We will be again. Okay. Done. Just like that. Easy peasy. Jesse says, not gonna lie, I wanna grab this game, but I'm quite poor. Jesse, you would have enough money to buy the game if you hadn't spent so much money on Genshin gems and Tim Horton's snacks every night. The People's Hope. Maximum health increase. Aye. All the HP. Choose a new ghost weapon. Uh, oh, I can actually select one. So I've got my kunai. Uh, we can take black powder bomb for explosions. Smoke bomb, causing enemies to lose sight of you. Sticky bomb or wind chime. Nah, that sucks. I think we go for the black powder bomb, honestly. Smoke bomb's tempting. 
I think I'll go for this. If I pack the Mongols' black powder into a clay pot, I can set it aflame and throw it as a weapon. Cool. All right, sweet. Just like that. Uh, L2 and left to select. And L2 and circle to equipped. L2 and R2 to throw. Cool. Charm of Shadows, Stealth Charm. Ranged weapon swapping, L2 and down to swap your ranged weapons, that's fine. So yeah, we'll put that away. Sweet. So what do we get for our troubles then? We've gotten some new gear. So if I go into my charms, we've got one spot. Charm of Shadows reduces enemy detection speed by 10%. Not really fascinating, but it'll do better than nothing, for sure. I still like to upgrade my uh, Tanto if possible, but yeah. All right, being able to hold more arrows would be great as well, actually. If I'm being completely honest, what we got accessory-wise, different ones. Need to sing it. Singing crickets needed to learn a new flute melody. Four. I didn't even see any crickets out on my ways, but uh, okay. What we got here, Plum Blossom, Sh uh, Plum Blossom Shrine, not complete yet. Melee Charm and Waxwood, I mean it's really close, we'll check it out. And then I think what we do is we head back and we start doing these missions again. We could f go all the way down here and do this. Tadayori's Armor, Moderate Legend Increase, we've also got Blood in the Grass for Ronin Attire. Did I get armor for doing that last quest or is it just the one I'm waiting? Just the one I'm wearing. Okay. Um, sure. Well, we're really close to something. Let's, uh... Wait, is it... Am I getting further away, or...? Honestly, I'm so bad at navigating this shit. Alright. Let's just leg it. Fuck it. Smooth bottom is unrealistic. I prefer the real deal. Some people have smooth bums, Sorian. Just because you've got a hairy bum doesn't mean that other people don't have smooth bums. Smooth bottom is attainable, if mildly uncomfortable. People stop taking ma stop talking man butts. I've had my dinner an hour ago. Cherry, listen, if you really want to talk about man butts, you just have to say the word, my dude. Don't have to hide it. We're all friends here. Beware the spider says Jin is a regular waxer. You guys, this is my man Jin you guys are talking about. Okay, he is important. Would you stop talking about his ass? You have arrived at your track location. Uh, is this the shrine here? So what am I doing? Getting to the top? Careful, my lord. This path is dangerous. Oh, she's wearing a Miko outfit. Hello. Talk to me. Dangerous for a samurai, but not a priestess. What are you doing here? There she is. My duty, tending the shrines. When the war ends, people will need these Torii gates to mark their path, so they can find the Shinto shrines Cubsy. and pray for the Kami's protection. We could use their protection now. <laughs> yes, but the paths are too treacherous. I tried to visit the nearby shrine, almost fell to my death. Maybe I can reach it. As a boy, I climbed every tree and cliff around my village. If you get there in one piece, pray for our island, and take an Omamori charm for yourself. Wear it close, and the charm will change your fate. And perhaps the fate of our home. Thank you. Okay, I didn't listen to anything she said Follow because... Follow the Torii gates. They will lead you to shrines all across our island, and the Omamori charms that rest there. I was, wasn't listening to what she was saying because Cubsy was asking about bananas. Okay, you guys not. Dude, look at that upper body strength, bro. Cubsy, how you been, man? Other than eating certain fruits. Okay. Dude, I like this, man. I feel like I'm playing Uncharted. Or Pitfall. Dude, look at this, man. We're going in style. Oop. Oop. 
Going good, going good, smooth, smooth. Okay, I think this is our Omamori Shrine. Is there uh, anything in here? Is this useful or? If any of you guys have ever played uh, Slay the Spire, guys, you, you actually get a Tori um, little uh, token thing, which is quite useful for reducing I think if you're about to take 5 damage or, or less, it reduces it to 1. And you actually get Omomori as well as a, a trinket as well, and that stops you from being cursed twice. Kinda cool. Honor the shrine. So it's like a little obs it's like a little obstacle course. Looks like there's some stuff at the top of that area as well. Pure Assassin's Creed here. Look at that black smoke though, that looks bad. Charm of the Kagu Tsushi. Uh, Kami of Fire. Okay, so what does that do for me? Let's have a look at our, uh, our gear. So right now I've got... That one's pretty good. Increases knocking and reloading. Didn't I just get a, a new one? Ah, here we go. Oh, so they fit in a specific slots, look. So, I've currently got reduced damage while at 15% or, or less. Deal bonus damage while at 50% or less. Ah, so when we get low, we can either take less damage or we can deal more damage. I think I like the idea of dealing more damage. We'll see if I come to regret that. But that's pretty cool. Hey, we're zoomed out. This is what I wanted earlier. I don't even want to know what you guys are doing over there, chat. What are you up to? Don't mind me just praying at shrines where you guys talk about weird stuff. Just a curiosity, what did's... <laughs> you guys are out of control, you know that, right? Read scroll. The only escape, there's nothing left for me here. My family is dead, my home is burned, my hope is lost. Oh man. Oh. Uh, so where do we want to go now? I say we head for this. Hmm. Yeah. I think that's fine. So is that in this direction? Oh god, it's so hard to see sometimes. Right, we're going to go down here. Hopefully not fall off the mountain. All right, raining it in. Okay, okay. <laughs> Sorry, you're, you're fine. <laughs> I appreciate the humor, my guy. Right, you guys are absolutely golden. You guys are fine. It's just sometimes when they cut. Here's the thing, chat. There's a lot of you guys who know where the line is, right? And I appreciate the humor, but some of you guys always take it too far, and then it enables all the other freaks to enable it too far. Okay, a lot of you guys are wild bastards. And you just kind of gas each other up, you know, it's always a, it becomes a case of who can push the chat the furthest. And sometimes it can start fun and I, you know, I'm having a good time, you guys are having a good time, but then it goes places that we can never come back from, okay? So sometimes it's better if we just, you know, break a little early, just to be careful and relax, eh? <laughs> Thanks in advance for understanding. So oh, I just nearly stabbed my horse. Right, while you guys are doing your thing, I'm just going to continue driving my pony. Let's go but on. you guys are golden. Love you guys. These are just a bit hyphy, that's all. Are these bad guys or good guys? We could talk to these people. But I don't think I care. Alright, we're driving, traveling back across the land. Let's go. Bananas are only for consumption, says, says Cubsy. You guys can do with bananas as you please in your in your own time. That is absolutely fine. Just maybe keep keep those the private details to yourself. <laughs> I 
Anyways, everybody having a good night? Having a casual Monday, guys. Yeah? Looks like there's some place people to talk to here. Um, where are we at? There's some things to do here if we want to. Uh, I say we just... I think we just continue on our destination. I'm getting Witcher... I'm getting Witcher 3 vibes from the kind of lighting that's going on here. You know when you turn up at the, at the village at night time and the moon's out? This is very Witcher 3. Feels good. Fully clothed hot tub stream. I refuse to see Jack and... Why are you guys talking about hot tubs again? You guys talked about hot tubs for like 20 minutes yesterday. What is it with you guys? So when... Oh, it was Cubsy again. Okay, Cubsy, you just... Here to completely destroy things today, I see. Fucking hot tub stream questions. Guys, listen, I don't... I don't have a... I don't have a fucking hot tub. We need a hot tub to do a hot tub stream. You guys are aware, right? I'm not just going to do a bath stream. That would be weird. Okay? I've seen some of those. They're never really that appealing. I think you need to be extremely attractive to make that work. And, you know, we're not, we've not we not quite got that together yet. So if you guys wouldn't mind... Is that a bear? What the fuck? Oh shit. No! Save me! Wait, are you enemies? I don't have any fucking arrows! This has got to stop. Fucking hell. Let me, uh, can I harvest the bear? I thought those guys were good guys. New resource found. Nice. Yeah, I'm coming, Fox. Calm down. You led me into a fucking bear ambush, you dumbass. Pray to the Fox. The Frog Shrine. Please don't fuck me in advance. Thanks. New charm slot, baby. Pet the doggo. Let me pet the fucking fox. Okay, nice. Okay, listen, mate. Listen, buddy. You ever fucking lead me into the bear den again, I will literally slap your ass. Don't make me get the bananas out. What is a hot tub but a bathtub with hot water in it? I think we have different definitions of a hot tub, guys. I think we have different, like, concepts and understandings. Bath with a straw. We've already discussed this. Fairy liquid for a bubble bath. Guys, that would bleach my fucking skin. Do you get hot tubs in Scotland? Ask beware the spider. We do, yeah. You just kind of have to have a decent amount of money to afford one. If you want to get a good one, that is. There we go. Nice. Yeah, you get hot tubs. You do get hot tubs in Scotland, for sure. Some of my friends have hot tubs. Um... You guys know Jamie, right? Jamie's got a nice hot tub. A very nice hot tub. But, uh... You, you have to you have to save up to get one, guys. They're, they're pretty expensive. Not exactly on budget for the wolf pack at the moment. Asking the philosophical questions here, says Cubsy. Alright, where are we going? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We get to use hot tubs in Scotland maybe twice a year. Yeah, only when we visit our cool friends. We can hire a cabin in the woods with a hot tub for an outside stream. This is getting more and more extravagant, chat. I don't know. If we hire a, a cabin with a hot tub, that's still going to cost us money. Probably quite a bit of money. We looked at lodges recently. That's why you get a gazebo. <sighs> oh, a new quiver. Can that... Can that... My lord. Anything to offer Range from capacity your upgrades, yeah, dude. Arrows. I'm sorry. I need more for that. Oh, I need predator hides. Yikes. I'd like that though. Quick fire capacity upgrades. Could I? Okay. Thank you. So if I can hunt more predators, I can actually do something there. Maybe the. 
Maybe this guy can trade me. Nah. He's just upgrades. He's vanity stuff. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. Well, if we see any more bears chat, maybe we can kill some bears. Hi, buddy. Is this where I was supposed to be? This, uh... Yeah, this is actually the camp I was looking for. Hello. My lord, are you heading to join the rest? What do you mean? I've heard of a small resistance group gathering in Azomo Prefecture. There are others fighting back against the Mongols? Brave. But dangerous if they're not trained. I'll find them. Mrs. Wolfie, stop, in stop encouraging the chat. We're not getting a blow-up paddling pool. There's nowhere to put that and you know it. What did we just get from that? What was our notification? Was that in journal? Uh, is there any close by? Or are they all the way? I didn't actually realize the island was so big. Fuck's sake. Um, for Tsushima. Um, what do we want to do, guys? Do we go back and help this guy again? I feel like the quests are going to just get harder and harder. But I'm kind of interested in doing this quest line for the time being and feel a bit invested in it. We could go and speak to some other people further down if we wanted. Or we could do one more of these. I say we do one more of these. Yeah, if we're in the area, why the fuck not? Seven hundred meters away though. I'll jump down here and then get on my horse. How's the Japanese voice acting? Ask Cubsy. Well, we're list we're playing the game in English, Cubsy, but the Japanese accents for the English um, dialogue is really good. I'm enjoying it so far. This is ingenuity. Just have beans for dinner, and you don't even need the straw. So still hot tub. You said it yourself. Checkmate. Why are you guys? Quickly, no You don't put a baby in a tub of hot water. Wait a minute. Are you guys debating what what contributes a hot tub? Chat. I always pick the language that the lip sink in or I get triggered. Yeah, I've heard that, Cubsy. We made that decision at the beginning. We were I didn't know if I wanted to play in Japanese or English. But people were saying that the English audio is actually better suited to the lip sync. Don't know if that's true or not. I haven't compared for myself, mate, but that's that's what people were saying. Make of that what you will. I know some people are gonna differentiate on that, which is cool, I don't mind. Cat, I'm a kitty cat. And I dance, 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 and I dance, 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 dance. Gajin? I'm a kitty cat. Oh, no. I dance, 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 and I dance, dance, dance. Sekiro, I would probably roll with Japanese. This Cubsy. We played Sekiro in Japanese, yeah. That's what we did as well. I agree, my guy. Gajin, welcome. Gajin, the fact that you've entered the chat with, with a sound alert makes me worried. Gajin, you're not planning anything wild today, are you? Nothing crazy, eh? Think of the children as Renny. Hi, Gajin. What am I doing here? Is this, uh. Oh, this is my archery dojo guy. Yeah, 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 of course. Right, let's get involved with this dude. Hey, man. What's up? Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Yoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave. Or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? A few archers at strategic points can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Gajin says, don't be worried, I am out of bits. Tomoe was a good student. Welcome, Gajin. It's nice Truth. to see you. We're fighting Hope you're having a good night. We will turn that to our advantage. Here we go. The pass never passes. With a crack of thunder in the back, very, very thematic. Come. <sighs> Guys, what are you even talking about? 
Follow Ishikawa. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe. Oh, is that some linen? We want to control movement in and out of Yoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? Uh, am I supposed to look or? Oh. <laughs> All right, we put archers here. It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. Archers there would be wasted. Phil. Okay, what about here? That path behind the inn. No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. Okay, what about over here? A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. Oh, he liked that. Is that us? We got one more? Okay, wait. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. Yep. Oh, and? The road south runs along a high ridge. Perfect place to rain down arrows. Tomoe would agree. There's hope for you. Let's go hunting. Nice. Okay, reach the uh, coastal road. We go and... See, this is the thing. When the wind blows, I can't tell if I'm walking away from it or, like, towards it. Uh, I guess I've got... I've only got six arrows, and there's arrows here, but, like, I can't take any more. I think I'm going this way. Sounds like my sensei just fucking broke his leg trying to get down. Sensei, you gonna what be alright? did you teach Tomoe? I held that nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. It was time to retire, and the hot spring suited me. Uh, why, why would you never you retire? You would never willingly retire. I see. So what's your My uncle said you became close to a commoner, and Lord Nago was forced to cover it up. <laughs> Your uncle has an interesting sense Arrows of humor. are heavy. You weren't forced out? A samurai always has a choice. Is the ginger an infant? Are you guys talking about me? Life? Mastery of the bow is mastery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy guys, of Guys, you can't call me the ginger. The we talked about this the other week. And also, I'm not an infant. We're I'm older close. than probably most of you Eyes guys. Open. You creeps. Here's me just trying to enjoy myself in feudal Japan, you know. Let's help their killers follow them across you the guys are talking about river. weird shit. Standoff. Wait, what? Standoff? Where? Ziv, stand and fight me! Fuck, here we go. Come on, buddy. Water stance is effective against shield men. Yeah, we know chat. Or we know game, thanks. Hold R2 and circle to switch to water stance. I'm already in I'm already in water st You fucking skank. Give me that arrow I wasn't here. Keep moving. Can't believe that last dickhead hit me. That was a clean fight otherwise. Arrows. Give me these. Okay. Six arrows. All those innocent dead. Tomorrow what difficulty are you playing? We're playing on hard mode, Copsy. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, well. Feels nice on hard mode. Feels challenging but not annoying. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Feels I need now to use like all my tools as well to like survive on hard mode. Kindness can be useful, even to a warrior. Who told you that? Sun Tzu? My uncle. And he didn't tell me. He showed me. Mercy creates a debt. Your uncle showed mercy to people who pose no danger to him. A safe bet. Okay. 
Alright. Here's the bridge. Oh, we've been here before. Ambush! What the fuck? To find. Go. Oh, wasn't so bad. Kind of want to try my bombs. I'm gonna try these at some point. Give me these back. How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow. Am I really and supposed to go to down me? here? You didn't turn her away. I tried. I guess so. But she sank arrow after arrow into my target. I've never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Or wrong. It would have been useless in a real fight. She had no what fear the of missing a shot. Fuck, dude. Am I going she this way? Hesitated. A warrior's spirit. No. The killers. I didn't see until it was too late. I'm gonna see if I can use this bomb to my advantage. Okay. I gotta be careful because I don't have a lot of health left. I guess I gotta like aim higher when I'm fighting. I gotta aim way higher. Arrows are full. I don't think this was actually supposed to be the uh I don't think this is a fight I was looking for, was it? Did I just go the wrong way completely? The whole time? Dude, I don't know man, honestly, in a game like this, some people will play this and have no problem, but I just kind of wish it would just give me an arrow, honestly, like a, a soft arrow on the ground or something. See this fucking wind shit, even with the enhanced like directions turned on, I think it's fucking useless. It's like, it's not bad, it's, it's just like really annoying, like, they've tried to like give you a navigation system that makes sense and oh shit. Sorry, horse. No, 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 no. Trying to give you a navigation system that makes sense and is thematic to the game. But holy fuck, dude. Did I? I'm still doing the quest, right? I've lost the guy that was with me. What's even happening? Am I still doing this quest? Reach the road south. Oh, I am, but it's just like... Hello, AJ. I don't hate the horses. It's just normally on games... I think on Skyrim... I think... No, Skyrim I was playing with the keyboard, actually. 
Show me your skill. Some enemies will uh, and I stand off will attempt to trick you with a faint attack. Oh. Okay. A faint attack. Oh, okay. I need to aim higher with my bow for the headshots. I don't think this is where I was supposed to go, was it? Am I still fighting? It says defeat the Mongol, the, Mo the Mongols, but... Oh, that's reinforcements, I think. Stance. Let's go. What the fuck? Where are you going? Swords, arrows, possibly fireworks. You know the name is Kawa. I do. I have message. Speak, Sensei. All of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori now. Silence. <laughs> Killer observed more leaders to unlock one stand seven. Damn. <sighs> Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. <clears throat> we'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight. Done. Quest over. I don't actually know what we get for that quest. I think it's like another charm, is it? The past never passes. Alright, we don't get enough for a, a level up here, but... We get a ranged charm. Is that better than the one we had? We get some silk as well. Charm of efficiency. Moderate increase to arrow damage. Oof. Yeah, dude, I'll take that. I think I'll take that. Sure. So that's another quest done. Don't really like this as well. See, once you finish the quest, and it gives you this kind of animation where you're stuck for five seconds. I don't know if that's like a loading thing or what, but it's kind of annoying. Don't really get that. We could keep. I kind of like this guy's quest line with the Tomoe stuff. Like, I kind of want to get in more involved with this while we're here. Um. But at the same time, we could go and explore some other things instead. We could go all the way down south and have a look at this, maybe. Some There are some Asimov who want to fight back against the Mongols, but they're not samurai. I think we just go for this. We came back up to do this guy's quest. Maybe we do another one? While we're here? I kind of like the idea of defending the, this area, the, the springs. I actually really like this. Like This is a good starting quest line. It feels cosy. As much as I get lost every now and then. Did I miss any seppukuing before I joined? We've seppukued a couple of times. No, unless I... Nope, unless you mean Jack playing casually. Cherry, were you always toxic or did you have to learn it? We've died a couple of times, Cubsy, if that's what you're asking. We've died a few times. 
I died once in the opening area. And then there was a canyon area where it was like a mini quest, it wasn't a main quest. We were fighting across a rope bridge and there was archers on both sides of the canyon and I died there like three times while I was trying to make my dinner. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's go talk to this guy again. Kind of down for doing these ones over and over again. This guy seems like an interesting fellow. I didn't really like him at first, but I'm starting to like it. I, I kind of want to. I kind of want to meet Tomoe. Sakai. I think you're supposed to go and do other things before you, you know, do a lot of these in a row. But I quite like this. The way of the bow. Guys, who's up for a game of we drink a shot each time Jack dies? Threat against Yoshi Springs before it's too late. At your own peril, boys. I'll take no responsibility. Come. Although I was drinking I was tonight myself. There. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. Because <laughs> they're so fucking troll. Humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or we allow the Mongols to take it. Domoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it. Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Fine, Sakai. She will attack from the north. We should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? Ambush. One arrow, one death. Oh, I don't have any. Dude, there's so many bushes here. Dude, I like how she's got like a whole fucking army at her disposal now. The fight with Tomoe is gonna be epic. I like that this this uh, level started off with straight combat immediately. That's what was to kill us. She would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Here she springs. The attack is starting. Okay, where's my arrows? I've got none. This but way. we're in a fucking archery dojo, like, is there not anywhere to, like, top up my arrows here? Surely he would have arrows close by, man. Is there some, like, out on the ledge or the porch or something? Please tell me I can get some arrows from in here. None from the dead bodies? Supplies? Oh, here we go, please. Can, can I take these, please? Sensei, listen, my arrows are quite important to my survival, but I, I need some. Can you give me some of yours? You've got lots, right? Oh, this fucking useless bastard. If I fall today, promise me you will keep hunting Tomoe. Mikey says that's me calling it a night with the report cards. Better go check on the missus. Cheers promise, for the stream to catch you. Uh, cheers for the stream, mate. Catch you soon. Thanks, Mikey. Appreciate, the appreciate the uh, the lark, man. Thanks for hanging out. Tomoe strike? In the back town. Near the water legend. The most vulnerable point. If we get there before the Mongols, we can prepare a defense. But it won't be easy. It never is. Yeah. Uh, sometimes I find myself changing stance when the spear guys come running in. And the thing is with the spear guys is like, see if you fuck up the first stab, they, they immediately stab again. So you can actually get like double hit by the spear guys because if you fuck up the, the first dodge and then they go again and you're too busy trying to counterattack because you think you've dodged the first one properly, they'll actually stab you and then stab you. It's like a perpetual kind of rhythm of death. 
which is a bit fucked. You two, come here. I need arrows. What is it, my lord? <sighs> Mongols are heading for Hiroshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. Okay. I'm ready. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. Arrows. Come on, yes. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Uh, are we scanning the area? Okay. So are they coming down Not the hill? Many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Those barrels could do some damage. The beehive. Hornets' nests. Excellent distraction. And then we've also got the lantern. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. I don't have fl Take these flaming arrows. Oh. And try not to burn yourself or me. Flaming arrows. Shot by the half bow, ignites enemies, cloth, and dry grass. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. The Mongols will be here soon. I'm ready. You're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. Where are they? They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, says they. Fucking, you must be kidding me. Not that. I'm ready for more. So are they. Coming down the main road. I've got them. Oh my god, that guy's insane. This guy's actually putting me to shame right now. Fuck. Stood in one. The sensei is actually just killing more than I am. Wait. Oh god. Where did that guy come from? No sign of Tomoe. She'll come. More on the way. Got it. What? Wait, the flaming arrow doesn't fucking... Where did that guy come from? Jesus Christ. I got, I definitely got. I gotta get fucking uh, upgraded quiver ASAP, man. The fucking eight arrows bullshit is like doing my nuts in right now. Uh, that was intense. We just killed a lot of guys. Okay, that was pretty good, man. Landing the sh the headshots when they're running is actually like the best feeling, man. Woo! Hold on, mate. Honestly, the sensei was killing fucking more than I was, I think. He fucking slaughtered them. 
Uh, hello, can I? There we go. That was a good uh, level. There she is. That's Tomoe burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Skank. Uh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. What bitch? She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion. Finally, says Cubsy, an NPC pulling their own weight. I said that earlier. But only the NPCs in this game are actually quite useful. Then. The girl at the beginning was good as well. I forgot what her name was. Hironori but she was good too. Fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoe all of this. I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again. But like everything else, she turned it against me. Turned the winds against us. I've been there. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago. And you won't change Tomoe. But today, you saved the people of Hiyoshi Springs. Hell yeah. You're my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours. But Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. Alright, done. We have the bow finitoed. Cool. I actually uh, I missed out having the uh, the charm in that fight, the the one that actually speeds up the rate at which you can shoot your arrows, and I put on more damage instead. Charm of Immunity, Defense Charm. Sounds kind of OP. Storming Falcon, uh, half bow die. Let's have a look at some of this. Let's have a look at the gear first, the charm. 15% chance for uh, enemy arrows to deal no damage, that's terrible. I'm never going to put that on. 15% is such a low number and even then the arrows don't hit that often. That probably would get effect. I think this would t come into efficiency maybe like once every fucking, I don't know, like 10 hours of gameplay or something. That'd be pretty bad. Let me have a look at my weapons here. A few upgrades, bow options, half bow. Oh, here we go, burning fang. That looks a bit like a snake, which I'm scared of. Fuck it, okay, let's go with it. Alright, fine. Yeah, I need to upgrade my uh, my quiver so that I can hold more arrows, because the eight arrows is like weak sauce, dude. It's so bad. But I need to kill more predators if I want to see more of that. And I don't know where I'm going to get predators. I am going to set my marker down for here, and we're going to go to that. We're going to leave this quest line for now. I actually think it may have been hidden. I think it's actually been hidden, the, the rest of that quest line. Or if it's there, I can't see it because... Yeah, I don't know. Hidden Springs Forest? I wonder if there actually is another spring there, other than this. Probably not. Okay. My uh, glasses are kind of pinching my nose a little bit, guys. I feel like there's a lot of tension there. Okay. Um. Wait, who are you? Lord Sakai, I studied poetry with your uncle. Oh, hello. The Mongols have taken Lord Shimura captive. Mm -hmm. He will endure. He is strong and resilient, skilled in the art of combat and poetry. Do you practice haiku, my lord? There's no time during war. Haiku. War is the reason to make time. Haiku allows one to concentrate, eliminate chaos. To find peace. Precisely. My favorite place to ride lies atop the cliff. 
It is one of many such places. If you look, you will find inspiration all across Tsushima. This guy's like the 50 cent of Japan. Places like this one, untouched by war. Bars. Look for the birds. They will show you the way. Uh, Hayoshi Haiku. Is uh anywhere close by or not complete headband of serenity? Oh, I don't know if we can be doing that. Don't know if we can be doing that and wearing any of that trash. <laughs> Gotta go do some yard work. Been a pleasure as always. Alright, come see, take it easy, man. Have fun, man. Good luck with the, the yard work. Whereabouts is that? Over here? Compose haiku. That should be fun. Alright, sword down. Reflect on serenity. <laughs> Wait a minute. Clear skies and clear mind. A cool bed beneath the stars. Protected from the harsh sun. Swaying freely in the wind. Nah, dude, I love the idea of that. A cool bed beneath the stars. A sturdy defense, growing ever strong. I like the idea of growing ever strong. Okay. Clear skies and clear mind. A cool bed beneath the stars. Growing ever strong. Beautiful. Was right. My spirit feels at peace. Strong. I well. should compose more poems. Hell yeah, dude. Clear skies, clear mind, a cool bed beneath the stars growing ever strong. There you go, dude. Strange place, welcome to the stream. Hi. Don't mind us, we're just uh, creating some haikus. You know how it goes. Woo! Right. Triangle's not the menu button, I need to figure that out eventually. So we got a new headband. Let's have a look at this. Right now we were wearing this piece of shit, but now we have... Yeah. Headband of Sereni. Strenty carriers. Now if we die, it's your fault, okay? Thanks. Ninja clan, here I stand. Oh, I can upgrade my uh, armor as well, actually. Ah, that'd be cool. We can actually get some armor on us instead of being, like, half naked. I just need some more supplies. Cool. I like how everything can be upgraded. That's so cool. Me likey. Okay, so... There we go, just like that, dude. Um, done some haikus. Now I feel like we go this way. Head down. We could head up more north and do some other things around here. I mean, this is close. What is that? Let's have a look. I'm kind of... Okay, put the sword down, you freak. We're going this way. Up into the mountains. It's 400 meters away, which is... Quite far. I think we're going to need the horse. Come here. Good horse, no. Just finished playing Red Dead Redemption 2 and I really dislike- Wait, what? A Strange Play says, just finished playing Red Dead Redemption 2 and I really disliked it. Um, but also can't get enough of the story, it's a really conundrum when it comes to trying to evaluate my experience. Well, how far into the game are you, A Strange Place? I- I played Red Dead Redemption 2 and I absolutely loved it. That- that is such a powerful story. How- f how deep into the game are you? I beat it and finished the epilogue. You didn't enjoy it? Oh no, strange place, I'm so sorry. That sucks. Roll your blades. Let me kill these men in your honor. Gotta be real careful here. Fuck. He baited me. Shit, this is looking a bit dice. Where's my fucking arrows, dude? Why did he never shoot? What's it doing? What the fuck was that? F 
fucking so annoying, dude. I don't know what's going on sometimes, man, when I do... Sometimes when I'm like, I aim my bow and I hold R2 and then he's just standing there like that doing nothing. I don't know what happened there. It was really weird. Um, yeah, that sucks. I thought Red Dead Redemption 2 was a fucking phenomenal game. I played that for a long time on stream with you guys. We did a, we did a very long playthrough of that. We did like all the, all the hunts. We did the story, we did a lot of the side content, we did all the, yeah, we went around and caught all the legendary animals and did all that stuff. I, I thought it was brilliant. You're going to be alright. I thought no samurai survived the battle at Komoda. They caught me at the crossroads north of Tsutsu. They take everyone who passes by. They're controlling their roads to capture travelers and put them to work. Is there anything that can stop them? I'll try. Damn. But avoid that crossroads for now. What what did you play on a strange place? Did you play it with the, did you play it on the console or did you play it on the PC or you feel the game is poorly designed and incredible I mean don't get me wrong guys like sometimes I play games that everybody loves and I think they're they're shit but like Red Dead Redemption Two was that was up there dude for me that was up there that was up there with the Titans I thought the game looked beautiful I thought the writing was amazing the story was good the gameplay was solid. I didn't feel like it was poorly paced, but you know how that you know how you constantly move around in the camps from place to place. But then again, it's been a long time since I played it, so I don't know. We played it over the course of like many many days, and we played it for many many hours a day. So I don't know. It's not even like I got some games. I do feel suffer from pacing issues, whereas that game, I I never felt bored. Mm, an incredibly large map with no reliably fast way to traverse it. Well, you've got your horses, right? Did you get the Did you get the special horse from the north of the map? The white ones, they're really fast. If you get a fast horse, it helps. Or if you just fast travel everywhere, it helps, I guess. Play it on PC. Did you play with a keyboard and mouse or with a controller, a strange place? I never thought I'd be free again. Hey, you're welcome, dude. I got fucked up by those bandits, by the way. They kicked my fucking ass. I think they leaned too much on the realism and missed a lot of the fun. What do you guys mean? Like, can you give me examples? Didn't like how the main character was caught that disease close to the end and died from it. Alright, Cherry, I guess we're full on spoiler territory. Spoiler territory there. It was far too fast. No, I don't think it was fast at all. I don't know what you guys are smoking. The, there's no way that the, the disease that Arthur catches is far too fast. He, he gets it from an early point of the game and they build up to it as you play through the main story. It doesn't just happen like he gets the disease and then the next hour he drops dead. It's, it's built up over many, many days, many, many weeks. To understand this is a hot take, so I'm open to someone giving me a new perspective. No, I mean, the thing is, like, if you didn't enjoy it, Strange Place, you didn't enjoy it, yeah? I'm, I'm not going to try and convince you. I just try and understand, like, people's perspectives. Because, like I said, guys, I watch movies sometimes, I read books, I, I listen to music that people tell me you know oh you gotta you gotta play this it's god tier i would put red dead redemption 2 up there in like my top 10 games of all time i feel like it's like that video game is beyond so many other video games like if if i guess it depends what you're looking for and what makes you happy when you play games right because some people want challenge some people want like story some people want you know romance it, it depends what you're into as a, as a like a video game player but I felt like Red Dead 2 was like, it had a lot of stuff, it had funny, it had funny moments, it had personality, it had a huge open world for you to explore, side content, secrets, uh, twists in the story, you know, it's not, it's not like the story was like super, uh, you know, unexpected in certain regards, but there was a couple of twists that things happened where characters died or, you know, people were shot and I didn't expect it, it kept me on my toes, and uh, yeah, I don't know. Keyboard and mouse. You play so you played Red Dead. You played on a keyboard and mouse. Having to clean up my gun. Having to clean my gun. Clean my horse. Need to wash myself fairly often. When the when the nearest town has a hotel to clean myself is fifteen minutes horse ride away. Having your character handicapped later on in the game, rapidly losing weight and shit. But those sound like cosmetic problems. A strange place. I mean, cleaning your gun. I don't even remember doing that. 
cleaning your horse. You mean like where you dust your horse down and it undusts? I think I remember that vaguely. But these are like these aren't these are like visual things that you have problems with. So like, it might be that uh, you've completed the game now, right? And you've finished it, so you're not gonna likely go back to it anytime soon. But maybe like mods or something might have sorted that. Maybe there is like mods to stop the horse getting dirty, or like there's uh, things to slow down the rate at which you have to clean your gun or something. But I don't even remember. You you know you can just get the brush in your inventory. Just wipe the horse down, right? And it, you know, you do it like once, twice, and then the horse is clean. If you don't clean your horse, then the health and stamina core depletes. I mean, I I honestly don't even remember doing that. That's not. I feel like if there was things that annoyed me about Red Dead Two, um, sometimes I had issues when trying to climb onto the horse when I was trying to put guns away and stuff. That that kind of pissed me off but then I kind of got used to it sometimes I would take guns onto my character and carry them, carry them around and then you know how you can only take like one main rifle with you at a time when you're like getting off the horse sometimes that would kind of fuck up but don't watch yourself people constantly remark about how dirty you are well normally in the game don't you normally only get dirty if you like end up falling off your horse into the mud or something or if you end up falling into a stream do you get like if you end up rolling about in the ground you'll get dirty I guess. <laughs> I mean, I guess that could be a problem, but in the grand scheme of the game, I, I don't know. Like, if I was... I don't know if... The, like, if I was playing... I'm trying to think of, a, like, a comparative example. Like, I, I don't know if that would, like, bother me, but I don't, I don't even remember. Like, I don't even remember that being a thing where I was playing and I thought people told me I was stinky all the time or anything like that. Mm -hmm. You get dirty over time, yeah. Okay, okay. But I didn't... Isn't there, like, moments in the story if you're doing the quest where, like, the character... Your character will refresh himself? Or if you get up in the morning from the save file, like, let's say you turn on the computer and you boot up your game and you load the game. Maybe there's differences been I mean, I played, I played on console, right? So there might have been differences between the PC port or maybe there was updates since I played it on console or whatever. I don't know, but... Like, when I booted up the game, like... Having to clean my gun, clean my horse. The nearest town has a hotel to clean myself is 15 minutes horse right away. <laughs> you can clean yourself. Can you clean yourself in the camp? Isn't there like a wash basin in the camp where you can like trim your beard and wash your face and change your clothes? And you can also brush down your horse wherever you are because you've got the little brush in your inventory. I don't know. I I I, I don't know. I'm I'm Do you know what? Like like I said, guys, if you if Strange place. I'm not trying to argue with you, by the way, because there's nothing worse. You know when you come into, you know when you go somewhere on the internet or like you talk to your friends and you're, you, you know, you watch a movie and you've heard it's great and you're like, dude, this game pissed me off so much, and then all your friends go, oh no, I loved it. You kind of feel a bit resentful. You're like, fuck you then, <laughs> you know. But I, so I don't want to be that guy that argues because, like I said, if you, uh, if you didn't enjoy it, you didn't enjoy it. But oh man, like. Maybe it was just because I was playing Red Dead 2 with the stream and maybe because we did it like every day for like a month. It was kind of like a journey that everybody went through together. Those are the people that were watching the stream that is. You're going to see uh, some butt cheeks here chat. Don't miss it. Don't miss the butt cheeks. Oh, smooth as moonshine. Are we reflecting on Red Dead 2? Freedom, of Sh Freedom with Shimura. Or a Yuna, let's reflect on Yuna. Oh, hell yeah. Saved from the battlefield by a thief. <laughs> what will my uncle think of Yuna? Hmm. HP, baby. Just like that. Easy peasy. I just got back, says Anne. What are we talking about? We're talking about Red Dead Redemption 2, Anne, and what people thought about it. Throughout the whole game, they're they're like you're gonna catch a cold dressed like that, you daft monkey. I I did a strange place. I don't know if that was PC only or something. I genuinely don't remember people talk like I don't even think once when I played Red Dead Two did anybody comment on how unclean I was. I honestly don't remember. Maybe if I went through because we have our whole let's play right on YouTube of Red Dead Two. Maybe if I went back and booted it up and watched it for like half an hour, I would see somebody comment on how dirty my character was. But I don't even remember anybody ever saying that to me. Maybe it was just... 
I don't know, because the thing is, I had the game, maybe I had the game turned down a little bit, and because I was, like, talking to the chat while, like, travelling, I wouldn't notice it, but maybe playing with the chat around is so much more fun, says Fractian, yeah. Maybe, maybe you guys took my mind off it and I didn't notice, but... Oh, I'm sorry, I honestly, Strange Place, listen, I'm really sorry you didn't enjoy it that much. It feels bad, because I've, I've recommended Red Dead 2 to so many people, and, uh, you know, I just do it... There's some games that I wouldn't recommend to people, right? Because I know that they're specifically unique to a genre of people. But I know that the team at Rockstar has so much money and Red Dead 2 is like a fantastic Western cowboy experience. I mean, you're not going to play a better cowboy game than that in the modern era. And probably not for the next 10 years, you know, unless they make a Red Dead 3. And so when I recommend that to people, I always do it totally carefree. You know, I don't ever think about the fact that they might go play it and hate it. Um, so I'm I'm truly sorry it wasn't a, it wasn't your cup of tea, Fractine. It's good to see you. What's up? Welcome. I uh, hope you're all doing great. It's Cactuar's here. It says Suteki Dene. <laughs> well, because my guy's dipping in the hot spring. <laughs> I love the story so much. I felt like the game itself held it back. So what would you have? So I don't mean to. I'm not. I'd please strange place, right? Friendly, friendly to friendly chats, right? What would you have liked to have seen different then? If you were to make five, no, let's not even make it complicated. If you were to change three things about Red Dead Redemption 2 to make it more enjoyable for yourself, what would you do? You would stop your character from getting dirty as fast? Or would you make the horses faster to deal with the travelling problem that you had? Like, what would what would you change about the game? Like, just three things. And that question's open to anybody, by the way. Anybody who played Red Dead 2 or remembers Red Dead 2. Yeah... You just gotta be in a cowboys to be like Red to to like Red Dead says Sign Ghost Rider. Yeah, maybe. The thing is, guys, I hadn't played. I, I played like the tiniest, tiniest opening sequence of Red Dead One. So when I played Red Dead Two with you guys, it was uh, it was my first kind of time, um, you know, playing a cowboy game in a long time. Back in the days of the PS2, I played a game called Gun. Do you guys remember the the game Gun? It had the kind of yellow artwork. That was the, the kind of last kind of major cowboy game I played before Red Dead 2, but I, I I thought it was up there. I thought it was like God tier. It had like a nice balance of everything. You get your money's worth as well from the game, which, uh, you know, in my opinion, a lot of games don't, don't give you these days. You buy a game, you know, and then it's done in like six to ten hours, and then you're just like, man, paid like 50 bucks for this. Hmm. I did feel, um, one thing I could criticise, maybe, uh, if I'm really nitpicking, right? You know what, after, uh, you, after Arthur goes away, we'll say, and after you move on to the John Marston story, at the kind of, the kind of epilogue kind of area, where you play as John, I felt like that kind of was longer than I expected it was going to be, but I guess they were just trying to set up John for the beginning of Red Dead 1, which comes after Red Dead 2, you know, Red Dead 2 is a prequel, Red Dead 1 comes after Red Dead 2, despite the, the out of order sequencing. And so maybe they were just setting... Maybe they were just setting up the... You know, the, the starting of the first game or something, I don't know. Hey, Drofig, what's up? Can't wait to play this one. Yeah, this one's a good one. So far, Drofig, it's been really... It's been really fun. Uh... Oh, is this... What does that say? Tory gates lead to Mending Rock. Oh, okay. I think if I follow that, uh... Oh, no, I can't get on my fucking horse. I think if I follow the gates all the way to the top of the mountain, there's something to find there. Alright, we're just gonna go on a long journey here, guys. We're gonna... We're gonna avoid the Mongols. We're not gonna fight these guys. We're just gonna run past them. Hopefully I don't get shot off. There's also Red Dead Revolver that came out before Red Dead 1. Yeah, I remember Red Dead Revolver as well, yeah. I didn't actually ever play that game or see gameplay of it, but I remember I remember seeing it in the store. Random thing, have you ever played Days Gone? Ask uh, Move37. No, I haven't, but I've been... I was thinking about it. I missed Days Gone when it was free on PlayStation Plus, though. I think it was one of these games that they gave away with PS Plus, and I actually never, I never grabbed it. But I've heard Days Gone is good. I think that'd be a quite a chill stream game for us to play at some point. 
it would be one of these games like Ghost of Tsushima, like Red Dead Redemption 2, where, you know, you could race, probably race through the main story really fucking fast if you wanted to. But if you're gonna just relax and play through the game, it's, it's a nice stream game, I think. Looks like there's a lot of drama going on in there, I don't know if I... I don't know if I want to get involved in that. Do we have uh, skill points, by the way? We do. I know what one I want to take. I would like to take uh, this standoff streak. Press triangle or square as they're swinging. So we kill one and then... Does it go into another one? Yeah, we're going to take this. There we go. Keep going. Mm-hmm. Gun was a great game, I do remember, yeah. Gun was good, yeah. I, I think Gun was actually like the kind of... The main kind of... Uh, may, may have been inspiration for like Red Dead Redemption, I think. Gun was a fantastic PS2 game. Wasn't very long, but I, I had a lot of fun with that. Um, Strange Play says, one, I would revamp the health and stamina core system, like constantly trying to take care of myself when my horse got in the way of getting to do the things I wanted to do in the game. Okay. Um, two, I would make either the map smaller or make fast travel easier. Too many times the game wanted me to go from St. Dennis to Rhodes or to Valentine or Beaver Creek and it was such a hassle. Um, horses being a relatively fast means of travel but having the ratio of the speed of the horses to the size of the map. Okay. Not being ideal. No, no, I got you, I got you. Okay. Did, did you, uh, Strange, I don't know if you've replied to this, but did you ever get the white horse that's up the north? I think they're, I think they're called Arabian horses or something. They're really, really small and they're, they're pure white and you get them up in the snow. Did you ever get one of those? It's, it's right up the north of the map. It's actually next to the, there's a part of the game where, like, there's a, a lake that's frozen over and there's, like, bears and stuff around it. I think you track, like, the great moose next to that lake. You actually see the, the Arabian horses up there. If you get one of those, you can keep it. It's the fastest horse in the game. That that made a huge deal for me. So maybe that would have made your travelling problems a little bit easier, but I don't know. I, I like I'm a bit of a I'm gonna I'm not gonna lie. Like I am a bit of a weirdo when it comes to playing these open world games. Like I like see here, here's a good example. I could fast travel to, to this and then walk down south. But instead I've decided to like travel across the, the, the countryside on my horse. Uh, it's a bit of a weird hobby I've got when I play these games. It gives me an opportunity to talk to the chat, but I would probably do it if I was offline as well. So I didn't mind the kind of travelling around, but I could get why some people might get fatigued by that for sure. I, I, I just don't know. I can't remember. When you're fast travelling, you have to go to the railroads. Is that how it works? You have to fa you have to travel you to the railroad and then use the train to fast travel. Is that how it works? I can't actually remember. It's been so long. Strange Places final update says 3. I would change the entire uh, Guarana chapter. I feel the whole detour was a great for the character development, for, for, but from a gameplay perspective, you just shoot a bunch of guys and leave. Seemed really repetitive and pointless other than to watch Dutch descend into his mania. Just feel like he, uh, that could have been done better, okay? Yeah, I feel like that kind of segment was very unique. Um, it was obviously quite random that they suddenly took you away from like the main story, but I think someone told me that I think the reason they did that is because they did something similar in Red Dead 1 or something. I think, I don't know, I've never played Red Dead 1. I think somebody said that there's a segment in Red Dead 1 where you go to a completely different land that you can't get back to. It's just for the, it's purely for the story. And I wonder if they were, I wonder if they were trying to just, maybe they were just trying to give you the nostalgia kick of the, the first game for those that had like played and loved the first game maybe. But I don't know. Maybe I made that up, I'm not sure. You go to Mexico in Red Dead 1. Okay, okay. Yeah, maybe. But I, I know what you mean. Maybe they could have made it a bit more enjoyable than just like a, a montage. I think what they were maybe trying to do is maybe they were worried that uh, for people that didn't like that area, they were maybe scared about making that segment too long. So they just made it like, pow, 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 pow. You know, call of duty your way through it. And then before you know it, you're back to where you wanted to be. Because I did feel as well when we got sent to that area, I was like, fuck. It was nice to be in the beach setting. I feel like they were kind of uh, flirting a little bit with the idea of maybe making like a Red Dead Redemption game that was like in a, a bit more of like a tropical environment. And that's kind of what the that, that whole segment was about. It's been a while since I played, so forgive me. I'm trying my best to remember it, but 
yeah, I, I know for a fact when I was at that point, I kind of just wanted that area to finish quickly. Even though it looked beautiful and it was a nice change of scenery. Yeah, I don't know. I guess it's like... Yeah, if, if, you got, if you got bored with the game at any point or you felt like it was slowing down or the pacing was a problem for you, I can totally get why... Uh, Maybe at certain points you were like, oh, dude, this the game's dragging its feet or whatever. I just felt like the way that the game... You know how you move around, you start off in the snow, and then you come down into, like, a new area. And you start off at a little campsite, and then you move to a nicer campsite that's kind of next to the river. And then later on you move down to the kind of... The kind of southern area that's got, like, the kind of swamps and the alligators and the kind of hanging... The hanging vines. And then from there you move on to another campsite again. I, I quite liked that, um... I feel like that kind of kept everything fresh, it kind of kept the scenery fresh, but I don't know. I, f I see, I, f I feel like I sound like a a Red Dead 2 fanboy, but I, I guess I kind of was, I don't know. Oh shit, this doesn't look right at all. Did I fuck this up? Can I get up here? No way, dude. Did I, I? I hope this is the right way. This doesn't feel like the right way. This feels like I'm going down, but maybe not actually. Hmm. Now I feel like I'm playing Genshin. Hmm. I did not get the Raven horses, and maybe that's on me. I like my horse since I spent all the time buying stuff for it and bonding with it. But maybe I should have gone and done something else. Honestly, I think that I was quite fond of my horse too, but then I drove it off a cliff by accident and it died. And then I had a second horse that was a better horse than the first one, and I actually drove it in front of a train, trying to beat the train, and I, I mistimed it, and the, tra the horse was killed by the train. So my I didn't even get a choice. My horse just got fucking flattened by a steam train. Um. So then after that, the chat was like, Jack, you should go get the Arabian horse up north. So we, we, we went looking for it. We took a shit horse up. So found the uh the good horse and and then yeah the only my only disappointment about the the really the really good horse in the game these arabian ones is that they only come in one color and they're very small on your character so they actually look like a little pony under your under uh arthur or whoever you're using they don't really look like full-on big western epic cowboy horses they're quite small but they're really really fast and uh, if you're trying to do any of the, the the time trials in the game Anything to do with like uh, trying to get from like you know San Denis to wherever in in like as little time as possible. The Arabian horse will just make that challenge a piece of cake because they're so fast. I haven't been here before, have I? That would be really weird. Hmm. Hmm. I had a couple of, couple of other nitpicks with it, but for me it was the death by a thousand cuts. Yeah. The thing is, guys, as well, one thing I will say, right, see if you're, see if you start off playing a game, right, or watching a movie, or a TV show, or reading a book, a manga, listening to an album of music, whatever it be, right, oh, the charm of the Amaterasu, <laughs> holy shit, Digimon World 3 flashbacks, question mark, the thing is, guys, if you're playing a video game, right, and uh, you have a, a first bad impression of the game, sometimes your opinion can flip and eventually you could start liking it, right, that's happened to me a lot, uh, the, for example, Persona 5, I had that, right? I played... I started playing Persona 5. I thought it was the biggest amount of trash I'd ever played, and then eventually it became one of my favourite games ever. Same with uh, when we were playing... Another good example would be when we were playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I started off in day one and two of Odyssey. I was like, dude, this game is fucking shit. And then we went on to play it for two weeks, and I loved it. Um, I wouldn't really rate that as highly as... Uh, all the other games we played and you know I, I wouldn't put that up there with the best of the best but I actually really enjoyed the game once I got into it the same can be said in the opposite like if you don't have that change of if you don't have that mindset that change where um you know suddenly you do start enjoying the game if it just if it's just a slow descent a death by a thousand cuts a strange place explains it then you, you're gonna start hating the game more and more every time you know if something pisses you off and you're playing the game and you're kind of bummed out for whatever reason, if something's annoying you, if there's a silly mechanic or there's a glitch or you lose your save file or something, when you're playing that game, when you start descending into, oh man, I'm not really having a good time with this, and you start convincing yourself, when the game starts to do every little thing that's annoying, you're just going to go deeper and deeper down the rabbit hole and it's going to get to the point where you convince yourself 
no, nah, dude, this game's fucking shit. I hate it. And no matter how much people try and convince you, oh, actually, the game's good. Here's all the th- here's all the things I liked. It's not going to change your mind because you've you've made up your mind. Like that happens with me sometimes. I uh, I've watched movies and uh, you know I watch the movie and I think God that was fucking so shit. And then I'll go online and I'll look it up and I'll have like you know eight point something on IMDb or Rotten Tomatoes will be giving it like fucking eighty five percent ninety percent and I'm like what the fuck dude. And I go online and I try and read everybody's explanations as to why they love it and I'm just like no. You know, someday I'll write out a really nice, well thought out, decent argument about why the movie is great, and I'll just be looking through it like, no, fuck off, I hate you, shut up. I don't say that back, obviously, this is all internally. I'd probably write thanks for the review. But, like, you know, if you just decide that you don't like it, it's going to take a lot to, like, flip that, right? And and come make a comeback. It's quite, quite tough. Uh, what did we just get? Um... Killing enemies restores a moderate amount of health. That seems really good. Uh, can I swap that? Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of that. And I'm going to get... Mm, maybe I can put this here. And then I'm going to get rid of that and take this. Killing enemies restores a moderate amount of health. That's really OP. Well... Nice, 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 nice. Okay, good finds, guys. Uh, how do we get down from here? Is there, like, a quick way down? Oh, the sense right, nice. Hey, hey. Mm-hmm. Um, spoiler alert, it sucked leaving Arthur's horse that was almost just as sad as the death of a source, but the whole money issue was solved really nicely at the end of the game. That's my noble. Yeah, that was brutal. Yeah, I can see why people love the game and I really enjoyed a lot of it, don't get me wrong. I absolutely was enamoured by the story just as a game. I can't say it was great holistically. That's fair. Yeah, no, I don't think anybody would argue with that. Yeah, no, I, I got you. The thing is as well, guys, like sometimes it's about managing expectations. Like if you go into the game thinking it's really good or the reputation of the game is that the game is fantastic, super, super great, and then you play it and it's it doesn't quite meet what you were thinking or... You know, there's a couple of things that happen in the game that piss you off early on. And suddenly you're like, wait a minute, everybody told me this game was fantastic and I'm kind of having like a an average to meh time with it. The more it kind of disappoints over and over, or doesn't get better, you feel like you're wasting your time or your, maybe even your money if you paid a lot of money for it and it's really not pleasing you. There's there's so many reasons why it's okay to be like, yeah, no, I didn't like it. That's a shame though. But do you know what strange place? Kudos to you. Kudos to you for actually playing the game all the way through, despite getting kind of annoyed with it. Um, the fact that, like, even though you didn't enjoy some of the kind of the mechanics in the middle about, like, maybe fast traveling or the, the the dirty face or the dirty horse or whatever, right? Any of that stuff. At least you actually played the story all the way to the end. So well done for doing that. Good on you. Because some people will, I see that sometimes, and it hurts me. Like, like Strange Sea had said. Strange, see if you had came in, right, and, and and this isn't aimed at you, you could have been anybody who came in and said this. If somebody came in and said, just played Red Dead Redemption 2, uh, uh, couldn't get out the, out the tutorial area, I'm still in the snow and I've uninstalled it, I hate it, I'm never playing it again, that game is terrible. I would be so, like, I would be, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't really say heartbroken because I probably wouldn't give a fuck, but like, I would feel so kind of like uncomfortable because you have to... You know, to give a comment on a game like that and have such a profound, like, opinion of it whilst also playing, like, a percentage, like, like 5% of the game, it would, like, it would tilt me, you know? It's like if someone says, like, oh, Pokemon, man. I've only ever played Pokemon Red and uh, I couldn't get out of Pallet Town. That series sucks dick. It's like, well, maybe... Pokemon does suck dick, but you're not really qualified to fucking... I mean, anybody can like, give an example or an opinion. Uh, sorry, anybody can give an opinion. But like, you know, how much weight is your opinion going to have? Don't faint me, please. After you win a standoff, additional enemies will rush you. Wait until the charge enemy swings a weapon, then attack. Woo! Get down! 
Hold still. What? Did I just get a hit? Did I just get a hit marker for hitting that guy in the face? No, that wasn't targeted at you, Serenity. Pokemon was the easiest. No, that wasn't. That wasn't. Absolutely was not targeted at you. <clears throat> Pokemon was the easiest fucking game to reach for because everybody knows what Pokemon is. Could have been anything. Could have been like. Could have been like Persona. Could have been Digimon. Could have been fucking whatever. Um. I never did fast travel. I love to travel with my horse. Yeah. I, like, I mean, we've just finished playing two weeks of Oblivion, guys, and all I ever did through the entire Oblivion playthrough was walk everywhere. I, I, I think I did that with, uh, with Red Dead 2 as well. Hmm. I was always someone who thought a story could carry a game, and to a degree, I believe that, compared to games like God of War 4 or The Last of Us, I felt like the story in the game did more of the heavy lifting than it should have. Yeah, sometimes that is the case. Sometimes you're, uh... Your video games can be determined by like or you know it can a certain aspect of the game can like level up a little bit you know you might be buying red dead 2 for a cowboy game but if you really get touched by the story if you find it very poignant or emotional it might actually you know maybe the game moves from like a b plus to an a minus or something like that <sighs> pokemon is shite though says issue I mean, some of the more modern Pokemon games I tend to agree, honestly. Hmm. Wasn't that, like, heavy armor of the Colossus? Wait, do you mean Shadow of the Colossus, Cherry? Sorry to bring up Oblivion right after you finished it, but do you remember, says Single Shrider? Uh, do you remember the name of the armor you used until you got the Imperial Dragon armor? I used a, a mixture of armor sign. I didn't use just one specific armor. I, I mixed and matched. So for the longest time, I was wearing a mithril helmet, an ebony chest plate that I enchanted myself. I enchanted it. I enchanted it with strength. I was wearing ebony gauntlets, and I enchanted those with the blades. And then I was wearing Daedric, Daedric trousers, which had flame resistance. And then I think I had leather boots, which had speed and all this other stuff attached to it. All right, um, I'm gonna save my game here, guys, because we haven't saved in ages, and I'm terrified this game doesn't have an auto save. I think it does, but if it doesn't, that would be really sickening. Let's go ahead and save our game here. I'm gonna run to the bathroom, guys, and quickly have a little whiz and take my plates through as well. Check on Mrs. Wilfie, but thanks for the for the chit chats, guys. I'll be back in two minutes. Here's a I'll let you look at the the scenery. Anyway, sorry for derailing. No, listen, strange place. Listen to me. When you guys come into, first of all, when you guys come into the stream, right, and you guys say, hey, I want to talk about, you, in fact, you didn't even say that, you just said, like, oh, I've just finished playing Red Dead 2, and here's my thoughts, and because I have, like, because I spent so much time on Red Dead 2, that discussion to me is, like, super exciting, right, and I, I know I said, I said that with a deadpan, flat voice, right, but, like, real talk, I love it when you guys come in and have, like, interesting discussions, because it's a game that I've played so much with you guys, it's a game that we played on stream together, and I was really passionate about, um, as nerdy as that sounds, and I, and I love talking about it, if you guys can, if, if we have a chit chat, right, because Strange, I feel like you always come in the chat, right, and we always see, we see eye to eye, we have very similar humour, um, senses of humour, and I feel like we always see eye to eye with a lot of stuff, so when you tell me you didn't like it, I'm in, like, I immediately, I'm like, well, I, I need to know why, like, tell me, what was it you didn't like, like, we, we gotta talk about this, and if everybody joins in with the conversation, as people have been doing for the past 10 minutes, uh, then that's a perfect stream topic, so don't ever apologise. We, we're playing Ghost of Tsushima, this is the kind of game like Red Dead 2, anyway, where it's a free roam open world game, we're doing a bit of quests, we're doing a bit of side story, we're doing a bit of upgrading, and the whole rest of the content of the stream, you know, we've been live for six and a half hours, the rest of it is just chit chat. It's phenomenal, I, I love it, this is like the best part about streaming, in my opinion. Um... So yeah, you're absolutely gold. Um, I would welcome any conversations like that anytime you guys like. As long as you guys are like decent about it. Okay, give me a minute boys, I'll be back in a sec.
music is my life, is my life is new, thirty years in your heart. What's happening? What did I miss? Um, I'm just playing right now for watching you, says Sign. Nice, playing some Oblivion. So, Jack Genshin, why you no like anymore? We've been over this, Renny, lots and lots of times. We've already talked about this, Renny. We've talked about this lots of times, I've told you. Okay, we've played Genshin a lot, and... Okay, we'll do bullet point format, right? We've played Genshin a lot, first of all, so kind of, kind of exhausted, okay. Secondly, all the stuff we're doing in Genshin right now is just the same generic stuff. You know, let's go, go to, you know, do your dailies. Go to Area X, talk to character for 10 minutes, listen to their absolute pish. Then a horde of hilly churros turns up and an abyss mage, you kill it. Then you go to the next area, and then you do the same again. And then you go back to l fucking Mondstadt, and then you listen to Gene talk shit. It's, it's just the same shit. So, until they add, like, a new area to explore and kind of, like, roam around in, just putting Genshin on the bench for the time being. It's not that I hate it and we're never going to play it again, it's just that, you know, there's only so many hilly churros I can kill before I want to, you know... Yeah, it's like grinding my face against sandpaper, right? I think I'm going to play some Oblivion tonight, says Saurian, but I'm going to use console commands to make my character level 1 uh, and all their stats and then boost the difficulty to the max, for fun. Saurian, that sounds like the opposite of fun, but whatever, whatever makes you happy, dude. Hello my there. Lord, have you come to help the Azamor League too? Yes. I've never heard of them. Farmers and fishermen banded together to fight the Mongols. I've come from Ariake to train them. I admire their bravery. How is the training going? They were supposed to meet me here hours ago. I was this about is well, to look guys, like, them. I'll ride with you. There's a part of like, when it, in terms of the Red Dead 2 discussion, because we played it with the stream, and the stream like seemed to do well during it as well. I have like fond memories, so I could be being influenced by that as well. The stream did well when we were playing Red Dead 2, so maybe that would influence me. I played the same class as Jack made so far, it's really fun. I just finished the Mage's Guild quest earlier. Nice. Hope you enjoy, Sign. I was told many times it was a great game talking of Red Dead 2. I try my best not to set expectations for anything, because in general it only leads to disappointment. This was, uh, this is for me... Just a singular experience. I kind of want to give it another shot at some point just because it was visually stunning and so well polished, but for now I'm burnt out. Yeah, no, you, that's another thing, Strange. Like, if you've if you've smashed... Red Dead 2 is a long game, and if you've smashed through that entire game in the space of, like, I don't know how long it's taken you to beat it, but if you've been playing that the last few days and you've just been kind of, like, blasting through it, absolutely you're going to be exhausted with it. I, I, I get burnt out with games all the time. Learn to defend myself. I hope the skills I gain through hardship can be of use to the people here. You're not so different from a samurai. My lord, you flatter me. Srini says, I'm winding you up, son. I'm at peace with you abandoning me in the game. Please. I feel like this is mental warfare, Serenity. Please don't, okay? Just don't. Please. You're hurting me. I did it in two weeks, sunk in around 50 hours. Yeah, I think... I, uh, I, I can't track how long we spent on Red Dead 2 because I played it, like, if it was on Steam, I can open up Steam and see how long we played the game for. But because we played it on console, I actually don't know. All I can check is my achievements, the I guess. The farmhouse. Uh oh. This doesn't look good. Oh, is this a sneaky mission? Okay. Oh, you're just running in? No, dude. Oh, fuck. Cut them down. Okay, I was attacking. I kind of wish she had given me an opportunity to do stealth there, but I guess she just didn't give a fuck. Um, These are the men I was supposed to meet. Whoops. If the Mongols found them, they could have found the main force too. I should have come sooner. We can still warn the others. 
You hear that? They might have found the main force. We have to help them. Hurry, my lord! Wait! Wait, what's happening here? Oh no. Go, 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 go. Don't know why I'm helping this woman. She just seems to be someone who looks like she might help me. And she's fighting against the Mongols, so... You drive a Mongol horde. I drive a Mongol horde. Your army is weak. What? You going to attack me with We're a posse of peeps? Uh oh. Well, Jack, I have some news. Can't, we can't save everyone. Then I will avenge the dead. Kakwar says like there was an attempted talk. murder in the village I live in last week. Kakwar, who were you trying to kill? Oh my god, this bitch is fucking gonna get me super killed. You fucker. Change arrows, bro. I hate that you can't roll when you're... Come on then, bitch. Jesus, that was fucking heads. Can't help you. Thank you, my lord. Stop charging in, you, you ape. arrows back. I actually like shooting the arrows more than I thought I was gonna in this game. Uh, let me collect some things. My sword stance is in the wrong spot as well now as well. I actually may end up leaving my character in sword stance. We got a couple of headshots there, that was alright. Supplies. I need to maybe track some animals. I, I forgot, I probably could have... I need predator pelts I think. So that's gonna be like boars and bears. Okay, I'm ready. What's happening here? We're gonna do this again. You have skill, but you nearly died rushing into battle. Don't the Mongols anger you? A samurai's most important weapon is himself. Lose control, and you risk defeat. I see. I should return home. Learn to master my emotions. Yes. Keep fighting. We need people like you. But remember the lesson. I will, my lord. Remember the name. Okay. That was a good fighting mission. That was just a little side one though. That was like a little kind of random mission. But these people might come back to help us. For Tsushima. So what do we get for that? Some XP. No points though. Feels bad man. Close. We get Linen. Charm of Hidden Sight is a stealth charm. Legend Storyteller. All right, I say we head down and uh, oh, is that a bamboo strike? Oh yeah, dude, let's go back. I like these. These are hard, man. This should give us some sort of advantage. Uh, let me see. Oh, I'm ready, dude. Sign me up. Okay. Nice. That was nice and easy. That was fine. How many? <laughs> Four X's and one L, one square. Fuck. It's hard, man. What? You got a wrong button. I must have not. I must have only done three. One, two, three, four. Nice. That's tough. I love that though. I love it. Bamboo strikes needed to increase resolve. We need two more. Oh, those are addictive, man. I, I don't know why. That, that like Those are so challenging. Um, they make me feel good when I get them. Uh, Legend Storyteller. Oh, should I have done this? I, I, I completely abandoned this instead of doing it. Fuck, I don't know. What is this? The Legend of Tadao Mythic Tales. 
moderate legend increase. Um, what we got here? Armor, two upgrades available. Ooh, exciting. I guess we could go upgrade our armor and stuff. Maybe, maybe we can find a like a boar or something on the way back. Yeah, sure. Okay, let's uh, let's travel back the way then. There's another legend storyteller back here. All right, we're looking for like an animal. Maybe we can actually upgrade our thingy, my bob. Hmm. Let's go, look. Hmm. I'll be in the car and she'll be like, hold on, what are we talking about here? My grandma's the same with obituaries. Thanks, Gajin. For writing out the Fort Minor lyrics, I appreciate that. Are those running away from me? Black powder bomb. I saw a goat there, I wonder if that counts. Is there somebody trying to fight me? Oh yeah, there is. Do we want to fight these guys for the memes? Here we go. Shit. Oh, it stunned me. Weird that I need to talk about in a minute. So here's what's fucking strange. It's like So if I want to swap it's just left and right. But then if I'm doing this I have to push square or triangle. I guess it's not so bad, but like this is X and circular. It's gonna take me a while to get used to that. Hmm. I need more practice. Give me my kunai back, bitch. Is that a prisoner? I don't think that's a prisoner. Better free this poor lad. Hello. Hold still. Take it easy, buddy. Can you get somewhere safe? I think so, my lord. But the Mongols are watching from the crossroads above the river. Anyone traveling north from Azmo is in danger. I'll see to the Mongols. Okay. There we go. Oh, dude, come on. That never gave me a point. Right, I need my... Uh... I really want my arrows back, but like I can never seem to get them. I think it's I think maybe you can only get the arrows back from like headshots or something. Hmm. Not entirely sure. I think this guy said there was enemies up here in the mountains. Is it that flag maybe? <laughs> I don't really like the idea of going into a fight without the uh, without arrows. Is there anything to be gained from this? No, just a dead guy. There's a bird here. Hmm. D-pad changes your weapon. Face buttons or ammo type. Yeah. It's just because you got your sword stances as well. My, my brain's kind of tripping up learning the, the early patterns, but we'll get it, guys. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Hot spring. Fuck yeah. We're finding these all over the place, actually. 
I didn't think there was going to be this many of hot, this many hot springs, but this is great. Anyways, gotta go, guys. It's been fun discussing all this. Have fun, strange place. Thanks for swinging by. You have a great night. Much love to you. Butt cheeks. What are we reflecting on today? A warrior's burden or next spring? Let's talk about a warrior's burden. <sighs> Booty. I wish being a samurai were as easy as slipping into warm water. Imagine the Mongols attacked him when he was relaxing doing this. Maximum health increased. Nice and easy. Alright, magic. Where are we at? I must have just missed that last time. We're actually very close to my destination. Good find on the way past. It shows you how much stuff is like hidden amongst... Well, there's iron over there. Kuta River Bridge, Mongol Territory. Uh, iron's good for upgrading like our Tanto and stuff, but I've not actually had that many opportunities to do stealth kills yet. Do I want to go up into the mountain and... I think I might have already been up this mountain. It's really hard to tell. Yeah... I've already done that one. Okay, we're gonna travel past this mountain then. I swear they just oh, include the on. naked exit in the water scene for those thirsty. I mean, why not, dude? The question is, why not, Cactuar? It's a brutal adult game. It's an 18 plus, right? Why not put a bit of ass in there? It's exciting! You know, it's a fantasy game. People take part in fantasy works because regular life is boring. When do you get to see a samurai ass in regular day-to-day -day life? I think it's when uh, video games put excessively one particular part of adult content in over and over and over again to the point where it's a bit kind of um, like, uh, I'm trying to think of the word, like, I don't know, I really want to catch that deer but my arrow is, I have no arrows. I don't think we're going to be able to upgrade our quiver. I've not killed any more bears yet. I wish I had though. Alright, let's get off here. So I've got a storyteller, a main... I've got a storyteller, a quest. Are you the... This is the armor. So I want to upgrade the samurai clan armor. And I think I'm going to upgrade this... Wait, what? Do I actually get the whole set like this? Moderate increase to help reduces all damage by a major amount. <laughs> Fuck it, yeah, dude. Why not? Much better protection. All right, fine. I'll see you again. Thanks. What does this guy tell me? Oh, that's Legends mode again. Yeah. Mm. Um. You look like you're important. Don't know if I want to talk to you just yet. Probably can't upgrade my sword again. I would be honored to work on your blade, my lord. Apologies. You don't have what we need to I do. I need iron work. and steel. Yeah, we've just spent all of our supplies. Where's the is there a crafter in this village? No. Oh there is a boar. Where where's Where's the Fletcher? Oh, all the way over here. Naked bodies are icky. Not my naked body, not this naked body on the uh, on the samurai end. What's this guy's name, guys? I forgot the main character's name. Is it Jai or something? His ass cheeks are lush. Anything your bow requires. Fear the Toms here says we playing some sushi. Let's go. Did we finish Oblivion? We we finished the main story of Oblivion, Tom. We finished the main story of Oblivion, the Mages Guild, the Fighters Guild, and the arena. So we didn't finish Dark Brotherhood, Thieves Guild, Shivering and Isles, or Knights of the Nine, but we might go back to it one day. Um, half bow. So I need more supplies if I want to make this better. Which I would totally be down for, by the way. Tom with 100 bits. The legend. Tom, thanks. Did the title sequence give you the goosebumps when you rode out into the field? Of course it did, yeah. I'm going to be adding that in some sort of montage at some point later in the year for sure. Absolutely. How do I, uh... How do I do this? Weapons and ammo. View upgrades. I want to... Who is it that increases my quiver, guys? To, like, give me more arrows? Because I saw that earlier and I forgot how to get there. Is that a specific person? 
Thanks for the bits, by the way, Tom. Appreciate that. Um, let me see here. Oh yeah, Jack, you're likely all, you know you likely know already. You can downgrade the appearance of your armor and keep the stats. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, we were mentioned. It was mentioned to me earlier. I don't know how to do it yet, Sushi. Any options? But I did see that as an option. Yeah. Um. How the fuck do I? Is it in here? Surely it would be her. You lack the required materials. Uh, Very sorry. Who was it? Shoot well, my lord. I, I honestly can't fucking remember. How the fuck? Was it a specific? Was it like a blacksmith or something that? Oh, is it? Oh, it's the. It's the. Uh, it's the. The trapper, but there's no trapper here. But even if there was, I don't know if I have enough Mongol territory. Oh, there's iron. We could go do that. We could go fuck up these guys and then go back here. There's like a. I'm trying to see the village. Yeah, there's a trapper there. But I don't have enough. I still don't have enough bear pelts. I'm gonna go here, and then we're gonna go here, and then we're gonna go back to the city. But we upgraded our armor, so we should take less damage now. Which is pretty cool. We could also talk to some of these people where, while we're here. I don't think that would be a bad idea. What's this woman saying? You seem troubled. What's wrong? I saw a terrible battle near Kuta Farmstead. Bandits and Mongols slaughtering each other. Normally I'd let them tear into each other all they want. But the violence may put others in danger. Keep away from there. I'll have a look. Uh, I don't know if you see me say earlier, you can set up gear sets so that swapping your armor also changes your charms, hat, and mask. Okay. I don't know how to do that either, Sushi, but that sounds fun. I only have, like... I, I don't really have that much cool stuff yet. Uh, honestly. Cast of iron. It's got leather there. Uh, I've only got one set of weapons and charms at the moment, but... Uh, I'll figure that out later, Sushi, for sure. That'll probably come in handy if we want to swap between, like, fighting and bow and arrow stance or something. Different playstyles. Lady Masako, do you have news of your family's killers? On the list we found, Sada was at the top. He's the head man of Kuta Farmstead. Kuta's people served your clan. Why would he turn against you? Because he is an ungrateful traitor. My husband appointed Sadao as headman, and he repaid that kindness with bloodshed. I learned he fled Kuta the night my family was murdered. <laughs> must have heard you survived. Sadao is a deceitful snake, but his brother, Hachi, is a fool. Rip. He just passed by the temple carting food for the refugees. He will make an unscheduled delivery to his brother. And we will be there to catch him. So if I wanted to keep this armor but take the helmet off, I could do that, right? Sign Ghost Rider says, I'd donate $100 for an Among Us playthrough. Well, I appreciate the kindness, Sign. And it was it's very nice of you to say that. We have to go, or we will lose him. Oh, is this actually a mess? Oh, fuck, this is actually a... So how the fuck... I appreciate you saying that, uh, Sign Ghost, and it's, you know, that's a really thoughtful thing to say. We might play Among Us one day, my dude. I'm not sure when. Uh, oh yeah, so I can do it like that, yeah. I'll put my Serenity headband back on. I think that's kind of cool. Alright, that was a lot easier than I thought. I didn't realise I was actually signing up for this quest. I kind of fucked up, because I was going to go here and do that. But, looks like we're doing this instead. After what happened at the inn, I didn't think you'd visit the temple again. I came to watch for Sadao's brother. And mourn Clan Adachi's dead. Among us. Have you given your family a proper funeral? Not while their killers walk free. After my father died. Doesn't work at saying Ghost Rider Jack refused to be influenced night. by Donos. Help ease my pain. I buried them. That will have to do. It's not that I refuse to be swayed by Donos. When's the last time you slept? I just I'm not I had some really that interested in Among Us guys. The youngest warrior needs a full belly and a rested sword arm. 
Are you calling me old, Lord Sakai? He's just scared we'll gang up on him. I mean, that's a My fact. That would happen. Works just fine. You never kill off the streamer makes up for a rubbish stream. <laughs> no, not a thousand dollars. Why are you so interested in uh, in Among Us single Strider? Thousand dollars is a big donation, my dude. That would be the biggest we've ever received. I don't think it's really worth though. Let's search the area. I would lie to you. I'd like to lie and say it would be worth my guy, but you're best saving your money, sign. Honestly. Here we we're, uh, we're hearing the English dub. I played with the Japanese voices. Says X26. Yo, what's up, dude? X26, how's things? <laughs> Ten thousand dollars. Now you're trying to pay for my house, my guy. I don't think you've got that kind of cash sign. One billion dollars. <laughs> Musical, look. The man with the card. That's Hachi, Sada's brother. Here we go. Are we, uh... Are we following him or? Oh shit! He's leaving. And we will follow, close but out of sight. We nearly get spoiled. Stay hidden, horse. Back to it. Oh look at this! We're gonna be able to follow across the log. Oh, this is classic ninja stuff, dude. Oh, this is funny. I like this. Dr. Evil Pinky. <laughs> I don't even got a hundred, says Ghost Rider. That's all right, my guy. You save your money. Appreciate you being here. That's more than enough, man. More than enough. How many arrows do I have? Absolutely none. Fuck my life. I've got one bomb. He has visitors. We can't let them see us. Food, water, other things. Sure. Uh, of course. I did English since it was made originally with Japanese. Since it wasn't made originally with Japanese, you know. Uh, if anything, the Japanese was the dub. Yeah. Some people said that. That's why we chose English. Forget the wagon. Follow those horses. I get shame for giving a hundred quid. You just can't win. Good horse. No, Serenity, you give a hundred quid every week. And then complain about having no money in your bank account. That's why you get shamed, mate. Oh, fuck. I don't think I'm supposed to... Oh, Christ. Nowhere to run. You're losing sight of your target. Oh shit. Fuck. I didn't realize we weren't stuck in the car anymore. Gosh, I just went with Japanese for immersion. I almost picked Japanese, guys. Almost. Like I said, some games are pretty good in Japanese. Like, I played Sekiro in Japanese. Watch a lot of my anime in Japanese as well. Just depends. That's called an addiction chat. Jack says Cherry. Cherry, now who's shaming who? Come on now. Gajin says, yeah, but we don't dono and then you have no money in your account, so... Wait, what? But then we don't dono, and then you have no money in your account, so... Listen, guys. Let me focus. Oh, I've, I've, I'm supposed to speak. Oh, shit. Come here. Tom, thank you for the gifted sub over to X26. You legend. Tom, coming in with a gifted sub for four months to X2601. Legend. X26, welcome back to the Wolfpack, friend. Thank you for being here. Four four whole months. Tom, you're a legend. Cheers. Sada's house. Guarded by bandits. Sada's cousins. He must be hiding there. We don't know that. But we will soon find out. Oh. Show me your skill. Here we go. Time for a standoff, boys. I'm holding a grenade in my, in my back pocket. Ah. Ah. 
Come on, dude. What? Did the time in there was so shit. Dude, the fucking camera, dude. I haven't done like a stabby stab in quite a while. I'm gonna do that later, I think. I need more arrows, man. I never seem to get my arrows back from like the floors. I feel like I'm always empty. This game does make you feel really good, like though. Do you see what happened there where like I was trying to fight one guy here and then the spear guy came in? I pushed circle and then I did it too early and then he just stabbed me twice. And then I'm trying to attack one guy. Oh, this guy's attacking me. And I'm like, bro, can I get some space, please? Can a man work? Corpses can't answer questions. There's someone in the house. I'll make them. I'm starting to think I should just leave my first. character in sh in water stance. I think I should just leave it in water stance. That's probably for the best. Hello. Water stance. He runs about holding his sword above his head, which is a bit unnatural. Can you change the FOV? I I can on PlayStation. No, I wish I could though. I'm not going to hurt you. My name is Sakai. Who are you? Hina, Sada's wife. My husband is innocent. The Mongols killed your family. Where is he? I don't know. You're lying. She'll help us. And she can't stay here. I'll take her to my estate. Park. She is going to kill me. No harm will come to you. <laughs> that look of disgust. No, I can't change the FOV, you know. I'm pretty sure you're stuck. I wish I could zoom it back a little bit. We talked about this a little while ago. Hey, technique point. Give me. Not bad. You mean you don't watch them in dub like Jesse does, Kappa? <laughs> Jess. <laughs> Good gene. <laughs> Charmer Resolve 1, that, that, I think that's actually, that may be pretty good, um, 15% increase to Resolve games, that could, that would actually be alright, I think, I don't think that would be a bad one, I'm gonna put that on, okay, we got some Silk for that quest as well, not bad, alright, that was an unexpected Masakao quest that I did there out of nowhere, um, I was gonna go up here and do this, so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna clear out this camp and then clear out this, and then maybe go back and do some more Tomoe stuff. In fact, Tomo the Tomoe stuff isn't even available yet, so who knows? Mascal's waiting there for that. Let's fast travel. Uh, Tom says, all right, back to work I go. Have fun slicing fools up, Tom. Thanks for swinging by and gifting a sub, man. That was really fucking kind, and I really appreciate it. Tom, I hope work goes fast for you. I know Monday sucks, so uh, kudos to you for being here, man. Much love, dude. And X26, I'm glad that you're back with us as the uh, part of the sub-community. Feels good, man. Okay, let's go. Where's Tanjiro? Oh, I don't know where Tanjiro is. Tangerine? <laughs> She can't just kill people based on baseless accusations. I think Masako is in a, a feudal era where people are getting slaughtered. She's lost a lot of her children and she's raging. She's looking for a bit of uh, vengeance. Or am I where I wanted to be? No, not yet. Demon Hunter. Oh, I've never seen Demon Hunter yet. Right, we're close to where we want to be. I think I need to take a right here. Let's see what we've got in the back of the wagon. Steel! Oh shit, we needed steel for sword upgrades. That was a huge find. Okay, nice. There's enemies following me through the woods here. 
I really don't want to attack this... I don't really want to attack the stronghold without having a fucking... Without having arrows, but I don't really have much of a choice. Fuck it, let's go. Can I just swim across here? Alright. Stand off. Okay, this could get really bad, I don't know. Is that a dog? Ow. Go off me, Fido. Jesus Christ, dude. See, whenever I try and party, I feel like I just get absolutely fucking dicked. I don't have any arrows to, like, be able to deal with this guy. I want to I wanna climb up and fuck this guy up, but, like... Can I get arrows from him, please? I guess not. I got none. There's gotta be some Mongol artifacts, okay. Please, guys, I gotta get some some bulletos, please. Meh? Maybe? Oh, poor Doggo. Doggo got killed, Sonny. He was trying to eat me. I had to punch him in the face. I wish I could have left him alive, but he was a bit aggressive, you know. Munching my toes. Have you not been using a stealthy boy? I haven't really had an opportunity, honestly. Now we've got an opportunity to maybe be stealthy. That guy's looking right at me though. Let's see if we can find a way in here without, uh... Let's see if we can find a way around. Maybe there's like a hole in the fence or something. Can I climb up these? I almost got spotted there. Who the fuck is shooting at me? What the fuck? Looks like I'm supposed to go over here. Can I get some arrows from this place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me these. Uh oh. What we got? So we got the banners. One of three. Okay. Where was that guy that saw me? Dude, I love that. I love how you jump at the wall and he kind of slides over it. That's so fucking sick. Okay. We'll try the stealth stuff as much as we can, guys. So there must be a banner in every single one of these houses, is that right? Maybe? Do I have to get all three? Yeah, recover all. Okay. I don't feel like I have a very good range. That looks like a guy there, is it? Yeah, I see him. Oh, 
come on, are you kidding me? Shit. How do I, uh... Oh, you... I don't even know. Is he gonna come this way? Is there not a way you can, like, you can... Oh, yeah, look over the shoulder. That's what I wanted. here as well. Decent. I think I was getting spotted by someone else out there, by the way. Quite like this. There's a guy here in front of me. Near the dogs barking. The dogs must be in the kennel. Got six arrows left. Where's the last spot? No, where's the last big? F Is it over here in the main area? Must have been over here somewhere. Steel again. That's good. Horsey here. So bad guys in here. Iron, ammo. That's it. Okay. Destroy the black powder cache. Where the fuck is that? Is it going to be in one of these dojos, maybe? I actually really enjoyed breaking out this compound. Everything went super smoothly. Is that, is that, is that someone sleeping? Oh, it is. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Leather, records. Fucking ninja of the night, dude. Um... Where are we going next? There has to be like another part of this. Is it in like the the middle area maybe? Oh, it's over there. Fuck, I didn't even see it. Gimme. One arrow. Looks like it was over here. Dog barking outside my window, thought it was from the game. I thought I heard a dog inside the game, so I don't know. Hold to ignite. Alright. Run away! Woo! Oh shit. Where did he come from? You alright, mate? One v one, Mortal Kombat. Oh, how's he got a full suit of armor and the shield? How's that fair? Listen, so, some live, some die in the way of the samurai. Okay, that's all I'm saying. Some days, some nights. Some live, some die. Okay, let's see. Warlord Dogger. He's upset because I killed his dogger. Ooh. Fucking dead. See that perfect party chat? Fucked him right up. Click. I think of it as more as like a snick, you know, like a snick. Cool. 
good ship. Mm -hmm. And these guys are like, yeah, Jim, and then I saw him and he, oh, dude, he was insane. Flaming Red here, he came in, killed all the guards, blew up the gunpowder, defeated the Samurai Lord. What a hero. Technique point earned. Got some gold as well. Don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. You have this weird kind of like cooldown after the missions like this. I don't really get it. Like, it's kind of cool, but I also kind of think, why not just let me play? I don't know. Merchant, no vanity gear available. Uh, I kind of wanted to go over and do this. Get some iron from here. That was pretty good. I really thoroughly enjoyed that. Should we see what the merchant has got for sale? I better, I better do this now. Trade is difficult in these times, my lord. Armor dies. Oh, here we go. Load, 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 load. Anytime today. Oh god. I can't even see that under my armor, can I? Can I even see what colour my arm like my character is? Can you pet your horse? I don't know if you can pet your horse, but you can pet your you can pet the fox. Immaculate warrior. Oh god. I'm not sure I like that. Farewell. Although our current get up of blue and green is not really that much better, honestly. Uh oh, there's someone here who wants to talk to me. Hey buddy. You alright? Lord Sakai. Hi. You must do something. It's Kii Sake Brewery in Azamo. Oh. That brewery is the pride of Tushima. Tushima. I remember the first time I tried Kii Sake. Soon there will be none left. The Mongols are taking it by force. I'll see what I can do. Alright. Right, uh... There's... What one's my horse? Did I always forget? Is this my horse? I never, I never know if I'm stealing someone else's or not. I got a bit nervous. Okay, I think we go over and we do this. This... area over here should be... A lot easier than what we just did. Maybe I should be looking around for supplies. Miko. Priestess. Priestess Kikio. Lady Kikio. Sorry. So she says, uh, slight spot spoddle, save your flowers. Roger that. Fuck off. Fuck off. You don't stand a chance. Mongol scumbags. What? item right in the face. Kill or observe more leaders to unlock wind stance. So there was an opportunity for me to for, to watch the leader. <laughs> Fuck. Do I have any arrows? Oh, I do. Fire arrow to the face. <laughs> Fuck it now. Alright. Got it done. Oh, are we still fighting here? Some oh, hello. Come on in. So sorry. Alright. Bonus objective. Increase legend. Oh, there must have been a, like a bonus. I didn't even know there was a bonus objective for this place. Oops. What we got here? Some iron. Is this like, what is this a prayer site? I need to pray? I can't pray. I don't have any skills. Maybe I just, uh... Teabag? No? Okay. Yeah, I'm enjoying headshotting the enemies. Is there any more stuff around here that I could actually... 
tons and tons of iron. I think the thing I needed to upgrade my sword was steel. And supplies. What was that? Mongol artifacts. Dude, now I want to watch fucking Samurai Champloo, dude. I've got the fucking intro stuck in my head. What a good anime that was. Not too long, not too crazy. Just right. Alright, come here, horse. That was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Um, so yeah, cannot travel during combat. What the fuck, really? Got the lake here as well, we could go check out, or we could just focus on some of these other ones. I think we just go and do Misakao. Not physically, that would be a bit weird. We can make our way downtown and do some of these as well. We haven't not even looked at any of these yet. But we can maybe head down here and do that after. Let's do another Misakao quest. Nudge that along a little bit because there's quite a lot. Alright, I need to go round and then down. We should be good. I'm thinking about writing my own manga, says sign. Okay. I think it would be really fun. I think it would be a lot of dedication. But it could be. I used to do these tiny little comic strip things when I was younger, guys. I used to get a little bit of paper, right? Fold it in half. Until it was like... I don't know, like maybe like this size? Right? Like a tiny little bit of paper like that. And I used to draw lines along it. Horizontal lines. And then in each little line, I'd, I'd do like little vertical lines to make it boxes. Like three boxes in one row, and then two boxes in the next, and then four boxes in the next. And inside the little boxes, I would, do I would draw like a little uh, storyboard of like a stick figure. Show me your skill. And uh, yeah, it was it was kind of fun. I've not done that in a long time though. That was when I was much younger. Yeah. Absolutely fucking owned. All right. That was kind of dope. 27 supplies, not bad. I'm not really getting insane amounts from these guys though. I like headshotting, dude. Headshotting in this game is so sick. So fun. Um, am I actually going across the river? I am. Okay. These enemies actually respawn in areas that I think I've already cleared out. That's awesome, I used to do the same thing. It was actually my friend that used to do it and then he, I, I would just copy him. Don't do that. Sorry, deer. Wait, can I not farm the deer? Oh, okay, there we go. Wait! I can't farm the deer carcass? But I just used all my arrows hunting the deer. Do I need to shoot it, like, in the head or something? Did that glitch? I need to kill animals. That are like predators, so that I can upgrade my bow, dude. I'll see one of these gold birds over here as well. Fuck, I'm getting distracted, dude. It's happening. Chat, no, don't let it happen. It's happening. I'm gonna follow the gold bird. Fuck me. Deers don't have drops. That's a bit lame. I can see a golden tree. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna follow the bird. Bird, lead me. Take me somewhere exciting, bird. I'll wait. Survivor camp. Ooh. We got a Fletcher here. I do. Trapper and stuff. I work metal, wood, cloth. Range capacity upgrades? No! I need more for that. Fuck you. Flaming arrows? You dick. You fucking dick. Goodbye. You fuck. Can I buy hides from other people? Can I buy those from anywhere? Like, does anybody. Does this guy, like. Does he have, like. 
He doesn't have supplies, does he? Like, can I buy hides? Hmm. Hello. As if losing our homes wasn't bad enough. R.I.P. We have to see Mongols in them as well. I know. I've seen too many homes. Really. So he's going to say I've seen too many Mongols. We've killed a lot of Mongols. A few days ago, the man who lived there. Some win, some the die in the way of the samurai. For help. I'll try and find him. But I make no promises. Rumored location added. Oh God. Uh. Oh, could it be this? Undiscovered location. Okay, okay, okay. What we got over here? Oh, fox den? Question mark? Foxy! Yeah, dude, these are so fun, man. Come on, little fox, let's go. Me and you, buddy. You and me, foxy, ain't nothing but mammals. Let's do it how they do on the Discovery Channel. Break it down. Oh, dude, following the fox is so fucking... It's exciting, you know? Come on, little buddy. Imagine one time he just, like, led you into, like, some sort of, like, fucking... Oh, God, I... Fox, you never saw that. Pretend you never saw that. Just broke my fucking neck. Alright. Honor the shrine. Pray to the foxies. Dude, the fox is huge, man. Inari! Four more shrines to get a fourth germ slot. Thanks, buddy. Come here, you, you little bastard. I said, come here and let me pay at you. Here we go, little guy. You're probably looking for something to eat. Unfortunately for you, I ain't got fuck all. But if you see any bears, let me know, because I need to kill them. Cherry says, Jack keeps singing that song, I love it, I'm such a freak in the sheets. Cherry, I didn't ask. Okay, okay, Cherry, calm down. Right, where's my horse? Come here, valiant and noble steed. Oh shit, I never asked. Okay. I keep accidentally trying to chop my horse, don't judge me. Okay, the Adachi estate. Nobu, you are a good horse. I did not mean to stab you accidentally. That was just once or twice, Nobu. But we can put it behind us. Nobu's missing like three legs from all the times I've accidentally stabbed him. He's like, Jack, no, sorry, we can't. <gasps> bear? Is that a bear or is that an animal? Or what, what is it? Fuck. Get back. Get back. <laughs> Nobu. You'll fucking regret that, you skank. Oh, I keep trying to... What the fuck? What's going on? Dude, is this guy the final boss? Holy shit. That spear guy fucked me up. It's the rhythm. The rhythm of the spears are absolutely filth, dude. See if they just keep getting you and getting you and getting you. It never ends. You just die over and over again. It's so fucking annoying. Right, no, but listen. Yes, I know you just got injured again. As we were talking about you getting injured, but again, let's put it behind us, eh? No, but you haven't got any spare arrows, have you? I keep running out of arrows. Oh, is this a body? What happened here? Oh, arrows, 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 arrows. Ooh, good shit. Okay. Let's go! You and me, Cherry, ain't nothing but mammals. Let's do it how they do on the Disney Channel. Don't for, don't worry, I gotta get back. I gotta back to Cherry. I just started telling him about my sex life and he freaks out. Just say the word. You and me, SG and the naked butler. Wait, what's happening here? This isn't where I'm supposed to be. Let me, let me go. No, I don't want to fight. I'm trying to get to Masako. Get away from me, evil Mongols. This is the right way, right? Please tell me this is the right way. The Adachi Estate. 
fuck going through the door? Why use the door when you have big legs like me? Hello? Shit, I went in the wrong place. There's nothing in here for me. Let's see what else I can find. Oh my god. Moscow, you're naked. And alone. Whatever shall we do with the situation? Jack, please, I'm like 80 years old, leave me be. Masakao. Hello! Don't mind me, honey darling, I'm just gonna be farming your flowers. Hope you didn't need those. Interestingly for you, the trader up north trades flowers for armor dyes, but you don't know that, because you're a dumbass. So I'm just gonna steal all your stuff. Mmm, yeah. Give me this. Ooh, linen. Hope you won't be needing that. Anyways. I'm just gonna... Oh, what's happening in here? Who the fuck are you? Don't worry, I'm not actually gonna touch her. Calm down. What's wrong? You said Lady Masako wouldn't hurt me. What did she do? But she is so angry. Did she smack Not you? A word with her. Then we need to talk. Wait, what's happening here? So wait, did you? You said you weren't gonna hurt your servants. You rude person. Lady Masako, has the traitor's wife told you where he's hiding? Every time I ask, she starts crying and won't look at me. Can you blame her? I'm starting to. Maybe a young samurai will charm her. She's inside. <sighs> Wait here. I've just spoke to her. She says you're beating her senseless. Not about that life. Oh, the husband! Right. What's next? Who did I got a stab? Speak with Hina. Okay, Hina, it's me. I just left a minute ago, but I'm back already. I've spoke to her. She says she's not going to do it again, and she didn't mean to steal your Power Ranger collection. We haven't seen Hainsley in a while. Lady Masako plans to kill me. I can see it in her eyes. Oh, eye. Hina, stop it. I won't let her hurt you. She's not going to do that. But I need your help. I have told you all I know. Hachi delivers messages for your husband. <laughs> that means they have contact. It's only a matter of time until Masako finds them both. No, you have to save him. I can only do that if I get to him before she does. You know your husband. Where would he hide? In the wine cellar. He's dressed up as a woman. Let me think. This is important, Hina. Your husband murdered innocents. I'll be back. <laughs> she definitely knows. I said we just fucking cut her down now, chat. Hiya! Just kidding. Sorry, Hina, it was a mistake. Sometimes my back it passes out and I stab accidentally. Okay, she's told me fuck all. I see we kill her. I'm giving her time to think about where he might be. Let's pull her toes off. Let's take a walk. Hey Atari, what's up? Good morning, you. Atari, how was your sleep, friend? Welcome back. What's up? Walk with Masako. Masako. Masai. Masaki. You know Masak. Masak. Somehow. Sorry. So you Sorry, chat. I told her I would try to save. Just talking to Masak here. And I will. What will you tell her when you fail, Jim? Come on, Sack. You could not forgive his crime. Weak Sack, old Sack. I will not stand between you and Wrinkly Sack. Sack, my sheep. Everywhere I look here, I see only the night my family died. Yeah. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm Other family? You had a family before you married Lord Adachi. Could you go to them? My older brother died a few years ago. And my sister. The well, look at this, dude. The only thing I recognized was her gold sash. I didn't mean to make you relive that day. It never leaves my mind. There should be music. What? My grandchildren. Sit fine. How are you? Is this still recording for YouTube? Yes, sir. To celebrate the Probably watch your thought in, yeah. I will never hear them play again. Swipe left to play on your flute, a family heirloom and a gift from your late mother. She's like, if only there was music. Our man's just been fucking waiting the whole game on somebody to ask. She's like, I take that back, you are shit on the... I don't know what that would be, the oboe or something? You are shit on the flute. 
It's not fluent, but... Would you stop playing that? That sucked. Thank you. <laughs> Arigato. That wasn't so bad. Better than my... Hina. Get to the house! Oh! Shit! Our only lead, the witness! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Get my fucking... Oh! Stuck in a tree. Shit. Place the sub alert. Have you guys seen the uh, the meme of the, the fucking flute guy? I don't know what... There's a meme and it's like... You guys will find it on YouTube. It's like a video that's gone viral right now and it's like the meme flute. And it's like the... There's like a kung fu movie or something where the little kid's playing his, his instrument in front of all the samurai. And it sucks. He's playing the, the broken Titanic flute that we have as our fucking... Our sound alert. And then the guy like gets his knife and he fixes the flute and then he starts playing... <laughs> Starts playing this like rap music that's like super sick. <laughs> you guys will have to look it up. Just trust me. I can't play it. It's probably copyright. It's a fucking bop though. Oh. We need her killer now. Shit. Look around. They must have left a trail. So any fucking evidence? Search for the assassin's tracks. Um. Dude, I fucking- these are the bits that I get tilted at the most, where I get zero fucking- there we go. That's what I was looking for, thank you game. This way. I was gonna say, give me something man. I hate when it's like you go out into an empty space and it's like, go find the fucking assassin, find the- find the clues. I'm like, mate, I'm not really that bothered. Oh, he went this way. Oops. Why would someone kill Hina? To keep us from Bucket's Podge, hello? The traitors knew we had Bucket's Podge. Bucket's Podge, it's Bucket's Podge. Many people saw her with me. Coming in hot. Huh? You made sure they did. You used her as bait. I hoped her husband would take it. You should have told me your plan. So you could stop me? I promised to protect her. Where the fuck are we going, dude? Return to the assassin's tracks? Oh my god, dude, what a fucking shit mission. How are you doing, Buckets? Just watch the meme. Starts playing, uh, Persos- Persoset? I don't even know. I don't know what it's called. Oh, can I like? Oh, I can I can bow. What else can I do? Oh, I can put a leaf into the wind. That's the I don't know what that is. I can't play the flute right now. Um, track the assassin. Uh, I see footprints here. This way. This way, this way. Perquisite. Peaky Blinders. Only one set of tracks. Derek Whoever and the Dominoes. The is, they're alone. With Hina gone, we need them alive. <whistles> wow, I tell you, Osaka can fucking. Who will face me first? They have we can't let him die. Here we go. Time to fight, boys. I'm bleeding. Nice sunshine. I don't want to die like this. Dude, I keep like. I'm bleeding. Jesus Christ. Oh, 
Balls. Okay. I can't even see this fucking guy. She's just killed him, hasn't she? No, no, not you. That was really fucking weird. The M your Hachi. your NPC companions Sada are actually brother. very good in this game, like almost Why did too you good. Kill Hina? Tried to free her. They actually kill the enemies by themselves. She wouldn't leave. Wanted to save Sadao. She screamed for you. I I didn't mean to. Where's your brother? I failed him. I won't betray him. Rip. You can't die. Tell me where he is. He's gone. Hina died for nothing. She was murdered by traitors, just like my family. I can't give up the hunt. <laughs> that face, though. He carried messages for his brother. Maybe he had one. Okay. What did you find? Well, I'm, I'm getting there, mate. Calm down. Supply map stained in blood. A map belonged to Hachi, brother of Sadao. Sadao? The headman of the Kuta farmstead. Okay. A map of supply routes. He delivered food to survivor camps. Maybe Sadao is hiding at one. Go to the nearest camp and talk to the monk in charge. He might know what the map reveals. The monkey. You? I will bury Hina. Yeah, okay. I owe her that. She's gonna toss I'll her. I'll find you at the camp when I'm done. She's gonna tarp Hina. She's gonna tarp Hina's fucking corpse off the, off the cliff that we were fucking playing the flute at. I know it. She's like, yes, I'll go bury Hina. She's eating that corpse the fucking ten buck two guaranteed. Okay, I didn't realize we had fucking four points. Whoops, I haven't been spending those. I feel like a bit of a pleb. Charm of jewel destruction, offensive charm. What's that? Be nice to see what the charm did before you like actually like put it away in your bag. Uh, attacks have a five percent chance to deal double damage. Ooh. That's exciting. Five percent so low, but that would be so sick. What do I have on? Increased resolve games, increased knocking and reload speed is quite good. Bonus damage will at fifty percent health or less, I guess. Yeah, no, I like that one as well. These are all fine. We need more charm slots, I think. I'd like to have the five percent chance to do double damage, but that's really really low. Um Okay, so what did that unlock for us then? Am I supposed to go back here and, yeah, this will be the next part where we take off from that. Like when we do the next quest, if, uh, off our quest, we go back here. Um, let me spend some points. Um, what we got here? Hold triangle and tap triangle. That's... I never really use that, but... Increase damage against swordsman from all stone stances. Hold triangle and tap triangle three times. I think that's fine. Let's go for this. We're definitely going to get value out of that. Increased stagger damage against shieldmen from all war stances. I mean, that seems pretty good as well. Drown your throat with a flood of five rapid strikes. Just fucking destroy them, okay. Um, I think I'll take this as well. And then that one. So now our stances are just much better. I could have went for like, uh, you know, I could have put points into some of these maybe. Oh shit, charge on an enemy while knocking them backwards while sprinting and push circle to bash. Oh shit, I kind of want that. <laughs> uh, hold square to initiate a pose. Press square to release. What was that? Show me that, show me that again as a video. Alright, so it's like a hold button. Okay, cool. Strike from horseback. What's that? Mounted strike. Oh shit, dude, that's so sick. Oh yeah, we need to get all of these, man. Holy crap. I'm not very good at partying, honestly. I was going to try and make an effort at partying, but I'm honestly shit at it. Um, we're just kind of killed him for... Uh, I don't really care about that. Chain assassination would be good yeah, as well. For sure. Or extra streak. Save yourself from defeat when wounded. Down to initiate, cost three to resolve. But when are you going to likely... I mean, you would have to get absolutely smashed by something. 
to have three resolve left and to die. Like somebody would have to catch you with like such a disgusting combo. I guess the option's nice, I guess. To have it as a like a an opportunity, maybe. What's this? Let's see what this is. We've got Kut Kuta River Bridge as well, which is down there. That's iron. Or the cost of iron. Yeah, let's do this one. This is gonna give us leather. We're really close to this one as well. I think we're gonna start heading down south. Because I've been neglecting a lot of these. We could also go to the, the lake and I really did that. Okay, cool. So now I've got this. We can do stab, stab. And we should have extra damage against swordsmen. And then also, if we go into this stance, do this. Oh, that's so sick. Okay. Very good. Very, very good. Where's my horse? Come here, buddy. I'm not gonna stab you this time. It's okay. I've, I've figured. I've finally figured out that it's not R2 to get on the horse. Or sorry, it is. I finally found out it is actually R2 to get on the horse and not square. Hello, Nixon. Welcome back. How's things? No boring. F uh, hold on. These upgrades look great. No boring five percent increased damage or rubbish like that. You feel like you have to take. I mean. Oh, I know what you mean, Nixon. You're being... Okay. Funnily enough, Nixon, you're being deadly serious, right? And I know what you mean, like, when you look at some skill trees in some games, you go up the skill tree and it's like 5% damage, 5% damage, whatever, right? But we actually literally just got... I don't know, maybe you're... I don't know. How long have you been here, Nixon? We literally just got a charm called Charm of Dual Destruction Attacks have a 5% chance to deal double damage. I thought that's what you were maybe referencing. We actually literally just got this and we were looking at it. So when you said that, I was like, is Nick, is he taking a piss or...? <laughs> I couldn't tell if you're, if you're being serious. Um, Alright, let's go over here. No meme. Saved. Welcome back, Nick. How you been? Okay, we're gonna... Get off here, I think. I was going to say somebody might be having fun in here, but I don't think so. Whew. Sorry, mate. I hesitated to come in because I thought you guys were busy. Do you guys, do you guys have... That's what I want. I want a hat like that, dude. I need to get the... Uh, I need to get the, the fucking wooden hat so I can, like, fucking throw it off and then stab somebody with my sword. Alright, I'm ready. Hi. What happened to you? All good, just done a puzzle game at my sister's. They gave a puzzle game? Iron mark. What does that mean? We tried to take it from him, but like, he had too many guards. As in, you were working as a iron team to solve it? Be worth a lot to risk your lives for it. Or was it like a, mur a murder mystery or something? Travel the roads without fear of being stopped by Mongols. I could find a use for that. You, you're welcome to it. We had to flee, but the merchant cart is still up the road. I'll, I'll look for this iron mark. Stay here and tend to your wounds. The Gust of Iron. I was watching my friend play Control. I know you played that before. All the upgrades were just flat damage and not much new uh, fun new combat or anything. Yeah. Control. The Mongols will come looking for their men. So Control was actually quite a good little game that we played, but it ran like dog shit on the console. Um, I feel like if you want to get the yeah, controls a good little game, uh, really fun, and it makes you feel really empowered. And there's a montage part towards the end that is just epic, and we we reference it a lot because the song that plays is like heavy metal. Maybe not heavy metal, but it's like it's really sick. I it guess it gets you going. You feel like a badass, and uh, yeah, the only thing that held control back was the performance on the console. But honestly, it was probably made for PC. Yeah, I saw him play that bit. Yeah, it's really good. I actually, I've actually got that song added to my Spotify now because it's so fucking fire. That must be the merchant's cut. Take control. No sign of the merchant. What's happening here? So it says, I know it sounds a bit wacky, but I'd love to throw one of those murder mystery dinner parties where you get dressed up and everyone takes a part and try to solve a murder. I don't think that's wacky at all, Eshi. I think my family done that twice when I was younger, and uh, 
it was like an adults only thing that my auntie used to do. My auntie, one of my aunties was like quite fun, quite fun loving, kind of chill. And she done that twice. And it was, uh, none of, the, I was so sad because I was the oldest kid, but I like the kids weren't allowed to go. So all the couples came to my auntie's house and it was a murder mystery night and everybody kind of got to choose their character and dress up. And then when they got, when they got there, they all got given like a role. And you know, they were getting pissed and stuff. They were, they were getting drunk and having fun and stuff. That's why the kids weren't allowed to go. But um, yeah, they they went and did that a couple of times, and it actually looked really fun. It, it actually looked. I think that'd be pretty good, SJ. I don't think that'd be weird at all. Oh, I can see arrows over yeah, there. Yeah, Mark isn't here. Mongols. What the fuck? Fuck, I hate that so much. I hate getting interrupted. I wish as well when I was... I'm gonna have to fucking take these guys on. Let's try our new stance actually. Let's try our new move. Hold on, that was. Fuck. That's not what I was supposed to do. Fuck off. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? The arrows are relentless, dude. Come here. Hold still. Fucking. May be searching for the men I met. I better warn them. When did they run out of arrows, bro? Come on, man. I know it's a game, but come on, man. I'm just trying to learn my techniques. I'm just trying to learn my techniques. I've got fucking Robin Hood and his fucking eight pro archers fucking headshot me CSGO style, man. Return to the wounded men. Uh, back the way, I guess, right? Where's my horse? I got to practice one of my techniques. I never got to try. I wanted to. I wanted to practice this one. But I think against the archers, that's probably the worst enemies to be fighting against. The the war the war stance is a little bit shield enemy, so maybe that was dumb. But I'm drawing my bow back right, and it's like, oh, dude, I can't I can't quite explain the frustration. Like the enemies are, I see the enemies, so I draw my bow, I pull my arrow in, and then you get hit by an arrow, and then he drops his bow, and then you pull it back, you know the arrow, and then you pull it back, and then he gets hit again. It's like, bro, stop canceling me, guys. I guess we just gotta get good. Stop shitting me, you cunts! Huh. Yeah, I'm too late. Oh, Please, my lord, he's fucking dead. You have to save the merchant with the iron mark. He, the man in the iron, the brother. man in the iron mask. Your brother? I was stealing the mark to stop him from dishonoring his family. If he agreed to help the Mongols, he deserves to die. No, he's a good man. Please. I don't know if I would want to do it with strangers, SJ, but saved. maybe. But I'll try to find him. I'd love to make a murder Thank mystery. You. It seems uh, like D and D LARP. It just seems like D and D LARP type of thing. Left tracks. I think uh, I, I like. I enjoy. Like, I mean, a separate topic, I guess. But I enjoy reading uh, murder mysteries. There, head it that way. Again, I, I I say this all the time and reference it all the time, and you guys are probably fed up. But um, the girl with the dragon tattoo is a, like just even just the first book. You don't have to read the whole series, but the first book is like a really good, um, a really good murder mystery. I love the scene of that. It's very Persona Four esque, very very Persona Four esque in the sense of the scene, not so much the monsters and all that shit. But yeah, it was good. Um. There are hotel, there are hotel murder mystery weekends you can go, but they all get booked up uber quick. Yeah, I don't know if I'd want to like do it with other people, maybe, but I don't know if that's just me being a miserable bastard. Round to mine for a murder mystery barbecue, followed by clue and betrayal at House on the Hill. They turned off here. Oh, followed by clue. Was that clue as in Cluedo? Did you just call it? Did you mean clue as in like the Americanized version of Cluedo, Serenity? Betrayal at House on the Hill, I've heard of. I nearly bought that for my sister once. Oh, I, I need this. 
I need this. Die. I didn't have any fear. How many did I get? Six. Oh, perfect. I wasn't worried. Uh, where is the, uh, the tracks? I'm not a fan of this shit, by the way. I would honestly just prefer if they just put a line on the floor that I could follow. I, I can't really see the fucking footprints. <laughs> is this it? Is this... I've got two arrows. I think I could headshot that dude. Maybe I need to be doing more stealth stuff. Search for the merchant. What? How is that not a fucking headshot? What the fuck? Come on, bro. Where's my kunai? I didn't mean to do that. I was wanting to do my my new cool my cool new move. <laughs> Fuck. That was so bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you guys have to bear witness to that. Dude, I don't know how that first fucking shot of the guy wasn't a fucking headshot, dude. I thought I'm you know, normally in these kind of games, you do have to account for distance, right? And I really like that. I like that you have to account for distance because see when you aim really high and you pull off the perfect headshot, it feels great. But see, because I was up on a hill, I thought, you know, I'm shooting downwards. The arrow travels faster or whatever. I don't need to account for the distance, surely. Fuck me, dude. I gotta get better at that. I thought I was gonna have my shooting down to a T by now, but it's still off at times. It's gonna take some practice. Uh, wait, standoff? How the f oh, that guy's there? I didn't even see this guy. Why did he- he never even reacted to the fact that, uh... This guy never even reacted to the fact that I was fighting Nick next to his mates. My sister loves betrayal, though my brother-in-law isn't a fan. Oh, okay, okay. I've never tried it, guys. Is it actually good? Have you guys played it? I've heard you guys talking about it bunt before. But that's it. It seems pretty fun. You're going to be all right. Do we get to kill Jack in the library with a candlestick? No. Wrong. -o. You saved my life. Thank you. Bought her betrayal at Baldur's Gate for one. Save your thanks. Wait, You'll they actually do that, Nixon? Wait, you hold on. So there's betrayal at House on the Hill, but is there actually like themed ones as well? Could you get like betrayal at you betrayal at Baldur's Gate? Is that actually a thing? No way, dude. I had no idea, that's cool. So do they have like different ones like fucking Star Wars and Harry Potter and all that shit? <laughs> like, I know they do like fucking all the, all the different versions of like Monopoly and Cluedo and all that stuff. My family and our sisters, if I carried supplies for and them. now your brother is dead. He led the men who tried to steal your iron Yeah, I nearly bought it from my sister no. once. I thought my mum would hate it. Fool. I wonder the Mongols thought I betrayed them. I never had any iron mark. Besides, they are engraved with the bear's name. So no one else can use them. You're free to go. If I hear you're working for the Mongols again. They'd sooner kill me. And I cannot face my family after this. I have nothing. Oh, don't say that. Nothing. You don't mean that. What you don't You don't do even now? mean that. What do I live for? Oh, he looks very sad. The Ghost of Iron. I've been paying very, very little attention to these quest lines. I feel a bit, I feel a bit rude, you know. But I can upgrade my quiver now. Charm of advantage, offensive charm. Look at that layer. Don't mind me. I'm just taking the back route. The cat flap. 
All right, where's my where's my motherfucking horse? Come here, you. I say we walk back to the. Is this where I get the? Yeah, give me this. Oh no, that does, there's no trapper there though. Trapper's here. Hey. All right, let's uh, let's travel my horseback. Hmm. Played it once and it's really fun. Don't have a library. I could chuck a few books in the bathroom, I suppose. Serenity's idea of a good time. Pokemon Monopoly Kappa. Fucking hell, you guys are going in on Serenity and our love of Pokemon tonight, I tell you. Serenity says, oh fuck yes, I can't wait. Oh, never mind. Betrayal at Baldur's Gate is fully licensed D&D game. I don't think they do any more other than that one, though. Alright. It's probably one of these instances where the, you know, the fucking, the creator of Baldur's Gate is probably like a huge... House on the Hill fan, and then the House on the Hill fan's probably a huge Baldur's Gate fan, so they probably like tweeted at each other one time, be like, yo, listen, can we collab, please? I wouldn't be surprised if that's the kind of shit that goes down. I'm gonna get off and fight here. Come on, then, mate. I do that all the time. Oh, you actually have to aim it, that's why. Fuck off. Alright, okay. So I was I need to get this bear pill really quickly. Okay, that right. Okay, not bad. Uh come here, buddy. Did he just call a horse? Trade you for anything. No! I wouldn't trade you for anything. That's a lie. Jack goes as Velma. Why are you so scared? It was only a silent movie. Well, if the movie was silent, why can't you be? Fuck off! Sorry. Get off my lawn. Jeez, Velma, what's the big idea? Well, if the movie was silent, why can't you? Possible win? said to find the monk in charge of this camp. Ooh. We may be able to read the map I found on the trail. The monk. Mother. Oh no, we're not doing that yet. Lord Saka, do you need Shh, any Don't nice. talk to me, everybody. I'm here for this guy. This is the man of the hour. I hope I have what you're looking oh, for. Oh yes, you do, son. Arosa. Yes, I've wanted this my whole life. Ooh. I hope it helps. Thanks, man. I'm sorry. I need more for that. I need Twenty for these. Okay, what about flaming arrows? I could, I could carry six flaming arrows. Black powder bombs. Need that. Thank you. That is a big win, dude. I'll make All an offer. Are useful. Read the scroll. What the fuck? A family's escape. I'm not reading that. Sorry. No can do. Busy. I'm a busy man. Poor Hatsu. She'll likely starve soon. I request that he cosplays sexy about? Velma from the a second widow. live action movie. On the outskirts of Tutsu. She lives alone Sharing a book, acting kind of sus, so you got a kink. Food for you got a kink you've not told us about, eh? That was an oddly specific reference. Keep it in your pants, good genie. Right, I'm not talking to this douchebag right now. Absolutely fucking not. I say we, uh... Yeah... I think we fast travel to like. Well, if the movie was silent, why can't you be? Uh, I could go over there and do that. Place to call home, plane. Or we could just go here. Check out that. I wonder if that's like a hot spring or something. Probably not. Let's go down here. James Gunn directed them. Good old James Gunn. What's it like, eh? Good old Jimbo. Jimbo gun. Right. I'm gonna save my motherfucking game chat. I think we're going... Maybe down here to do the value of sake. And then eventually go down to Jin's journey. The broken blacksmith. I don't know what this is. The mythic tale. Seems like it's a kind of... Maybe like extra content that they added after or some shit. I'm not entirely sure. Let me uh, save the motherfucking game here.